Hello, chat. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Hi. Happy Friday. Happy Pizza Friday, chat. How are you doing today? A little late, a little late on the start. Appreciate you guys letting me uh, start up late. I had to get a bunch of errands done. Hope you guys are doing well. Whether you're uh, just starting your day out or you're wrapping it up, I hope it's going well. Uh, I believe resets in one minute. I don't remember when it changed. Lucas! Theo Bico, thank you for the 19 months. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. We're getting that sub count back up. We're getting it back up. It's Pizza Friday. There's slight desync with video and audio. Hmm. It's okay. We won't have camera on for that long. Tsunami's just about to happen. Got it. It looks fun on my end. Huh. Odd. Very minimum. I think it's just the awful programming. I need to find a new site. <clears throat> Uh, I was late today this morning because I was out picking up the the used uh, used car I bought. So that was nice. Exciting stuff going on there. Uh, I got a I got a 2012 Toyota Tacoma. I've wanted like an old truck, old. I've wanted an older truck, like a like a little pickup truck for uh, for a while now, just for you know. When uh, when McLovin and I want to go to the beach or uh, you know take bikes something go camping somewhere move something easily stuff like that. So uh, very happy about that. That was a fun a fun morning. Drove woke up early. Drove over there with McLovin. Inspected the car, checked it out, ended up buying it, drove it around a little bit. It was good. It was good. Yeah, the truck. That's what I was doing this morning. And now we're home. And it's time to get all that money back. <laughs> uh, today's plan for the day, I'm probably going to stick on role play for the majority of the day, if not the entire day. I'm not sure if the PD games thing are happening. Uh, I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see. Um, but yeah, that's that's what we're going to do today. Today's probably going to be a role play day. And uh, yeah. We're going to try and stick to rotating around characters pretty often. Between DeJasper and Roland and Bryce and Neil and whatever else. Uh, as well as Wild RP. I have to play Wild RP again. I haven't played Wild RP in like two weeks. And it makes me sad. The entire day? 24 hours? Pog. No, not the entire day. Repeat all that? I had you muted. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. And a three consecutive streams this month. A watch streak. Mullery, huge. Huge. I mean, you're not the only one, not on Wild, to be fair. Yeah, Wild comes and goes, I feel like, with no pixel people. Number nine. <clears throat> Top 10 all-time greatest. And I think tomorrow No Pixel Classic comes out. So that'll be fun. I think tomorrow we'll mess around on No Pixel Classic. And by mess around, I mean just 
role play over there. No, you know, I'm gonna take it take it seriously. Uh, probably make a new character over there, just so it's not you know completely. Uh, I don't know. I feel like that would be confusing if I bring Bryce over there or something. Too many similars, storylines, stuff like that. Still thinking about the Fall Guys loss, dude. I bet you tossed and turned, man. <laughs> It'll be okay. There'll be redemption. There'll be redemption soon. Bow, bow, bow. Hey, Silas, how you doing? Hey, what's going on? Well, you know. Pizza Friday. Pizza Friday. Big day today. Huge day. Huge uh, day. Uh-huh. Uh <laughs> doing all right there, Silas? You know what? No, I'm not all right. Because I was on a two-hour-long chase. Miserable. Okay. Did you catch me at the end? We got a couple of them on foot. Got them out of the car. And then meeting time. Hmm. That's pretty fun. <laughs> so you didn't catch them? Yeah, that's what I'm hearing too, Archer. Okay. Judging by the silence. What are you too, wearing, I Silas? I think that's also true. Yeah, what are you wearing, Silas? A lot of long pauses today from Silas. I think he's really upset about the uh Two-hour chase that was going on. Why are on you there. wearing black? Hey, Brandy. Hold on. Hey, Neil. Brandy Kras. Ignore hey, us. Neil. You don't know my last name, do you? McGreal. Well, there you go. There you go. Hey. How you doing, McGreal? No, I'm good. fine. I'm doing good. Hey, Big C. What's going Hello, on, guys? Silas is ignoring us. Silas. Are you ignoring a, us? He had a two-hour chase, and he didn't catch him, and so he's pretty upset about it. No. He's also wearing... You're wearing black, too. Yeah, but I'm high command of the BCSO. Mm. Yeah, what the hell are therefore, you doing? Therefore, I can wear, like, a BCSO and a PBSO outfit. Silas doesn't have any motivation as to why he'd wear that. So I got he's half a mind to strike us. him. I got half a mind to strike him. You should. He's also I mean, ignoring it us. Him. He looks good in black. Yeah, but that's not the point. The point is I'm supposed to micromanage everything about your lives. That's oh, true. And Jaden's not wearing a, uh, oh, a PD safe hat. It's not hat. like you ever did that, Columbo. What should I have for Why dinner would you then, start sir? now? What do you mean? This is a PD safe hat. It's just black. All right. Going on, Big C. All right, now welcome talk. to Woo Yeah Wednesdays, nice. guys. Woo Yeah. It's, it's Friday. Friday. No, it's Friday. It's Friday. It's Friday. Yeah. It's time for Where's the pizza? pizza? Oh, triple pizza. time, triple pizza. night. You okay? Jeez. Where's the pizza? It's not Wednesday. It's not Wednesday. It is no, not it's not Pizza Wednesday. Friday. It's oh, Friday. man. Friday. Uh oh. Where's the pizza? What do you mean, where's the pizza? Where's the pizza? Gotta be patient. Big C's uh, waiting for it. Outside. Starving. Oh, okay. Pizza yeah. comes to those who wait. Did we get a PD escort for the fucking pizza this time? We shouldn't. Oh, no. Last time somebody, yeah, people somebody that soiled them. it. Oh, what do you mean soiled it? They like robbed the the car that was driving up with all the pizzas. Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah, but that makes it sound like they like pooped on it or something. I'm going to say it. Yeah, I think exactly. it was an inside job. Hey. Behind the, the pizza problem last week? No, it was the Maldini's. I think Maldini's Randy, we need a PD was, escort for the an inside pizza. job. Why? What happened? Because they robbed it last time. They were oh, ro who robbed them? Yeah, I don't know. Someone Night's did. Watch. Is, uh, did anybody take a, a? Did we get a report on this? Why? Nope. What? How, how is this not like the number one priority? <laughs> I mean, didn't you go Wait, get did it the get pizza robbed again? Yeah, you were the one that this was yeah, last, Friday. last Friday. Was Friday. You were there, Big T. What? Yeah, you, I don't remember. You got a phone call. Like, You're the, the phone... one that told us it got robbed. Hey, you talked to like Bob Maldini or something. Didn't you get the statement? 
Fuck guy. Remember his blood pressure, okay? I don't know what you guys are right talking now. about. Okay, all right. Where's the pizza? That was gaslighting. Excellent. Hello. Yeah. Yeah. It's true. It's the truth, though. It's the truth. Clear definition of it right there. Hey, guys. Oh, throwback. Oh. Damn, Brittany. Okay. Throwback, Brittany. Throwback. Did you be having that? Yeah, so as I authorized him. For what? For a we're scene. Gonna, we're gonna have pizza. Right, well, Brittany? Race. I do have food. Okay, put that. Pizza. Put it away. We got food. to have them all out for a street race. Isn't that cool? Put it away. Mm. Okay. In an evidence locker. Or yeah, okay. your, your fucking locker. I don't know. Okay. Put it back where you found it. I mean, I've already got one in my evidence locker. Along with uh, some other stuff. Okay, we'll put it in your fucking personal lockers. Hey, check it out. It. I've got an EMP as well. What about who's giving the who's Ew. giving Brittany all this shit? RIP the EMP. Where do you find it? You just pull it out of thin air. Just here in these filing, like right here. Okay, can you put the guns back in the <laughs> filing cabinet? Yeah, I don't know which one to put this uh, scar. I'll you did not find a gun in the filing cabinet. Yeah, there was one just right here in the slot. Why would Brittany lie about that? That's absurd. The he filing stuff cabinet in weird places is for all files. the time. Yeah. This is Los Santos, after all. Mm. Just get rid of the guns, Brittany. Yeah, I'll get rid of the guns. I gotta clear out my car still, too. Oh, Jesus. Well, I don't oh. use it. Oh, holy. No. Sit. Hey guys. Hey Moose brother, how's it going? Hey. That's going still, good. Still waiting uh, on you to put that gun away. You want me to go to that right now? I mean, we're just yes. here in the office. Oh, oh, right now. How you doing, wife? Oh my god. X, 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 you'll be back before the well, pizza we haven't been divorced you. yet. No. Technically, we're kind of both married Is that not so right cleverly now. in the back <laughs> over there? Well, no, no. Hey, Charlotte. I couldn't tell. Is she talking no, to me? I do want to talk Sorry, to she said hi. Your, your name is Charlotte. Hi. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I usually go Claire, by Archer. Claire wanted to join the SDSO. Yep. Yeah, there's another Charlotte. Boston Claire. So I think we only take her in if she has a Boston accent. All right. I'm riding with her today. That was as far as the rules. Okay. Can you make sure she does? She has a Boston accent. She. What are you she doing? I don't think the PD games thing is happening today. I really don't. Right. I don't see Svensson. Boston? Which is a bummer because it, it was going to be fun. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Claire. Camaraderie right there. Yep. You do it all the way back there. I'm just the back here. Are you hiding in the back? Is that what you're doing? Not really. I'm walking here. Mm. I'm just sitting back here. Well, what's wrong? Well, standing. You're disturbing the mural. Oh. Charlie, where's the board? Do you just want to look at the mural the whole meeting, not the board? It did sound fun, didn't it? Damn right. Well, nothing's on the board right now. Nothing on the board. I'm just looking at the oh, mural right them. now. Yeah, I'll go over here. We got like 10 people in the unit yesterday. Hey, Brickney, tomorrow you're going to be Brick. What? Is, is, to, I, what kind of outfit are you thinking of wearing tomorrow? <clears throat> oh, probably the same one. I don't know. Oh, okay. It's been a good month what apart from the Ooh. creepy man. What up, Spencer? Oh, what is that? I just saw a ghost. You muscling into my turf? Who the fuck is that? It's me, Damien Tinkerman. It's Kirby. I was brought here. I brought him here. Wait, 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 wait. He's, he's a park ranger Why? Why? intern or whatever. Why is he? Ahoy, yeah, Muller! I was going to come to the MRPD Muller. meeting, and I was like, you know what? This one's better. Hey, how about you fuck hey, off to the goddamn me. MRPD Boy. meeting? Oh, you thank you, Is that what that is? Oh my god. Are you UPD? Are you bring us civilians here as UPD, really. Oh god, Doc and Dan's here now, too. He works for the Park Rangers. They hey, the undersheriff is talking to you back there. Yeah, sorry, I, I couldn't hear because everybody else was talking. You asked if I was UPD, I said, I said yes. Okay, then why are you bringing civilians into the meeting? Uh, he wanted to question. go to MRPD and wanted to share mixtapes, and I knew that this meeting would I'm be I'm just better. here to give mixtapes. Okay, sir, I, I'm going to order you to go to MRPD. I understood, sir. <laughs> Holy shit, that triple town, triple nine. I went, Stan. 
Bye, guys. Have fun. Carmine killed a man as number one in the charts. Oh, Here, Carmine, rap about murdering someone. He actually killed someone. He did it. Sounds like Nobody a good cares about cool. Carmine. I believe it. There's a the Charlotte. Ahoy, Charlotte. Charlotte, over Ahoy. here. Ahoy. Over here, over here. No, no. Charlotte, they want you in the squad squad. No, I don't. Oh, no. squad squad. Okay. No. no. Honored no. to be invited. No, you're Winston. fine. Winston. Fine. Why not? That was a Way to go, Charlotte. No. Way to go. Alrighty. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, that guy was out of line, but he's out of Come back here. The triple time. No, have fun. Uh, what? Oh, I stumble. Tell you who wouldn't have. Ooh. Big T would have been like, eh, I guess it's okay. It's not true. We'll put Kirby you up. You should talking Big T behind his back, Silas. I would never do. Well, I, I should talk it behind his I'm back and in front of his back. back so. Oh, and you also say, to, I mean, if you say it to his face, then it's fine. Yeah. I mean, I, I, of course. No, I, Charlotte, don't leave the no, squad squad. What's better than one Charlotte and squad squad is two Charlottes? So true. Stubble. Yeah, hey, Stubble. Yeah. Listen, I know I want sergeants up front, man. Why don't you come over here? Let's yes, have a sidebar real quick. Come here. See you guys. Hey guys. Oh, in the big league. Hi. Big league. Hey. Ahoy. Hello. Hi. Hi. What's Sorry, good? I just needed hey. attention. Hey. Is this radio either on? Hi. Yeah, I walked in and nobody said oh, anything. Nice. 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 You know, that radio in the corner doesn't work. Yeah. 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 This, 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 oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, Wait, hold on. Who did this? That's nice. You ask her to join the trio in the first place. Because we needed a third. Kirby really has the grippers out. Silas, I'm sorry for your loss. It wasn't me. We did that. How did you make that noise? Good morning again. Me and her don't get along too. Is it, you is it comfortable for you guys over there, Spencer and Bones? Yeah, I'm on bottom. Oh, gotcha. Kirby? I don't think that's true. I'm gonna kill your girlfriend. It's lagging to me. Oh, Bones, are you the bottom? What did she do? Yeah. Bones is the bottom. You got him. You got him. Bones is the bottom. Okay. Well, she's just, just sitting here. You just bones like being on the bottom. Something more appropriate. Just, I don't know. Uh, There's nothing wrong with being a, a, a sure power. Nothing bottom, wrong right? with it, but I knew you were one. Yeah. I, I was what do you mean by we're bottom. one? Pizza's almost here. Uh, I'll stand also, um, that's just hot. Uh, Silas, we're gonna have to talk after this. Okay. I got some very concerning uh, text Ooh. messages. That's it. Two cans. Two cans. Uh -oh. Bird. Okay. All right. What the hell did you say to Fontaine? What are you talking about? You, where did you communicate? This is my favorite part okay. of the meeting where they whisper at the front. Yeah, me too. What? Okay, we can take this. What are you guys all, the rest of us all talking about? I don't know. A uh, bunch of tornadoes about to, supposed to hit today. What do you guys think about yeah. that? Yeah. Just upstairs. Jesus Christ. Yeah. It's going to be a whirlwind. Well upstairs. Oh, now we know. Right. Oh, I fall asleep. We know what happens. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Want to learn about tornadoes, you can From the university, uh, choke No, oh, fuck you, Dan. That pizza's upstairs. Oh, in six days in court. Did you, did you want to go? You wanted to. You want to help grab it, Harvey? Uh, sure. Yeah, I'll go get it. Okay. Uh, Does someone want to go help him? Enthusiasm them? would be nice, Harvey. Can we get somebody to help him? Get rid of this hey, stupid help. photo. Oh, uh, thanks. Uh, we took down uh, Baker. Uh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! No, no, not da not Dan. Not Dan. Uh, Patty, not anyone but Dan. Patty, can you what go with him? Make sure he doesn't put, put anything in there. Oh God! Put the, put the Tuka back up. No, I'm putting, I'm putting Baker up. Put Baker Mayfield back up. I'm putting Baker back. How dare you change it? This is your fucking Instagram right. account. You just post random pictures of people. What is Don't that? put the toucan. Don't put the toucan. Leave Baker up. I swear Leave to God. Leave Baker up. Toucan. Toucan. That's Baker Mayfield. You just disappeared. I, I expected a far more right. handsome guy. Hey. Okay, well we're good. Whatever you want. Approved. Well, we're getting the pizza. We're gonna start the meeting. Welcome to. <laughs> pizza Friday, everybody. It's nice to see everybody yeah. here. Big turnout. Woo! Uh, Woo! We should have the pizza here soon. We're going to put it in the middle, per usual. Mm. Hopefully, we get so. some orange slices today. Mm. No? I'm hoping. Mm -hmm. Hopefully. Uh, anyway, what do we got today? Uh, anything big? Any big announcements today? Yeah, uh, go weekend. Um, weekend. Big tornadoes Weekend's in coming. the Midwest. Big Be tornadoes. careful, everybody. Look out. TGIF. Thursday's out. over. Thursday's oh, I over. Do have one, I do have one announcement. Let me see something. I wanted to ask everybody a uh, question. Uh, what kind of animal is this? 
A raccoon. Raccoon. Uh, uh, you're raccoon. still a human. <laughs> it's a raccoon. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. Bones, uh, just did you hear that? It's a raccoon. Bones thinks that's a fox. So what? Wait, what? Huh? Show it again. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, pizza's here. Oh, he's right. just messing uh, around. Uh, wait, wait, hold on. Wait a minute. Is it like a gray, gray fox? fox? Is it, it's a yeah. trash bag. Thank you. It's all on the pizza. Thank I like, leave the term gray fox furry. You can work yeah. the dog. All right. Yeah, it's sex <laughs> pervert. And Tails has a fox mask. Yeah. yeah. Thought, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah. We can do this. Me, Tails, me, me, me. put on your mask. That's a fox, Bones. That's a fox. Another one. On one of my first days in the SDSO, how ironic that it's posted today. I have an announcement. What are you talking about? What does that mean, Spencer? There you go. There I am in my nice hat. Next to Jaden. Yeah, stand oh, up, sticks. Are you the cowboy? No, okay. the red, the red hat on the windbreaker. Early oh. orange slices. Oh, oh yeah, there look are at that. Not. I remember that. Oh my god, that was great. Okay, I think. Uh, it was back when say? Silas was. Jaden. Uh, let's not forget. I just want to make a quick announcement. Let's not this forget. Is cool risk Monday game, is mix up Monday. Very exciting. Uh, Wait, is it uh -huh. mix up Monday or Wait, mix it up Monday? Mix it up Monday. Either one works, to be honest. I think mix it up sounds better. Mix it up does sound a little better, so it's very exciting. Uh, if you didn't know what that is, it's going to be, we're going to be drawing some names out of a hat, and uh, whoever you're paired with, you're going to ride with for a couple hours. All right. So, Ooh. you know, everybody's going to be able to have a little... Uh... I actually like that idea. Oh, these are can, some, can I make a request, dessert. Big T, real quick? What's that? Can we exclude Docket Dan from that list? Well, he's no. not in the department. Oh, he doesn't count. UPD doesn't. Oh, perfect. It doesn't work. Okay. Uh, the... Yes, Brittany. What if we get someone that we don't like and we don't want to write to them? Well, that's the the point is to try to. Okay. Uh, that that's kind of the point is to put you know any of the differences we have aside and see you know maybe you were wrong. What the fuck uh, okay. Yeah. Man, look at that All right. tiger. <laughs> okay. Uh, what do we got? Anything call else? Call me the tiger. <laughs> Go ahead, Stig. Uh, Jaden, Jaden has something. Nice to see you. Um, after the meeting, for those who are interested, there's going to be a presentation of a secret, secret undercover operations unit group yes, task force units. of some sort. Mm -hmm. Just whoever you want, if you're interested, stick, stick behind. It's not really secret, it's All right. Presentation. Very yeah. secretive. Fantastic. Sorry. Well, everybody, I have a big announcement. Oh. Okay. Wait, how big uh, is it? It's pretty big. Tails. Huge. Sorry. It's uh, it's hard to say this. I don't. I should have written something down, but it feels like the end of a chapter in my life. Um, the end of an era. <laughs> We're not doing the. But it's today. time to announce that um, my time with. Well. It's over. My time with Fingal Dan is over. We officially oh, broke up. Oh, no! Oh, 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 it oh, is shit. a big announcement. Wait, does that mean uh, you're both back on the market? Both back on the market. Yes, you deserve sir. better. Okay. Anyway, okay. Sir. Congratulations to your chapter. Uh, I'm sorry to hear that, Owen. I am too. Uh, uh, we're here for sorry. you. Uh, just so you know, everybody here is here for you uh, and support you uh, for Fingal's terrible. Uh, Terrible attitude. I, I, have uh, a I have a, I have a quick one as well. If you're, I well, you're gonna have to wait because I want to add on to that, and I want to support uh, support line. Owen in this in this time. Uh, yesterday, as you know, I want to thank everybody for the birthday wishes. It was very nice. However, there was one person uh, who I thought I was very close to who did not uh, send me an email or uh, me right now uh, who did not send me an email or say anything to me. Uh, yesterday for my birthday, and that was uh, actually Fingal Dan. Whoa! Oh my God! Uh, what a, I think you know so he's cool. He's uh, so I don't know what's going on with that guy. He's betrayed Owen, uh, and he's uh, he's he's hurt me too. So he tried to kill me. He tried to kill <laughs> Willie yesterday, apparently, or the other day, Friday, or was no, not Friday. Send him back Wednesday. to UPD. You said Wednesday. we're not even friends anymore. Yeah, I don't know Whoa. what's going on with him. So uh, we all stand uh, with Owen, I, I believe, right? Now, guys, hear me out. 
Okay. Uh, what if I we guess? got a can? Thank you for the six months. Okay, we're not done. I'm trying to get one of those anyway. No, 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 I need one. We're not doing the cannon thing again. We're not doing the cannon thing again. I like that idea. No, please don't encourage Can we get a cannon separately? You've been trying to promote people with a cannon. All right. Get a cannon. I just think it would be a big way to promote people. A cannon. May I real quick? We need a cannon. The best I can do is a flat Do we have the money for a cannon? Attention! Okay. Somebody in the SDSO has betrayed somebody else in the SDSO. Oh, no. No. Another big announcement. Two months ago, John Riggs invited me into the car and drove me to a beach house off of Great oh. Ocean Highway. Oh. 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 He let me into the house and then told me that he had bought it. I checked the records and it was indeed true. He then told me, do not tell Kaminsky. I want this place to be mine. Oh. Ooh. My God! <laughs> oh, well, didn't Kaminsky fuck his wife? Maybe he just didn't want him to fuck no, his house. No, Riggs too. fucked Kaminsky's wife. Oh, that was the other oh, way. Never mind. Oh, yeah. Anyway, I just want that announcement out there that uh, he had a house for a while and a uh, secret house. Did not want Kaminsky to find out. Oh, wait, yeah. wait, thank you. Why did it take house? you two oh, months to come oh, forward? My. Yeah, that's a. It must oh, have been a must have been a fall out recently, and he's now being. Uh, oh, they're both here. Better. Oh yeah. shit. Yeah, Damn, that makes it like way more gossipy. Right. I Sorry, love Riggs. Um, I had a vote in my new house, Let's and see. it was one to nothing. Yeah, well, you got no Sorry. proof, bitch. Fuck. Actually, Whoa. the property does have proof. Of All right, you guys can take it, outside, guys. Guys. Yeah. take it outside, guys. Take it outside. Uh, is there anything else we want to talk about today? I've got something. All pizza. Right. Uh, Just eat the pizza. What does that have to do? The What'd you say, Willie? You want to talk about pizza? Can I get some pizza? Yeah. yeah. I can talk about tomatoes right. if you guys want. No, thanks, Dan. This. That sounds depressing. Those things fucking blow. It's yeah. it's pretty dramatic. I want everybody to <laughs> pipe down and get ready for it to get heavy. It comes. It came to my attention this last Wu Yeah Wednesday that not everybody was saying Wu Yeah correctly. Mm. And now it's also been saying. Someone said Wu Yeah Friday today. Not whoa, one, but multiple whoa, people. Whoa, it's it's whoa, a whole thing. Whoa, come on. So, How am I supposed I'm to know? Gonna, I'm not going to point any names, yeah. but Teretti, it was me. It's been it quite a few people. I'm going to snitch. It was Teretti. It, it piped out. There's been quite a few people in the base what? that don't understand Wu Yao Wednesday. So uh, as sergeant oh, of the bay, I made the decision that the bay will not return to Wu Yao Wednesday next Wednesday. As oh. we're going to be somewhere else. We're going to be okay. at the bay for our new scheduled oh. PBSO meetings in the middle of the week. Tuesday, oh. Wednesday, Thursday. We're going to be holding our own things. We're going to be doing our own things. Maybe whoop de doo Wednesday. That, that's an idea. It's not. We're not. Going I love it. I love it. Let's do that. Oh. But, uh, it's, it's, brainstorming. Brainstorming. it's brainstorming. Lame. We're gonna try it on Tuesday. If it doesn't work, then fuck it. We'll uh, we'll keep trying on Wednesday. We're it's gonna try bumble. it until it works. But the whole point of this restructure is to do our own things, and uh, we're not doing it. We want to build PBSO as well as BCSO. So we're still gonna show up Pizza Friday. We're still gonna show up Mix Up Monday. But in the middle, we're doing our own thing. Oh yeah! Well, that's All right. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, another lap. I, I do have another lap. Another lap. lap. Wait, me? I have Backwards. an announcement. Yeah, you join him. Yeah. You suck. You can. What? You join him. <laughs> I have another big announcement. Oh. Shelby is no longer my protege. Oh, oh my God. Owen. Who's the new one? It's time to announce that I think Shelby's. It's time for her to move on, leave the nest, and become her own person. She doesn't need a mentor Believe anymore. You betrayed me like that. Oh my God. And I'll be Whoa. taking Bones back as my protege. Ooh. And this time, he's not going to fuck it up. <laughs> Dibs on Walter. Right? No, right we got, we, yeah, no, no, no. no. This no, time, he's going to no, lock it down. Okay. And if he gets in a race with the worst driver I can think of, Jimbo Sutton, he doesn't fuck it up. This. I have an announcement. Okay. I would like to announce. You better hurry up, all right? This, I would this like is... to announce. You got two minutes. That oh, yeah. I am also a mentor. So we are the first official. Uh, Human centipede? Try. Try. Try team. Ha, okay. Three. What is, why? Three. Uh, three. Why, do you, why do you announce? Why is this right? announcement? Because yeah. Walter. This is uh, it's my protege. You fumbled the announcement. You fumbled. Why do you need you to even announce this in the middle of the meeting? Human mentors. It's a waste of time. Hey, Bones. I thought you were going to help me with your hiving. What is this? Okay. Yes, Neil. 
Is the mentor project <laughs> off happening today, or no. is that okay. no? We're yeah. gonna we're gonna move it. Okay. Oof. Again, we're gonna do it though. We're gonna. I'm Let's very excited. It's time. happening. Guys. Look, we're yes. gonna move like it, but we shooter. will move it again on a third uh, time after. This. And Explain I will be what announcing it, it again. No, next week we will. I don't even know what it is. Really. On we'll, yeah. we'll 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 For talk about it on I Monday. Pizza. Yeah. Right. Uh. Okay. I think that's uh that's all well, we got today. I got, right? I got something small. Uh, yeah, you do. What, oh, you what the hell? Oh, 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 uh, apparently, Big Pussy is also a part of oh, him. He does. He does. He does. He does. does he still have a warrant? There they are. Yeah. That's them. He's got a few. Oh. The Cara Cara boys. Oh, those Ooh. bastards. Uh, not well, Luis is also part of it. I have an announcement. Not Daryl Dickinson. We got one. And we crushed it into a small cube. Yeah. 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 Destroyed. Yeah, that's Rose. Rose is a, Wait, Rose is a big help. you guys all that. get shot down by them after this picture? Yeah, no, that done. was that was the one before this. Apparently, yeah, we've got right. two of them off the street so far, and I know of a third, so there might be at least one more out there. Uh, I did get information, though, that uh, some renegades may be trying to uh, do a similar thing, so we need to be on the lookout for more Cara Cara Boys oh, type things. Cara Caras. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Also, uh, Tails, when we were running, told me that uh, the captain goes no. down with the ship and she goes down with the captain. So. No, okay, no. Oh, oh. They're all sick. Okay. Yeah. Wait, why? 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 All right, everybody, let's get out there so and catch these car cars, so okay? Ooh, it's not my fault. He's out of the ship. I need to talk to Silas, Riggs, and Kaminsky. Give me. I gotta talk to the to the big guy. All right, I'll be right back. These would be cooler if they. I don't know. Five minutes. You. I'm sorry to hear about what happened, man. Is this the sting op thing? We'll probably get back together yeah, yeah, tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, it's funny because Silas told me to make a presentation to, I, I uh, to, to try and run it on Monday. Right, so I'm serious. serious. You shut your mouth. Oh, you mean oh. the back to the front. Oh, That's right. Walk, you know? Can you, can you Silas, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I gotta go yell. This presentation Walter, will begin shortly in five minutes. Just FYI, apparently Kaminsky Riggs and Silas destroyed any type of chance of uh, Fontaine joining the SDSO. During these five minutes, we're going to discuss uh, politics. I'm, Fontaine? I'm, I'm going to yeah, show the battery chairs real quick. For five hey, minutes. Yeah. He's been yeah. building the party. Uh, not really hard. No, I'm, I'm going for the... I'm slowing Bibles look with uh, Christmas. I love it. So loud now. Husband. My wife. My wife. Hi. Hey, Gable. Hey, Neil. Moav. Well, that's a bummer. I was looking forward to the uh, the PD thing today, but such is life. Uh, it will got postponed. It'll happen. Surely it'll happen. I do feel like going out on duty for a little bit after this, so we will be uh, going on duty for a little bit. I don't know what I feel like doing today, though. I kind of, I, I definitely want to play a variety of characters today. It may be some variety in itself, but I'm unsure of what variety that will be. Soon, TM. Hopefully, soon, TM. Grab your actual pizza if you want. I'll give you guys the first slide so you guys understand what's about to happen. No, no, you're good. You're really cool. God, the he looked so cool the back then. Only the only one who it actually worked what, for. What is what does it stand for? What is it what does it stand for? This is a symbol that me and Ingvar can't work together. Alright, hold on, I gotta go collect uh cool. I'm willing to merge our two ideas together. I don't think that's how you spell merge. Hey hey hey, I'm from the land of Britannia. I know I know English. So am I. So Britannia? is double, yeah. Britannia. Yeah. So am I. Cockham. That's uh, Chester. Abner? Yeah, we gotta do wild RP okay, soon. Okay, we now have three minutes till we begin. Did you right. make this whole it's presentation double. in paint? What? 
Say, say the name of that sauce. Oh, hold on a minute. I did sauce? just get... let him let him cook. No, it was a very professional barbecue. Watch the sauce. How come we, how come there's no Shire in there? How come I've heard people? Yeah, say I don't like, know if I need to still sauce? make a. Uh, let me text Silas. Shire is the place. Stop. Yeah, like what? Yeah, well, it's because it's. I gotta go. Can you take more? Well, well, Shire is the Hobbit place. Do you still uh, want me to make be a presentation? Uh, no longer than. Four. Sli seven, eight slides. Thirty seconds a slide. It's about seven minutes. What? Seven. Did you not hear the maths I just did? Fuck you. I heard them. I yeah. He's the boat. So then you should have figured it out. Seven minutes. It's his nickname. He's the boat. Yeah, maybe. but it it begins. Actually, I got a better idea. So say Jeff Ford. Yeah, yeah what's up? To do it. Can you take notes on the presentation? I gotta go. <sighs> you can't rock the boat. Yeah, sure. No problem, senior deputy. Thank you. God damn it. <laughs> I mean, I can uh, I can add all the slides to our uh, the BCSO thing. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. I I took right. those notes. You need Thanks, to go toe-to-toe to -toe with, with Sticks' right. unit. Well, it begins in exactly two minutes. Two minutes. All right, okay. All right. Oh, I have a question, Brickney. You know, since Women's Month is almost up, are you... Uh... Still Brittany? It's always I'm still Brittany. Brittany. I'm kind of liking it, honestly. I kind of like being Brittany. Fair enough. Yeah. But next month is my month anyway, so... Double, double month. Who's your Wait, what's your month? Uh, next month's Autism Awareness Month. You're autistic? Yeah. How? What kind of fucking question is that, Jaden? What do you mean, how? Hey, really? there's loads diagnosis. different. There's so many different autisms. There's a there's a whole there's spectrum. one. This is a spectrum. Yeah, exactly. So uh, you know, I just what's I have a diagnosis. Thing? That's how. Yeah, but well, like, what's your autism thing? You know, what? A lot of people call <laughs> me dyslexic. I, 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 I'm, just, I'm pretty sure I'm dyslexic because people tell me I can't read or write. I don't know. Yeah, well, it might just be dumb. Yeah. No, dumb. no, 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 impossible. Possible. It is. It is. It is possible. Morning, Compa. Oh, uh, it's beginning in one minute. Hopefully. All right. Why are you clicking on your phone? Because I'm sending someone an up. Sending someone an update. that is happening in yeah. one minute. Those are loud really buttons. Long nails. It's really, really long nails. It's really just like long nails. against it. Long <laughs> acrylics. I I understand. I need to clean this mic. Oh my god, I can't do the acrylics. They're, they're so too long. difficult. Yeah. They're impossible then, to do anything with. They really are. You have to like get a little I thingy, like a clip, to take your card out of the gas station. Ugh, it's a hassle. Yeah, screw that. I can only do like, I can do like small acrylics, but definitely not the long ones. It's um, fine for now. I'll clean the rest later. Thanks to the water in our pipes that has gone bad, we have to wait another two minutes. What? If we don't start don't in two minutes, don't I'm drink staging the damn a walkout. Water. Don't, don't! Damn it! You're gonna it's miss out. It's been almost 15 minutes, and after 15 minutes, we'll really allowed no, to leave. No, we will walk out. Yeah. You know it. You, you guys don't understand. Is the first that joined the, my department? There's a big bonus. Okay. Uh, by the way, guys. Uh, on Monday, I'm doing a presentation for my own Sting Op uh, department. If yeah. you guys want to join that, so I just put. Yeah, yeah, I'm interested. Oh yeah. Wait, how yeah, many of these things are we gonna have? Also Does Ingvar also a, have a weird, a weird op called SKPD? Best Dude, acting kings ever. That was really super cool PD a baker cool unit. Decay, but it's got to be a Baker picture, Mayfield reference. It was like a bloody knife behind it. <sighs> Serial killer. Oh, is that what it is? Oh, damn. Yeah. Yeah. It was weird. Apparently, there's serial killers in the PD. Mm. And they have a task force for themselves. You got a serial killer cousin? You got a serial killer cousin, don't you? I do not, actually. Yeah, not uh, just so I'm aware that... They may or may not be dead Neil? already for past... Um, okay, gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> but definitely not anymore. Uh -huh. Um, Have you got a good idea for your department? Silas told me to come up with a department, so I'm going to come up with it, and I'm not going to reveal any of my secrets until Monday when I present it. Damn, that's, that's smart. trade secrets. You're just going to steal really them. Smart. So smart. Keep your well, good thing I'll get chairs. my ideas out there first. Now I we know. We have to sign me. a um, agreement, like the compete agreement thing. Oh, okay. non-disclosure. Yeah. Well, well, like, like, the no, non-compete. Non yeah. Otherwise, I will. The non-compete one. Well, hold on. Silas said there's only one department that's surviving all of these things. So well, I guess we'll see. How huh? Neil, how long is the acronym yeah. for yours? Uh, it's probably going to be Baker. I just got to figure out how to fit something in there. The fuck? 
Oh, Mine is so much better than that. Bureau? Ooh. Maybe like BKR, Baker, Babriata. I'll brainstorm. I'll figure it out. He just told me yesterday I should come up with one on Monday. So, you know, stay tuned. Oh, I'll beat it. Bureau I'll beat it. Advanced. Punk. It's been two minutes. And he's come up with a KR. No, no, it hasn't. It hasn't. It hasn't I'm looking out. at my phone. What the hell do the pipes have to do with this anyway? Uh, they ruined the projection. What are we actually waiting for, Jaden? Yeah. Silas, Silas said he'll be here in two minutes. Okay, he's not we'll, being here. He'll we'll be here for like an that. hour. Yeah, you can just say that, man. Why don't oh, you just say yeah. we're... You know that he's going to be in that office for the next two hours. Should I storm in that office and drag him down? Yes. Because then you'll get, you'll get suspended again. Oh, fuck, you're right. I can't do that. That'll be three days in a row. Okay, the, the real leader of some group like this would send someone up there. You would need to... No, 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 because the, the group okay. hasn't formed yet. The group hasn't formed. Mm. Bureau of Advanced Knowledge and Research. Mm. Baker. Bakar. Bureau Against Ketamine Restrictions. Ooh. Legalize oh, it. Okay, well, I'm going to have to do some research on that one. Nah. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Not hard uh, to now. She you needs need strippers. For research purposes, I know where you can it's find strippers. it. Yeah, maybe we can uh get her for, for prostitution. Prostitution or something. Oh, Don Hart. Yeah, she's a real piece of shit. She's she involved is. in the He hung up on me. Thing. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna storm what? up there and grab her. Gold pirates. What? Big up sticks. Pirates? Hello. The gold I'm, I'm pirates? storming up there. You're, gonna, you're doing a I'm pirate thing without there. me and Moose. Me I'm storming the capital. No, it's a gold pirate investigation. There's people okay, who are impersonating and pirates and two, I'm murdering them. Probably. And the two pirate cops are not involved? Yeah, well, you guys yet. weren't pirates when I started this investigation. <laughs> what? what? do you mean are you I wasn't a pirates Moose when you were a pirate for hundreds, hundreds of years, years ago? Uh, uh, I was born in 1683. I've been in this city for five years. I don't know. And I was born in 1980 and I've been in the city for over... A year probably, and I'm the other. I'm know. the original pirate cop. Come on, I got that Brian Giles jersey that I wear all the time. You know what? I don't even want to be a part of this. Your idea time. of pirates is probably somebody on a cargo freight with a with an AK-47. The hell are you doing? What, what is his presentation? What is his presentation? Sticks. Sticks. This is not my, you would know. Not my was standing slide. in front of you. What is this? What is this presentation? Uh, we're gonna we're gonna start without silence because I don't know what you're doing. Okay, now mm. meaning for I have success stories, as you may know. I am seven for seven, he is one for one. Silas told us both to come up with something, and apparently Neil is real. But anyway, I am willing to merge my idea with Ingvar, and ideally he was meant to be here, but he's not. Vartown? I'm willing to merge. Did you bother asking him to show up today? He said he would be here. He said he would be here. Okay, that's the first slide. Remember that. Willing to merge. What? And now for the next slide. The big reveal. A Jaden Bain presents the planting agency on tour. Otherwise known as the PGA tour. <laughs> Well, that's on. right. Whoa. Can we do that's that? That's good. right. Hold on a second. <laughs> that's very good, Jaden. Yeah. Yep. The planting, you know, the whole plant thing is going to be merging with my double O agency. And I, I had to figure out something and I came up with the PGA tour. So the plants will be going on tour when they have to put some seeds in the dirt or some shit like that. I, I got to come up with some good line. But that is going to be what the department's called. The, you know, that. That. To that. Okay. Next slide. One second. One second. Why are you seeing next? Slide? You're the one controlling this slide. One sec, one sec. <laughs> You've got the clicker. And you're wondering why I should be a Coley. It's because I'm seven for seven. Okay? Never has a criminal escaped my grasp. Even when we we're about to lose, or we still won. Uh, shout out to the people that went to the Humane Lab. You mean that where the guy that we wanted to arrest got away, but we got the person that helped him? That's right, we got one of the warrants, so uh, still seven for seven. Okay. <laughs> that's all right, that's what we do, it doesn't matter. We always get an arrest. Okay, next slide. 
Right now you're wondering how are you gonna I don't know rank up in this uh, it, sub sub. You, you said next slide and you didn't you didn't change the slide. Next slide. Oh, yeah. well, that's the same slide. Look, there we go. This is how the ranking system is gonna work within the department. You start off as a seed. You wow. skip this thing. Okay, you skip this. Oh no! Good question. And then you become a leaf, and then you go to a plant. <laughs> yeah, I saw arms raised more there. You just ignored her question. Yeah, I kind of had the same question. Ah, see, that's this the next... One? That's pretty fucked up. That's the next slide. I thought this through. What happens that's... to the bean? Oh. It's gone by the time you get to plant. Where's the bean? Just trust me. The bean has a place, okay? But on this on this ranking system... Can you tell me it's... you can't find the bean? No. Nah. No, it's right oh, there. I just, don't, I just don't want it. I don't want it a part of this ranking system. It's seed, leaf, plant. However, you guys are all wondering about the bean. I'll show you. Are you going to show us where the bean is? The... Yeah, oh my god. Show us the bean. I'm here. I'll just show us yes, where the bean is. I... Oh, 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 Silas, you saw all this part. Let me show you the, the new slides I created. Are you yes. wondering where the bean is? I'll Where's the bean? Is this going to be safe for work? I don't know. Should, is... Don't the bean away. is here. Okay, okay. okay. Oh, you added a bean oh. slide. Yes, yes. Now you're wondering, how does one become a bean and, you know, not become a leaf or a plant? You have to be unique in your own way. Do so much, the only place for you is a bean rank. Very, a very detailed explanation, I'm sure you understand. I want to be a bean. That seems like a very nice way of saying you are uh, incompetent in your shit. How come uh, you didn't get rid of the box that makes the font bigger and smaller? What? Can you shut up? Why, why does the bean have yeah, a red X on it? Yeah. Did you screenshot the a a slide? A bean? It's like... What? No, this is the beans. It's a bean. I'm it's losing the metaphor a... sticks. Can, the bean and the seed should be the same one. Little... You're, you're losing me here. The bean and the seed are the same. Oh, wait. Thing. Wait, so what's the difference? I'm not sitting for this again. I'm out of here. No, 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 no. It's revised. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. If, if, you know, I see that your talents are that of not a leaf or a plant, you will be joining the bean rank, and there is where you will stay. Wow. Okay? Yes. This is a separate ranking system. Okay, that's all. On to the next slot. The clicker is really broken. Okay, one sec. Ah, now you're wondering how does one go from a seed to a leaf, okay? Very, very simple. You need to participate in five sting ops, successful or unsuccessful. You have to help. What? That's how you spell it? That's how you spell it. I'm English. That's how you spell it. Hey, did he correct how he spelled merge or no? No, no. He's still no. with a J. Still with a J. That's how you spell it. You've got to help plan at least two ideas. It doesn't have to be anything crazy, just little inputs here and there. And then. Once you've done those two, you have to pass the board of evaluators, which is three people, and there's a ten thousand dollar buy-in. What the fuck? He's on the board. What the heck? What the, huh. wait, if you want to go, if you want to get up there in the world, you got to buy in. All right, that's how it works. BTF, you don't have to buy in. Are you calling BTF a dog shit department? Well, guess what? There's not, there's not, make you know, you can't really climb that. You sort of just there. Really? It was shark rangers. We're putting money in the into BTF. Our... What do you mean? You absolutely can climb in the BTF. You just haven't done it. Is this a pyramid scheme? Pyramid scheme. No, no, Neil, on. don't. No, no. On to the next slide, and you can see how you rank up, Sean. If this is a pyramid slide? No, 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 no. This is the next slide of um, how to become Could it a be leaf. an inverted funnel, actually, Sonia. Leaf Stick to plant. Oh. This is the next ranking structure. You got to participate in ten sting ops, and the only, uh, only <laughs> successful be counted. Again. You can't have any fails for this one. I mean, you can have like five failures, but you need to stack up at least ten. Successful one. You need to lead two sting ops, all right? You can't become a plant unless you can lead. And then there's obviously going to be a board of evaluators, which is, um, that four is meant to be a three, but I couldn't bother to change it. And then there's a $20,000 buy-in. Wait, so, this, no, this is like, this is, <laughs> this is a buying rank. This well, is you know, a pyramid scheme. I will only ever give you the chance marketing. to buy in. I'm only going to give you a chance to a buy-in if you only, if you pass the other three. You're not, you're not going to just buy in and Yeah, skip. so this so we, yeah, we work. Surely yeah, the I see work a hand. would... I see a hand up there. Yeah, I got a, I got a quick question. So in your right. entire storied police career, <laughs> you don't even qualify for your own top rank? No, I'm only on seven for seven, so I'm three away from becoming a plant. But that being okay. said, um, going forward, whenever this uh, kicks off, everyone's going to be on scratch. 
A okay, lot of possibilities once you're a plant, though, right? Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of things to do as a plant. Wow. A lot of things. Like okay. what? I have a question. Hey, go ahead. Uh, if I am, let's say, leaf, uh, and I'm able to get a bunch of beans to buy in, am I rewarded for this? Oh, break! What a good question. On to the next slot. You're not gonna answer my question. You're just gonna continue with the. No, okay, okay. There's there's a there's a whole slide dedicated to your question. Ignored. Oh, <laughs> yeah. It just it just happens to be a whole slide for that question. So I'll. Um... But yes, the question will be answered shortly. Who's? This is insane. Hey, I got a I got a question. Uh, uh, go ahead. Uh, so, uh, t- leaf to plant is a two, uh, twenty thousand uh, dollar buy in. If I just really give you like a hundred thousand dollars, can I skip straight to being a plant? No, in my department there is no skipping. You have oh. to work for it. Integrity. Okay. Why? Why is the money involved then? This shows commitment. All right, you're not going to just ditch the, the department if you put twenty grand in, are you? The work for it is the commitment, not the no, money. No, 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 that's not enough. You, you always put money down. Do you Guys, get your money back money. if you uh, leave the department? No. Fuck. Where you spend, spend money to make money? money. I, I, spend I, money to make money, guys. That money's going to be invested in all. Yeah, that's where the money's going. That's yeah, what the money's budget the is game. for. From that's the man. No, 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 no. It won't self-sustain. I, I see what's going on here. This yeah, is money, money's the name of the game. Uh, <laughs> there is the next slide, which is more for the uh, the command members and the high Thank command members. This is the department request that to to keep going. Ten million dollars. A Batmobile. A waterfall for the Batman. None of these have spelling mistakes. Are you sure this is your slide? Nah, the, this is my slide. Number five is... does separate ranks. Oh, yeah. no, that's right. Yeah, Isn't it? That's, no, it's separate. 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 Oh, that looks. That looks yeah, great. Gotta... The thing is, look, I've explained the whole Batmobile thing. I, I don't want to explain it because I don't want to give away my uh, next UCO. But I really need a Batmobile. To who? We're all officers here. Which Fuck Batmobile? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna explain that. I'll explain for? the UCO. All right, which I'm one? gonna be Batman. Which, which movie? What the one with the, the Batmobile? Cartoon. Yeah, but do you want like the, the Arkham Knight one? Movies. Do you want the the, the, the Adam the, West one? Like, yeah, the which, 90s which cartoon. Yeah. yeah. You got Bale. that one that it splits. It's it splits off the things so it can fit through alleyways. You know, and it becomes a motorcycle. I want the one that can. Yeah. Uh, that one's really cool. I like that one. A lot. Yeah. I want one that can ramp off building. I used okay. to have a toy of that one actually. That Tell me you've never seen a Batman without telling me you've never seen a Batman. What about the Batman one, which is just a muscle car with a bunch of lights on it? No, I don't want that. Something's no, I want, I want the one with rockets. All right, but the thing is, if you guys are very questioning the, the whole Batman will be, I'm going to explain it. The UC op is very simple. I, the Batman, will uh, phone Where are call. Are you the Batman? Because I want the Batman and I want to drive it. Who can I, I be? Can I be a co lead? Oh, Batman doesn't explain. have a co lead. This let is me a explain. sting up. Are you calling Ingvar Robin? No, no, oh my, just, just let me say it, and then you guys can input. What character do we get to be? Which character? You will figure it out in a bit. List us off one can by I be one, the please. Penguin? No. Okay, Ivy? you know what? None of you guys are invited. That's you can just choice. listen. I'd probably Attach- be Poison Ivy, though. Listen, I am the Batman, and I will call up Robin, who is the uh, criminal that we are trying to arrest. He's going to be my wingman. Can arrest your wingman? Yes, eventually. <laughs> I don't like him. Oh, no, warrant- I get it. He's got a yeah. warrant for his arrest. Yeah, they did this arc. Yeah, and then with the fake Robin, that I'm yeah. gonna pick him up in the Batmobile. Someone's gonna be at Arkham Asylum. There's gonna be a Joker, the Riddler, and all those other fuckers. And we're gonna show up, and eventually the Batman's gonna die. It's the first of its kind. All right, the Joker's gonna kill the Batman. What? Okay. Batman and... has died before. I mean, <laughs> Gotham Knights is, is entirely a game based on the Batman dying. Th- no, no. In that this one, the... no. In this one, the Batman dies the first time. Okay, I die as the Batman. I resurrect as a zombie. And that's when we put on our thing, and we arrest the fucking... What the fuck? <laughs> How is that the... Well, you know what? Did you go over the 7 for 7 slide already? No, not yet. One sec. Can, Actually, can I did you have gone over the 7 for 7, seven slide? I have gone over He's the got credentials, slide. folks. It was the second one. It was the 7 for yeah, 7 slide. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You guys, look, you guys are all questioning me, but guaranteed that fucker shows up, and guaranteed we get at least a foot bail. Okay, yeah, but how much is a Batmobile going to cost you that you that- need... A couple of mil. Guys, look, there's Pirate Batman. Oh, oh I, can, I can be Batman. Batman. That's actually true. Oh, okay. All right, all right well, done, oh, well done, Thatch. Oh, well done, Thatch. You Thank have you. a first invite into the bean rank. Well done. All right. All right. I'll, nice. On to the next slide. I'm a bean. bean. Hey. Oh, Wait, hold on. You have to pay on. for it. Yeah. Pay for no, it. no, hold on. Bean didn't have a buy-in. Bean is the he rank. He doesn't have a buy-in. But bean he is the rank where you stick me and then I never move up. 
Yeah. That's not a, why me? A out of all, um, split. Phase well, you sounded excited at first. Wait, this is 80 20 split? How is that 80 20? That, that, that looks good to me. You guys can clearly see that it's even, even, right? It's yeah, a big 20. Text, it's a big 20. Text, well, it doesn't say. Well, Max, it's a big 20%. And you right. say it's a so massive twenty percent. You say phase up. Time. Does this mean we're gonna get yeah, some like weird crypto there? shit going on with what? us too? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. It's low. It's a clear even split between me and England. <laughs> Wait, why do you? To find, what what to does the ownership slide. percentage even mean? Uh, don't worry about the percentages. That's for me, Silas, and Ingvar. Right. This is the final slide where I discuss. This is how uh, the department is going to structure and how people oh, will uh, earn money. Here we go. There's literally a pyramid, pyramid there. Scheme. Pyramid. Why did you have the pyramid? It's picture? a pyramid scheme. It's how the pyramids are. This is just a, this is just a trip for uh, when I went to Egypt the other day. Look, pyramid the department scheme. is very simple how it works. It's me, you know, me and Ingvar in the department at the top, right? Then it's a plant, leaf, seed, and the bean is lower than the seed. All right, you actually lose position if you become a bean. Ooh, I'm sorry, okay. Oof, sorry, so the way it works is very simple. Let's just say um, Silas was a plant, and he found someone who became a seed, and he got him to me, and we said, "Okay, you're a seed." And he and that person gets promoted to the leaf. All right, that's a 10k buy-in. Silas would get 20 percent, and the department will get 80 percent. And if that person then became a plant, Silas would get 30 percent of that 20k. You see? You show it. You show it again. Yeah. Oh fuck me. Is it is ten forty five Bravo new? I've what is that? Yeah. No, that, that that's been around for a while. It's just very it's rare, very very rare. Very rare. Well, as you can see, there there is uh, benefits as to where uh, people who find seeds and uh, help them to rank up. You will uh, you'll get a cut on They'll their help bite. them grow. Yeah. yeah. But obviously, uh, the, a huge chunk of it will go to uh, the top of the uh, of course chain. Yeah. Question, what Fertilizer. happens if we find somebody that uh, by chance becomes a bean? Are we penalized for that? I I thought about doing, uh, you have to pay out 5k to the department. I thought about <laughs> it, but I'm sure right now. I might do it so it stops you bringing me everyone, you know, like, if you bring me Carmine and he just gets becomes a bean, I'm like, I'm going to punish you. promoted, well, demoted Moosebeard to a bean. Does that mean that you have to give a... Your own self, five thousand dollars. Oh, uh, if I implement the rule, I will be uh, taking five k out of my pocket and putting it to the department. Yes. Wow. Oh my That's god! Amazing. I have evidence of corruption. What? 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 what are you talking about? Oh. Huh? That's not even at all. Oh my god! That's not even close to even. <laughs> What? Oh my god. Oh, I, I, I use mathematics to figure out that, oh my so... Oh gosh! That's not even close. Well, did you measure from top to bottom, like the size of the... Bean boys. The circle as well? The diameter, but you know... Yeah, to make sure that it's like... Alright, look, look, it's a little off. It's like an extra 2% to me, you know? Oh, oh well, that's so... Does Ingvar know about this 2%? Uh, he has a bit... He wasn't need to even see the slide. Ingvar has, has no idea about any of this. Jesus Christ. What's your problem, Jaden? You're well, sick, man. You're fucking sick. Just, uh, just a reminder that on Monday I'll be doing my own Sting Op presentation. You know, super excited to present to you guys. All oh, right. Well, yeah. The Academy right, legalization well, we'll... thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was the end of the... Uh, this isn't the end of the presentation, but... Uh, yeah, it's like it is. Hmm. Right, well, that's the end of the presentation. As you know, okay. Jaden Bain presents the planting agency on tour, otherwise known as the PGA tour, which is going to be the department name. Um, and any questions? Reverse funnel scheme. When's the first up? Well, I want, you know, Silas and Big T to sign off. On this the, is uh, not official yet. Yeah, we're going to have to hear Neil's one and Ingvar's one, and then we'll know which one is which, and then we'll Neil's going to present his ideas for his thing up. Ingvar is going to present his ideas for his thing up, and then we're going to say uh, command will determine who's got the better ideas, who's going to lead the unit, stuff like that. Yeah, and then once that's done, the ops can begin. Bureau of Advanced Killing, oh, Eradicating, and it Removal. It's a sting hop one, not a we'll see. assassination group. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, I, I, I guess this I would have really worked if he saw this. You in the back. I, it would have really worked if I could have showed him mine. Well, they're still, listen.
you know, obviously Big C and Big T needed to, to, to see these presentations. They decided oh, not yes. to because apparently they didn't know this was going to happen and they'd rather talk to Dan about nothing. He's in the UPD. Uh, How important is he? So we should probably organize a day where uh, you, Neil, and Ingvar are going to be around and then you're gonna all three of you will present to the to command plus and then we'll we'll discuss what we want to do with okay. it. Okay. All right, that works for me. All right. Just, just so you know, keep you know, me at the top of the list because, you know, PGA Tour. PGA Tour. PGA Tour. He's here and Neil, you're getting fucked. I don't even know who you no, are. Good words. You're six. getting fucked. All right, sorry. According Jesus. to the ranking structure right, right now, I think I'm the third highest <laughs> member of the PGA Tour. <laughs> what the fuck happened? It's too funny, man. Not yet. You getting out there, Neil? Yeah, you want to ride together? Yup. Yes. The, yep. film the old band movie. back together. Oh, man. It's a great movie. You should watch it. I'm out front. I'm making a game about it. Bureau of Advanced Knowledge. Evan. Ooh, that's a good one. Chat, post your, uh, your ideas. Post your ideas in. Discord. All right. It's been a while, huh? Yeah, for real. Like that stain song. It's been a while. And I could say I was addicted. Is that Mr. Pepper's Day? I think it is. I think it's a Mr. Pepper's Day, right? Yep. The uh, cam's off, though, because he started to burrow even more. Uh, you're gonna want to, when you get the chance, take a look earlier in the day and check out, uh, his outfit. Okay. You ever heard of a little character named Leon Kennedy from Resident <gasps> Evil 4? No. Yeah, he was doing a little cosplay earlier. No. Let me see. Yep. Leon! Leon! Are you checking right now? Yeah. Give me a sec. Okay. Where is it? Was it, was it, was it like a... Hmm. Yeah, I, I can it. find it for you. I'll find it for you. This is not in the beginning. Whatever, he'll find it for me. He'll send it to me. It's during all that boring helicopter stuff, can you say? Oh, okay. EMS explorers keep tripping me out. Yeah. Little picture, little picture for you. <laughs> Look at him. Yeah, a little Look Leon at him, Kennedy. Huh? Ready to do a freaking roundhouse kick. Oh man. Yeah. That's great. That's great. Who's who's is Ashley, huh? Are you Ashley? No. That'd be kind of funny. But like I like raised him. Yeah, okay, yeah. That kind of, might be a little weird, a little problematic. Yeah. Just a bit, just a bit. Well, okay, uh, Brittany, what's, uh, what else is new? What's going on with you? Mm. Uh, am 
my best friend Copper and one of my top five best friends, Jenny, were in the ICU for the past couple days. I heard. I, I think heard. Jenny's still in there. Damn. Copper's out, but she didn't pick up phone calls earlier, and then uh, she called me Brick, so she's not even referring to me as Brickney, so wow. I think that she might hate me now. Especially because last week she kind of, like, hated me. People change, man. People change. Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, where am I on this ranking? Yeah, you're top five as well. Oh, wow. It's you and Copper and Jenny and... It used to be Moose Beard until he became, like, such a crazy pervert over the past, like, month. Yeah. Yeah. Uh... Probably Rose. Rose is a good one. Yeah. I haven't seen her as much lately, though, because she's, like, only shift two now. Yeah, she comes around a little bit later. Yeah. Top five, though. Wow, I didn't even go camping with you, and I'm still top five. That's good. That's amazing. Yeah, yeah, you almost... You almost lost top five with the whole, you know, not inviting me to camp, but, you know. I got a good 30 hours of camping in. And then, interesting, hours, what, you, what, what took you only seven hours, we did in 30. Wow. Yeah. Well, I need to, re I need to do more because more shit's come out since then. Yep, yep, yep. There's like an actual ending now, kind of, right here. Yeah, we got in the cube. Hold on, I need to... Well, yeah, I got in the cube, too, but apparently there's, like, a boss fight now or something. Oh, yeah, the guy that you can burn with the cross. Spoilers. No, it's... I mean, it's just... Now I know how to fight him. Eh, no, it doesn't actually really make a difference. Mm. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I thought it would do oh, a little shot. bit more, like, it would actually, like, you know, like, stop him in his tracks or something, but now nah, he just gets set on fire and continues to beat the shit out of you. Well, I mean, when you were last camping, were there those little guys with, like, little blade legs? Not yeah, blade those legs, guys fucking they would... suck. He's got, like, the blade mouth, the long mouth. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, those guys, they're... Those guys are annoying. Jerks. Yeah, they just, like, attack you like a scorpion, kinda. Yeah, those guys burn from the cross. Like, if you hold the little cross up to them, they'll start to... they'll sit on fire. Hmm. Yeah. I do enjoy it. Are you over camping then, or are you still Jesus. camping it up? I think we'll camp probably one more time at least. We have, we have to build our tower to heaven. Oh, yeah? How's that yeah, going? We, yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. We've made like a 40-story tall tower. Jesus. How long has that yeah. taken you? A while. A while. Yeah, it's pretty cool, though. Really high up. We got zip lines launching the logs all the way up there, and then uh, Jenny and Copper were uh, building. Ooh, okay. Zip yep. lines are fun, huh? You know, you can like throw logs on them and send them down. Yeah, yeah, that's how we send the logs up. Oh, man. Yeah, because the zip lines just work both ways somehow. <laughs> you can send them up and down? Yes. That's a really good zip line. It's got like speed boosters on it. That's crazy. Yeah, that's how we got up on top of a mountain at one point. We just kind of zip lined up there instead of going up the, going up around it. That makes sense. Yeah. Plus, we found out that the hang glider you can just infinitely gain height. Hmm. Not sure if you found the hang glider, but yeah. I didn't even know there was a hang glider. Maybe that's new. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there was a sled, and you could the sled was fun. Yeah, the sled's great, but yeah, the hang glider. No, the hang glider is a. Uh, I think that was originally in it. It's just like a, it's not a, it's not like a thing that you can carry with you places. Like once you like drop it, you have to like pick it back up or you'll just lose it. Hmm. Like it's not collapsible. You can't just throw it in your freaking pockets. Huh. I why they did yeah. that. I don't know. So you gotta go to the same spot every time you go camping and go grab it again. Where is it? Is it like in the mountains or? Yeah, it's on like the northern side of the mountain. Hmm. Sorry, I'm sending out important texts. So, you got any weekend plans? Uh, we can plan. I mean, I'm planning on coming around along tomorrow. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, I got an FTO session with uh with Trixie. She's a new SDSO cadet. 
And uh, besides oh, nice. that, you know, just Baker and I will just be uh, enjoying the weekend. You know, I'll take uh, probably take Sunday off, just enjoy it with Baker. Yeah, yeah. You know, watch some highlights. Get well, ready been for the draft. With, you've been hanging with Baker again. Came back to the city. Oh no, my uh, my cardboard cut out. Oh okay, gotcha, I just, gotcha. I just call it Baker because it's easier for that. Oh okay. Yeah. Gotcha. I was confused. I know you made out with him, so I was like, "Oh, he's back." Yeah, it's whatever. We uh, we totally made out uh, when he when I dropped him off at the airport. It's whatever. That's awesome. Good for you. Yeah. 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 Uh, you know, he uh, he, yeah, he kissed me on the cheek, and he said that he'll never forget me. I mean, that's like, I feel like in most places, after making that. No, that was that. That that was it. Oh. Well, like, uh, still pretty good. It's it was great. You know, he was uh he was he was good. Yeah. <laughs> cool, cool. It's a good kisser. Yeah, best I've ever had, honestly. And I'm like nice. ninety eight and a half percent sure he's gonna leave his wife for me, probably. So. Most likely, yeah. Yeah, I don't know what he sees in her. Himself. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> probably because yeah he's he's that guy he's him yeah you know yeah what about you no i never made out baker no weekend plans sorry weekend plans oh weekend plans uh <laughs> no nothing really Just hanging out Put some video games. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hey, your cheese stuff, huh? What? Your cheese, your, your cheese stuff. You wanted me to help you craft cheese. Oh, I'm not playing Project Gorgon anymore. Yeah, me neither. Oh, you quit? Okay. Never played. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Still fine. Still cool. Still cool. You playing nowadays, Brickney? Attempting to catch up with speeding vehicle, westbound occupation, mm -hmm. black and colored. A uh, little bit of dinkum. Dinkum? Of my last dinkum. As well. dinkum? Yeah, it's kind of like a. So, uh, westbound on. So I know, it's kind of like a little Stardew esque. Uh, it's more uh, closer to like my time at Porsche. Mm -hmm. Okay. Or my time at Sandrock, which I'm excited for, but I still haven't bought. I think about getting that Big Ambitions game. Ooh. Those are the kinds of games that I drop hundreds of hours into, like those King are, of Retail. Those are real fun. Burglar Arresting Knight Errant Re Regiment. Ooh. Whoa. Oh, you actually pulled it. Dispatch, Union 3, 1038, northbound Palomino, Avenue is crossed with switchy black color Pluto occupied one time. Go ahead and uh, leave that engine off and window down for me, sir, please. Thank you. There you go. Yeah. Weird that dispatch still says brick on it. That don't seem right. Yeah. Hey, the how's fucking it going? I'm a sub officer, so hey, yo. Hey, how's it going there, what senior? Brick, Deputy Neil McReal, license registration, please. Listen, bro, I'm going to be real my license is in my glove box. Are, am I going to get shot if I go and fucking no, try I mean, and get my license? You're fine. Just go ahead and reach into your, your glove box and grab it. I'm going slowly, officer. I'm going hey, slowly. You're, you're don't shoot me. Don't, don't no, shoot uh, me. Careful. You're fine. Whoa, whoa. What? Just kidding. Hey, hey, just, kidding. Chill, chill, just kidding. Just kidding. Oh. <laughs> okay. I'm back. I'm in a traffic stop right now. I'm funny back. Sorry. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Fuck! Bye, hopes I need to go. Sorry. No. What? Hey. <laughs> what the hell? Oh my god! I'll give it a second before I call it in. Hey, dispatch. Uh, the 38 that I threw in one has now turned into a 1080 with Frank Jr. Smith. We're currently southbound Las Lagunas Boulevard. If anyone, uh, we need some 77s, please. We had a good thing going, Mr. Frank. Currently going over Pull Del Perro Freeway, southbound, Los Angeles Boulevard, right, westbound. Oh, correction. 
Now left, eastbound, and now south, Beasley Street. Can you catch left, it? eastbound Vespucci. It doesn't have to be like this. Right south on Alta. This is the Frank Jr. Smith. I'm assuming that he's going to the Rust compound, or currently southbound Alta Street. Uh, he's, he, just, he just hit some random vehicle crossing this boulevard south on Alta. Left, eastbound, and this is Correction Carson. Uh, be advised when we pulled him over, he was com he was willing and complying, and then he got a phone call and said, "Oh shit, I'm on the way." So probably getting into something right here. So be be ready, units. Yeah. Whatever this is here at the Maze Bank Arena. Oh, he's coming in to pick another uh, another call up. Taser! Hey, what, what what radio are you guys on? What radio? Give me your hands, you fucking Please. bitch! What radio? <laughs> Give me your goddamn hands. Right, uh, we're at channel three. Frank, leave the radio. Leave the area. <laughs> so this is, this is the channel three Taste situation them. apparently. Taste them all. So we're gonna switch over to channel three. My vehicle, right, the north heading northbound Alta. Be advised, this is Frank Jr. Smith. He left one of our traffic stops to come pick up uh, your 95. He's heading northbound Alta Street. Yeah, see him right by the street. I got, I got Taser. We're starting to focus here right now. Running south. Copy. You want us to hold comms on this, uh, on the uh, the Mustang? Or whatever this is. Oh, come to focus if we can, just so we get this guy in custody. He's running east. Oh. Nice. They're holding comms on the foot pursuit, right. apparently. I'm just, I honestly, I'd just say hold comms on this. Right, smoked up. Get mobile. Get mobile again. Uh, foot pursuit can see west. He smoked up. I don't know which way he went. Still on the uh, Dominator. DCB uh, with the Dominator, last yeah. northbound Elgin. They're northbound Elgin. We do have we we have confirmation that's Frank Jr. Smith. He's still running westbound now under the highway. He's running towards the vehicle. He's got to pick up. He's got to pick up westbound under the, the highway. We need a mobile. Yeah, we need a mobile unit. He's running fast enough. He's running south towards Exceptional's Way. Get mobile. Get here now. Doesn't have a pickup. Never mind. It's just a dead loco. He's, He's going towards southbound. the third jump. A hey, firm. The third jump on Atopia. We need a mobile unit now. Do we see someone coming? We need a mobile unit. Someone, someone needs to get mobile I now. Guess we're we can go back there. We're trying, we're trying to get over there. We're trying. Yeah, it's kind there. of a we're messy going, situation, he, he huh? Might jump into the water potentially. He's running south yeah, yeah, yeah. the water uh, off exceptionalist. He ran behind. Wrapped around. Go to the right, right people. Go to the left. I didn't know. I just kept sending it. Yeah, I'm He may have jumped in the water. I got him. I got him. He's running westbound. Westbound. Where those pipes are, that you can get somebody stuck southbound. Smoke There's really any communication on that. We need that mobile Running unit ASAP. We're coming, we're keeping this going. Uh, yeah, we're on here. Guys. Mobile units here. Still southbound. This building. He's climbing over the fence. It's on the outskirts, Torch. You might need to go around. I'll think you can go to the fence. This is running south on the outskirts. BCB temporarily. I got seen. Yeah, motor bump in the area. Mark where they're at. I don't know, remember where they're at. Yeah, they were over on the ghost compound. He's jumping south. down towards the water. I think he's jumping into the water. Yep, he's in the water. Let him know you're gonna beat his ass. I'm not close enough to talk to him. He's there swimming eastbound in the water. Yeah, Thank I'm you, in the Brittany. water swimming east. Yeah. The parallel unit. We need a mobile unit to the east by the boat ASAP by Dodo Docks. They might have a pickup over there. We need someone to go there. Call out. Heading over there now. Okay, Fred. Uh, okay, 988, go to the docks. Fred, you should stay on the west side if Casey comes back. A visual cable? No visual in the water. No. I went under. I didn't see him. Last seen swimming east, though. Some good police work right here. That's it's what we do. I don't see him in the water. I'm looking. Apparently, I think that's Suarez. Uh, who? Who's, which one's Charlie Sheen. I don't know where the the guy that doesn't sound like Suarez. Oh. There's a lot of cocaine here. Yeah. Okay. You mean the guy that just got picked up by uh, by Frank? No, the guy that on the radio. Oh. I mean, if I'm a betting man, what he did is he probably went underwater and like surfed <laughs> Wait, around what? and then went back yeah. to the area. Did something happen to his voice? I, I don't fucking know. 
I don't think he would have. If he would have persisted through, we would have saw him. Uh, he was wearing like uh, a bandana with a shirt. <laughs> yeah, a gray hoodie and a, a writer's cap. And a shirt. Yeah. Gray hoodie and a writer's cap. <laughs> We need someone mobile to the south. I think he jumped in and went straight south and hugged the wall, and he's going south right now. That's what I, I would guess. So the, the I think that's Suarez talking right now. Can you go south to see if he's uh, hugging the wall to the south? Is that Suarez? Yes. Go to the area, Toto. Toe's here for the initial vehicle at Maze Bank. Why does he? Why does he sound like that yeah, now? I don't know. Going south, hugging the wall right now. Toto. Don't Toto. ask, but radio's yeah. popping off right now. Oh, yeah. I don't see anyone here. Looks like. I, mean, I knew what he sounded like. I just wasn't. I don't know. He was told to stop using the voice changer. By who? What? I guess he was getting a lot of crap about using the voice changer, so he stopped doing it. In the area. Like from viewers or from like admins. Really? That's... No way he got very far. I <sighs> okay. I someone running here on place, place near these warehouses. Uh, I feel like people have like always used voice changers for a lot of their characters, but... I got a red and white R34 that was flying up and down by Maze Bank. It's heading towards your, uh, your vicinity now. All right. All right, hey, friend, let's try and gain eyes on that vehicle, but try and be a little inconspicuous. Is that a dominator pack break, too? break. I've got the dominator right back on Davis Ave. No, we're going to continue this. All right, 410, I'm rerouting. Yep. Oh, hell yeah, we're continuing this. Again, bro. Pull we're over. Car. All right, we're currently westbound. Uh, sorry, northbound out of Volta. Uh, right eastbound to the uh, canal docks area off the Volta that goes behind Forum. Coming back dominator to driver was on the radio, by the way. Uh, eastbound across Strawberry, now onto Grove Street, left northbound onto Davis. Took a left again. Uh, currently BCB, I think they took another left right. back towards Lake Mace Bank or? No, 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 Forum, Forum. Oh, no, they're on Forum, they're on Forum. But we're currently BCB, last on Forum, left westbound Carson. Street dies. Oh shit, it's fast. It is fast. You think it's S? It's extremely fast, west in this I think this is A+. Yeah, I, think, I think it's... I don't know. This thing is really pulling us. This thing is really fucking fast. Uh, northbound is Boulevard going onto Clay. I'll go S and if we catch up, I'll still go down A+. Left, westbound, Vespucci. Right, northbound, Palomino. It's really interesting. So many characters. Speedy uses a voice changer. Marlo uses a voice changer. Eastbound, Dorset, Christian Carcer, another right, immediately south. Yeah, I don't know. Southern Unless all other characters stop to stop using that too. Left, northbound, Abel Parkway, correction, U turn, San Vitas, now westbound, Abel Parkway. Can I read that? I'm trying. Yeah, we're doubled up right now. I got this. Uh, continue northbound, Abel Parkway. Left westbound on South Boulevard Del Perro. Transitioning over to Normal Boulevard Del Perro, still westbound. Right, northbound, Portola Drive. Take it, take it. I'm reading a U turn southbound to kill that. Boulevard Del Perro. Oh! And Boulevard Del Perro and Portola Drive by the church. What the fuck? Time to die. Alright, southbound Portola Drive. Left, eastbound. Hey, he's on radio too. He's on radio. He's asking right for help. Right southbound, Rockford. Left eastbound, Carcer. Right southbound, or San Vitas. Southbound San Vitas. Going to Abe Milton. Fred, when you catch back up, I'm authorized pit box spikes. Southbound Peaceful Street. Left, eastbound, Vespucci. <laughs> right, southbound, Power Street. <laughs> Crossing over the south side, southbound, Power Street still. Right, East Boulevard, westbound. 
left, southbound, uh, La Puerta Freeway exit ramp, opposite ones of travel. Southbound, La Puerta Freeway, correct lanes of travel. Force of violence attached. Primary on ticket. Freeway. They're going to be uh, approaching the Miriam's Turner overpass, collecting over Atoka Parkway. Um, Freeway. Mm -hmm. Branching East Town, Richard Turner overpass towards the Alicia Fields Freeway. Reclaims the travel. The uh, Dominator, right? A firm white and color Dominator. Probably oh, Turner shop exit. Driver's gonna be Frank Jr. Smith. He gave us his ID at a traffic stop earlier. He's found these fields freeway. Are you using 77 Could use one more. 350. Red's car is smoking. <laughs> yeah. Going left west down on Ranch Boulevard. Spice strike lane, Spice strike lane. Street. Yep, spice going down, spice down, spice down, hold right, hold right. I can't tell if they uh, if they were successful or not. No, no, they weren't successful, he went around. I gotta break off, my car is fucked up. Paper. I'm up for it. Uh, right westbound, Carson Avenue, media right, northbound, Jamestown. Right into an alleyway, eastbound off of Jamestown Street, coming out onto uh, Little Bighorn, southbound. Another right, Westbound Carson, left, southbound, Jamestown. Once again, Pitts Box Bikes is going to be authorized on this vehicle. Right, Westbound, Dutch London. Media right into the alleyway, off of Jamestown, northbound. The right, eastbound, coming out towards Jamestown. Right, oh, so hard to see for a second. Jamestown. Right, Westbound, Dutch London. This is a good chase. Taking that dirt ramp uh, down to uh, Tokyo Parkway. Keep the units of this. I need someone to stay on the freeway. Someone stay on the freeway. I can do the jump. Out of six. Yeah, watch out for the barriers. We can use one more unit on the uh, chase itself. Uh, he is taking the jump. He fucked it. Uh, we are going north. Road northbound and right going east. So you try to get spikes there. Dirt jump potentially. One four secondary eastbound Tokyo Parkway. Yeah, I think Pred broke off. Up, no, yeah, yeah, yeah but we have Moose Spear joining them as well. Northbound, yeah, he's four. So now we have five. Westbound loves London. Yeah, we'll just to whatever last unit it is to break off then. Right. Heavy traffic on Dutch London, yeah. Still westbound, Dutch London, merging northbound. Northbound, Dutch London. Right, northbound, Calais. at Ubu. Or left, northbound, Calais. Left, westbound, Lizzie Circus. Is this S or A plus? I think this is S. I'm an A plus. Keep it up on it. I think it's safe. Plus. Right, northbound Ginger, left, westbound, switch to Boulevard, passing the Bullet Club, left, right, northbound Decker Street. Okay, northbound Decker Street, continue. Yeah, transition to Louis Star Way, northbound. Right, eastbound, south Boulevard Del Perro. Drive. Left, northbound, Milton Road, immediate left, westbound, uh, normal Boulevard Del Perro, right, northbound, two strange ways. Right into an alleyway, off the strange ways, eastbound, immediate left, northbound, Milton Road. Oh, correction, crossing over Milton Road, sorry. Uh, going towards San Fetus. We're currently BCB primary, can you take it? Yeah, we're you turning to take the jump back down to the garage right now. They're coming back to the garage. 
They're taking the jump. They're coming out of cliffs, coming out of cliffs, coming out of cliffs. Obviously, me. Last thing going out of cliffs. I don't know what direction. He's going right. He's about to jump. I think he took a left. Left northbound onto Gentry Lane. Correction lost the goodness. Uh, we're currently at BCB, gonna wrap around on Clinton. Damn. Might have gone up to Bay Tree Canyon Road, not seen him on Clinton Ave. Didn't turn south off of, towards Vinewood or anything. Hold on. Uh, there's a car I'm parked. Head north right we'll play, see if I can cut him off to you on eastbound. So a car north. parked where? Uh, down in that parking lot directly south of us. There's a white car. Uh, fuck the summit. Wait, 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 hold on. Actually, go back. Uh, turn around, turn around, turn around. Go to Clinton. Nine eight eight code six behind the ball. I think whoever that SDSO unit is going towards it right now as well. Shit. I saw someone for a second. So what did that uh, Dominator do? Just uh, interfere or what was there? it on? Rick, I have it right here. Eastbound Clinton Ave. Yes, they, firm, they fled from a traffic stop from us and picked up uh, a 95 from uh, another scene. Copy that. Southbound Elgin. Oh. Uh, we spun out southbound Elgin. Uh, left Taking a left. Eastbound. Yeah, yeah, go for it, Rick. Go to that Elgin. Rick East. East. Yeah. Sorry. Apparently, uh, yeah, last scene. Where? I didn't see him go off road or on Glory, so they might Where be sending it though. I was following this unit because I thought they saw him. Fuck. Uh, Neil followed an unrelated unit on accident. Ugh. They were they were last seen east on Mirror Park Boulevard. Sorry. I followed Neil. <laughs> well, damn, that other unit really fucked. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't see it come south out of Mirror Park, so I don't know where it went. All right. Uh, yeah, this is a uh, white color uh, dominator. It's uh, the driver's Frank Jr. Smith. He fled from a traffic stop from us and picked up somebody uh, that was fleeing from another scene. Copy that. Worst comes to worst, we'll put a warrant out for him. Got the Mirror Park filling up. Gas station filling that. up. Oh. Getting back in the car, that Mirror Mickey Park. Mouse. Admin, <laughs> off Let's just blow him up and get the W here. Yeah, really. Westbound Glory. Westbound West Mirror Drive. Right uh, to Bridge Street. Blacktown Glory. Yep, they're taking Glory. Spikes on the exit. Ooh, spikes. Spikes going down, spikes going down, spikes down, spikes down. Oh, Good shit, Suarez. He went over, but it... Right, westbound, popular street. Left, southbound on the Los Angeles Freeway. The exit ramp. Uh, taking on to Del Perro Freeway. Westbound, opposite to travel Del Perro Freeway. Slowing left, southbound. Elgin Ave. Right, westbound into the uh, parking ramp on the Elgin Ave. Going on towards lower power. Right, northbound, lower power. U-turn, southbound lower power. Going into the parking lot off the power south southwest. Coming out westbound towards the server's business center. Going underneath, westbound, continuing under the server's business center. Coming out northbound. Oh, going up the staircase to the server's business center. Uh Let's get someone on Alta. Yeah, he's heading eastbound towards Alta. We're VCB on him. Stay here, in case he goes around. Alta, they come down north. South Alta, South Alta, South Alta. South Alta. Left, eastbound Vespucci. There it was. Right. That was San Andreas. Uh, south Power on the uh, little alleyway thing. Left into the car park, he's found. You're following the wrong guy. Fuck. Found Vespucci, right. I was following his calls for a sec. Secondary comms, right southbound, Elgin. Hey, we're just doing a really long parallel. Southbound Elgin, yep. left, eastbound. Oh, fuck, you went left in there. Vespucci. <laughs> I stopped Van Alta, <coughs> right east into the uh, behind the bank on Legion. There he is. Uh, I messed it up. They're going, they're going uh, out of a spoochie, out of a spoochie. Get to me. South on Elgin. 
Alleyway right westbound. It looked like he went up to the top of me for a sec. Yeah. South power. Sending it south power. The power Fine. right westbound innocence. Westbound innocence from oh. Alta, uh, we 1050 BCB. Looks like it's going towards Calais. Come on, bro. You're trying to kill us? No, no. You all good, man? Damn, bro. You guys good? Yeah, bro, lights and sirens on, buddy. Are you oh. good? Oh, oh, you need no, medical. Please. We're at Calais. No sign of him. Fuck. You can come on, Adam. Behind you, Will. Accomplices. They were in on it. I might have it here off of the Palomino stand by. It's in a car going into a right, 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 right. I've got it. South Rockford Drive, right in the pawn shop uh, parking hey, lot. They're heading to the uh, the uh, docks. Yeah, it's the docks. They're going to be going through it. Uh, currently, they're coming out um, southbound still, back to the alleyways. Yeah, we still got them here. Uh, right off of Palomino. Pull over! He's never going to get away from us. He's going back northbound towards the uh, back towards Rockford. He's doing circles in the docks. All right, going westbound. Fuck. Off of uh, uh, behind the docks. I try to bump you in the water. Be careful. Oh yeah, sure. Yep, that's definitely what he was about to do. Whoa. He's gonna try and kill us. Uh oh. Yep, coming out Palomino. All right, southbound. Right, northbound, Bay City. <laughs> right, eastbound, San Andreas. Past the Berkshire, right, southbound, Prosperity. Great hit, great hit. hit by Neil. Nice ground to be turned out, going westbound to Spucci. I've got speed on your left, Suarez. Going under Bay City. Westbound Spucci, right, northbound onto Magellan. Right, eastbound, Sandcastle Way. Fuck. Right, southbound, Bay City. Taking a left onto San Andreas. Take it. I need to throw a repair on this, but at what cost? Oh, yeah, we're south on South Rockford, now holding left to go east on wow. It's up to you. Nah, no, too so much swords by himself. Maybe we double repair it at the same time. Secondary northbound ginger. Right, eastbound San Andreas. Left, northbound. The car's struggling to accelerate now, chat. It's struggling. Left, westbound on Dorset Drive. Right, northbound Madwing Thunder Drive. Sending northbound Medwin Thunder, opposing Lynch Travel. Still northbound now. Heading up into the hills, Medwin Thunder Drive. Hill 50, U turn. Southbound, Medwin Thunder Drive. Fuck. Left, eastbound. Speed. Going south, Dunstable. Eclipse now going east. East on Eclipse. Continuing eastbound. The east on Eclipse is past Roosters. Not too far behind. Continuing eastbound. Pushing eastbound Eclipse. Hey Rose, can I? Southbound the vault. Can I give you a call in a, in a few? I'm in a Stop chase right now. Is everything okay? in a chase when I call you. I know. Tell, <laughs> tell her she should ride with us. Uh, you should ride with Brittany and I, though. Ooh, I'm not going on duty yet. Yeah. Okay, well, when you Stall do go on duty, you should ride with Brittany. Spikes, spikes, I got spikes, I got spikes. Opposite lanes. Okay, they went right. Maybe, Good try. Are you. Going east through the pink yeah, yeah. I'm going to try to, uh, just trying to go, we're trying to go with uh, pit. I can give you a call in a, in a little bit, off. okay? A meteor. Okay. My east bound on Don't give me that, Rose. Don't give me that. Right down, Van Alden. Is the the sadness? I'm a four secondary south on Elgin. Sadness. Alright, I guess 
Yep, yeah, I'm too okay. busy for you, Rose. Call in a little bit. Uh -huh. <laughs> She's trying to guilt trip me, man, so I, I've committed to it. Uh -huh. Almost to Curtin. Thank you so much for the five months. Right, eastbound Center's passage, right, southbound Little Bighorn Avenue on the train tracks behind MRPD. Still southbound on the train tracks, heading down into the canals. Ooh, ooh, ah. Northbound in the canals. Still northbound in the canals, got a tiny bit of distance on me. Probably gonna do the jump up onto the yeah. roof or something. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Del Paro, Del Paro, you need someone up there up there. He's gonna jump on the roof, then jump on the yeah. Del Paro. Look at this shit, Suarez. <laughs> oh, I'm up on the roof with him. I told you. Stop yeah, I'm with you. I'm with you. <laughs> that was fucking he missed, crazy. He missed the jump. He missed the jump. Oh, no, no, he did yeah, miss the jump. He landed. I'm up there with him. He's found Del Paro Freeway. Uh, good, good shit, Gable. Hold it. He's found the Del Paro Freeway. Collects him to travel. Southbound Del Perro Freeway. On a dip, bit of distance on me, merging southbound Elysian Fields Freeway. I'm coming down! Still southbound Elysian Fields Freeway. Honestly, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go okay. for it. Taking the turn off towards Innocent. You got this, you got this. It's a good thing I can fix a car within a minute. Staying southbound. Yeah, true. I also carry a spare hood on southbound, me. Southbound, merging back on Elysian oh, Fields Freeway. You yeah. like the Baker Mayfield of car repairs. Yeah, it's whatever. Still southbound Elysian Fields Freeway heading towards the uh, Miriam Tunnel overpass. Right, off road, westbound. Going for the little squeeze here, comes out to South Shamble Street. We're out on South Shamble Street. Westbound South Shamble Street, correction hangar way. How long has this chase been going on for, chat? Right, northbound popular, opposing lanes. chase has been going on for spikes a hot minute. Spikes take right lanes. Spikes take right lanes. How many spikes does Suarez fucking have? Spikes going down, spikes down, spikes down. Uh, probably a whole storage full of them. Popular. I think it's southbound popular. It's been 84 right, years. Westbound. He's heading westbound Chum Street. A bit of distance on me. Still westbound Chum. Vehicle almost flipped. He's heading down into the uh, Dodo place. Westbound place place. The Dodo place on place place. Westbound place place still. Let's get spikes here on the exit. I'm on him. Right, coming around. Yeah, spikes on the Back exit. Spikes on the exit. Spikes on the exit. Spikes on the exit. Spikes going out, spike down, spike down, spike down, spike down, spike down, spike, 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 spike. You think I he put spike spikes down? down? He got me as well, but he, 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 he I believe he has down. spikes that are all ready to be put down. Mm -hmm. Can you put them down? Mark where they're at for me, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Once I find exactly backup. where. I need one unit dedicated mobile to him, oh, and yeah, I need one unit dedicated to the car that's inevitably going to be there. I'm going for cuffs. We're going to get him. Might be jumping in the water. God. Come out, he's gonna get beat if he doesn't come up to the shore immediately. Tell me you're gonna beat him in the water if he doesn't get back up to the, to the uh, ladder. I don't have eyes on Radio. Him. He's running, he's still swimming west. Nine eighty eight is going to remain with the vehicle. If you don't get out of the water, you're gonna get beat. Yeah. Vehicle's out, right? Uh I don't think it's out, it's just got no wheels. He's ignoring, he's going further south, or further west, further west. Do we have anyone on him in the water? As far as myself it. about then. Yeah, we've got one unit on him. He's uh, he's jumping up onto the little platform that the UPD unit's on right there. Oh, he got taste. Oh, taste into the water. Oh, let him drown, guys! I can't risk this for my career. I, was, I think I, everyone heard Gable's call to 
Or Tay's there, I think. All right, he's still oh. swimming. He's on radio. He's on radio. He's swimming westbound. What do you want me to do? I mean, if he's disobeying, beat him the fuck down. Beat his, beat his ass, Malcolm. Throw those punches. We've we've warned him time and time again. Ooh. Are you back? Just make sure you grab him. We don't want the guy to drown. He's got a knife. He's got a knife. Stand by. I think he's down. Did he get Suarez? Someone in the water. Him and Suarez are both down. Him and Suarez are both down. You need someone else in the water now. <gasps> Brick, he's on the way. I'm jumping in. I got Suarez. Just go back for the 95. Brick, he's got him. All right. <laughs> Status. Code four, we got Stop. it. Suarez is out. What's the status? 13 alpha? That's code four. It's code four. Yeah, give me three people just to come secure the scene. Hey, Thank you. Otherwise, we're good. Five, six. All right, uh, this individual was on radio before he got shot, so we probably have people on the way, so just be on the lookout, okay? And uh, somebody try and call EMS over here so uh, we can get Suarez and the other guy medical. They're already 10 12. Beautiful. Excellent, thank you so much. Where you need me? Uh, down on the docks of uh, near the Porta Freeway. We just need you blocking one of the entrances, having a oh, scene control. Hey, bro. Rap. Miriam Turner over down as well. Yeah. We're gonna chase this vehicle. Don't want them. Uh, ten nine. Suarez! Wouldn't want to be missing that court case tonight. Oof. Oof. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Suarez! Like eight months ago, so almost bad, a year. <clears throat> Jesus. How's, uh, how's, how's Frank doing? Is he breathing? Oh, uh, it. Yeah. You made me shoot I you, you Frank. I didn't want to. So. I had yo, to. yo, why yo, 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 what, did you beat me? Just a little sweat. We warned you to come back up, otherwise you're gonna get beat. Mm hmm You chose to disobey. Sounds like a cop out. Well, I'm a cop, so. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Let's, you wanna get EMS in here, Neil? Uh. Ended up on uh, the yeah. Yeah. Safe. Yeah. Three, five, six. I'm gonna be on uh, across the water from you guys to uh, north. Copy that. Once again, this uh. R95 was on radio before he got uh, shot, so just expect somebody coming in potentially. Mitch, are you on freak? We're on three, Luth. Hey, Brickney, did you uh, did you search and uh, cuff Frank? Yeah. Appreciate you, girl power. Okay. We got to finally use the gun this, is on the way. this time. Yeah, they potentially could be on exceptionalist way across the the water. They were when he was on radio, he was swimming that direction. So that yeah, will just keep a watchful eye over there, general direction. Copy that. <clears throat> is it going, sir? Ah, uh, it's going all right. Psycho criminals. Stabbing officers in the water. Oh no! I know. Jesus. I hate to see it. Swords could have died. I know. I know. They're uh, they're down here on this little platform. Thank you all for coming so quick. Please attend to Mr. Swords. Be us. Yeah, we got we got one. Uh, the officer has a uh, knife wounds, and the uh, other guy has uh, gunshot wounds. Okie dokie. Thank you, Hi, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh Logan.
Big Neil. How's it going? Keeping it real. Trying to. Trying to. Ninety two months. You guys decided to take the one jump in the city that I know how to take. Jesus. What did you stab Suarez? Yeah, he stabbed yeah. Suarez, so I shot him. We've got uh, his Good vehicle, job. the Dominator. Uh, no PD tools available, so we're ready to transport whatever. Copy that. There is a report up. Just throw all that stuff in there. Somebody that's doubled up, if they could uh, take that over to tow, that'd be great. Yeah, Roger that. We're doubled up. Um, like another unit there, just in case. Oh, shit. Anybody have a tire repair kit? The suspect had one. 616 does. Can you just throw a repair kit on it? Hope we give it to you, Gable. Don't you always just carry four so. tires with you, Gable, at all times, and doors no. and hoods? No. What no. the fuck? No. <laughs> Why don't you do that? Yeah, oh, it's, it's real nice. Yeah. How's this CSO doing? Good, good, yeah. All right. Uh, once EMS is good to uh, to roll out, I need uh, say three units, including myself, uh, to to follow uh, ambulance over to uh, some of them where everybody else can break off. Call out if you're going. Nine one four assisting with the impound. Ten nine McReal, sorry I didn't hear you. I need two other units to assist me and Brickney to uh, Simone Memorial to uh, escort, to make sure that we get there safely. Two six nine, go with you. We're doubled up too. Three five six. All right, everybody else. If you're not doing uh, impound or uh, hospital, oh, you can uh, go back to eight. Yeah, give me one more unit with impound. This car is still mobile, so they might try. Thank you. Someone grab my car. Uh, uh, yeah, we'll have we'll have Brickney grab it. Yeah, we're just car. Is that is your the, wait? Is that your car right there? Is it the smoking one, Suarez? Four six right, nine. Harvey, come yeah. help us. 914 to Harvey Holden. Might have already broken off. Just 301 that you need a additional, I guess. I'm going to take this barrier down. Careful. Careful. Yes, sir. <laughs> Are you a good to roll out? Wait for uh, wait for Brickney to uh, finish grabbing that car, and then we're all ready to go. Okie dokie. Good to go. All right, Papa five seventy six to SMH. Look around. I'm coming with you guys. I'm just across the water. I'll meet you guys uh, on the bridge. I right, appreciate it. All right, here, I'm gonna just go ahead and I'm gonna go with Hey, firm. Well, besides Suarez getting stabbed, all things considered, I think that went well. <laughs> uh, and we got to shoot someone with our with the new gun. I have a vehicle here at the impound lot. Same color, it's orange in color. Uh, it's probably unrelated. What new gun? What new gun is it? It's uh, the FN 57. It's pretty crazy. It's essentially a one shot if you get him in the head, two shot anywhere else, I think. That, at least that took two shots to, to get him down. We're all clear here at the impound lot for now.
SMH. Copy that. We are uh, loading up in the back end of SMH right now. Two six nine is gonna go to the front. Make sure everything is uh, copacetic up there. Uh, I'm here right now. SMH. Copy that. As far as your vehicle's just right out back here. Not a person. Thanks, possible. Brick Nate. No problem. I got you. Help us Vehicle's been impounded. Thank you. Thank you. All right, nine one four uh, ten seven IBS. Hey boys. It's an ordeal and a half. I don't know, I just got the Nancy. Yeah. Oh, it's Kate. It's Kate. Oh. If you're okay to just slide off this bed for me, I'll take you through. Dude, people are so fast. Neil, do you want me to just uh, delete the initial one that I put up there for the first... Uh, um, Because I put an investigative report before we had any 95s when the Subaru crashed out at Mays Bank. The gray Subi leaving. Uh, yeah, you could just delete that. You could just delete okay. that. Uh, we got it. We got it. Thank you, <laughs> yeah, of course. I just want to make sure that if anything was useful in it, we could. But if not, no worries. I don't even see anything in it. No, no. I just I I put it up initially because we needed to impound the Subaru mm. and we didn't have a report number. Oh, okay. Well. If you've impounded the Subi with this, then right, just Frank's leave it. To be I guess just leave it. So it's out something, okay. something on right, the paper just... about it, you know. Yeah, All right, I'll put the, I'll write the yeah, debrief right, up for it too, then, and I'll just okay. paste it in there and then turn it into a uh, incident since we impounded the vehicle. Yeah, sounds right, well, good. He stabbed me. Okay. I think he tried to. Did he try to stab you, Nakona? Uh, no, definitely not. I didn't see him try to stab me, but he I definitely saw chance. him stab you. And he oh, fled okay. a traffic stop. Yeah, we've got hey, your this stuff. This was all from a traffic <laughs> stop? Boys, bro. Well, he, he, he left our traffic stop it's because he got a phone call and went, Oh, shit, I'm on my way. And then yep. this whole thing happens. <laughs> oh, okay. He's, you know. Yeah. He was the pickup. Yeah, he was the yeah. pickup. But now you need a pickup. From jail. Damn yeah, right. <gasps> Criminal. Out of the bed? Yeah. All right. What happened to Suarez? I appreciate you guys. Good work, all right. Fuck you, Spotters. Yeah, you guys are going to break off. I'm going to load them in the back. Right, I'm going to stop you. Ooh, right, yeah. Your car's in the yeah. back, Suarez. On oh, the garage? Uh, right outside the garage. Again, Suarez. Oh, Why did you stab him again, dude? Because I can. Criminal threats? What the hell? Criminal oh, threats. I don't, I don't give a shit. I'll boom his shit when I see him. Suarez, there's something different about you. Did you get a haircut? What the hell? Yeah, well, no. I mean, I trimmed up a little bit, you know, but... <laughs> watch your head or freaking you watch your don't head, yeah it looks it what looks good Suarez I appreciate it Miro thank you yeah I said we said to watch your head I jammed him you in did, that is true oh You think stabbing cops is cool, Frank? Mm, Frank? Yes, I do, yes. What the hell? Take one down with you, man. Frank, you've it's changed. Caught. Can you tell Copper I said to phone? To, I want to speak to Copper, man. You get one yeah, phone call in prison, I, you can call her then. You can call her then. I was trying to call her earlier and she wasn't even picking up. Yeah. So. Copper's Bro, changed, I want to speak to her, man. Copper's changed, dude. Where is she? I don't know. I even think Can you just around. check your little thing you made your gun? Copper's around all day. Bro. Brick, tell her to come and see me, man. I mean, I'll try. We'll 
See if she even answers. She probably won't. She hasn't been answering my calls or like anything. Tell it, text her to say thank you. Really want to see you. But I'm bad on it. No, no, no. Yeah, we're good. Take the rest of your stuff real quick. We're everywhere. You don't want to take the jump, so you're the one getting the reckless driving. What's up, Frankie? Hello. I like how you only got here when he. <laughs> you only just got here. <laughs> Wait, he was the one that picked you up? No. Picked me up from where? Was it the white dominator? Oh no, never mind. No. Okay. Yeah, the, the, he, he ain't just you, that you got your license removed, my man. What, what are you doing driving? Wait, so my license is back. Uh, 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 not according to your MDW profile, it's not. Yeah, uh, that's that's the wrong thing. I just finalized it the other day. I gave him three tests. Second. After three successful tests, three that's yeah, you know, you you're go. correct. No one just removed that from your uh your your stuff. So let me remove that for you. Same. Yeah, oh I don't know. You guys look like fucking brothers. What is this? Maybe it's my brother. Oh I'm an only child, unless my dad fucks someone else. I'll be right back, my man. I'm gonna drop that recharge. Did that delete everything? You can do it right here, man. I don't feel lonely now. I I gotta run the gun. Okay. What the heck are the microwave bandits? I'm not gonna make too much noise, man. Oh, it was again. Okay, a group of us part of the day. Jeez, cheese, cheese, cheese. All right, Frank. Oh, uh, uh, really I've got enough. your charges written up already. <laughs> right. Uh, you're looking yeah, at attempted murder of a government employee, resisting arrest, no. reckless evading, oh, felony obstruction of justice, and third degree shot. speeding. How uh, much? 92 months, 184 months parole, and a $10,300 fine. I would knock off. I'll plead guilty for 60. I'll plead guilty for 60. All right, that's fine. All right. Easy peasy. Text cop on telling I'm going to corner. I want to speak to her. Okay. 340. Uh, that's a, that's a rip bozo. Right, you're getting on that billed push. for $10,300. <laughs> I know what he's broke. Someone else's gun and got me another arrest the next day. Alright, so no, no need to brag. You know, and uh, you're aware of how you parole know, works, laugh, like, Mr. Frank? I, I, yep. I figured you are. You got like a CBS receipt of, of uh, priors on you. Oof. Yeah, priors as long as my deck broke. You should get that checked out. That doesn't seem medically okay. It's concerning, it if anything. really isn't. Uh, as concerned as it is. That's, if anything, that's incredibly hard to, to live with. That's what I'm saying, bro. My God. I didn't say that. All right. Besides you having an extremely long penis and, uh, you know, huh? wanting to stab Suarez again. Anything else you'd like to say before we send you up? Yeah, fuck 12. <gasps> the hell? That's us, though. Yep. <laughs> yep. I was toxic, even, Frank. I, I bet you can't even it's count to 12. Toxic, bro. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Fuck, you did that so fast. Shit, you did that really fast. That so That's fast. faster than I can do it. You sent that so fast before I sent it. Yeah. Out. I would have gotten mixed up right there. Jeez. That freaking fast. Free my boy Cole, man. He done nothing wrong. <laughs> Who? Carmine? Cole. Hey, Carmine. Uh, Carmine what's killed up? a man. That was a whole song about it. What's up? Yeah. Uh, are you saying that we should free you? What? I was, I had, Frankie, I wasn't even, I'm not even arrested by, by what you got involved with. This is, a, I, was a completely different thing. Well, you can tell that to him in jail. He's gone now. Oh, he went, oh. Yeah, he already got sent. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna incriminate myself, you know. I don't, I don't, I don't know that guy. <clears throat> hey, by the way, uh, officer in the cowboy hat. Hmm. Yeah, how, uh, so in that situation that Frankie was in, how many people got away? Mm, I mean, well, we were just following Frankie, and we got Frankie. So yeah, from our from yeah. our situation, none. Yeah, none. Just Frankie. All right, all right. we got Frankie. This is a warrant. Good on you guys. Yeah, well, that's what he gets for fleeing a traffic stop. It's serious. 
<laughs> you know, Rambozo. All right. Wait, did he shoot somebody or did he just try to hit him? Yeah, he tried to stab someone. Well, I guess he oh, did successfully stab someone, did, but, yeah. uh, so we shot him. Oh, damn. That's yeah. a Rambozo. Are you doing the report, uh, Brickney, or? I'm adding people to the report. Okay. I'll so do. can you like, knock off some okay, I'll do the report. Since, you know, I was like, okay. cool. No. What? <laughs> it's cool. That's, um, you don't like a good chase? Is that, are you one of them guys that doesn't drive? Uh, I've been driving a lot more recently. Yeah, so you like a good chase. Sometimes, but you put, you put yourself in position for us to box you at slow speed, so. Yeah, well, a lot if of people. We let you it, go. Put, we let I you go. Myself, at that point, I, it's like I, I, I look bad myself. on me. Frank Junior Smith. Uh, pulled over. You wanted to get pulled over. I put you myself. Were... I put myself in a position to awake to be awake today. So, Man, there was a lot of people involved in that. It was. And I Jeez. The one, I need Dan's fucking statement because without it, like, literally. You mind if I piss my pants real quick? Yeah, go for it, please. I mean, I'm right. just admit what I did. I just, uh, you know, the Maze Bank Arena dirt jump, I just sent that jump. That's, 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 that's reckless under. driving. That's the original exactly. reason why you got chased. Slap, in the first slap place. that on, brother. Slap that on. It's not okay, good. so criminal possession of firearm class one. Oh, yeah. Possession All right, uh, McGreal and Brickney were patrolling the streets. Uh, when a white and color dominator drove by uh, at high speed. McGreal pulled the vehicle over and the driver identified himself as Frank Jr. Smith. During the traffic stop, I used to be a PFPO and I used Frank to got a phone call and said, oh shit, I'm on my way. Sorry, officers. Okay, how do you plead these charges? And drove away. He then drove to a nearby scene where he picked up a fleeing suspect. Yeah, and admitted under Miranda, exactly drove away so you are getting reckless driving. from another scene and drove so away told me after a short jump, chase but since he uh units lost eyes uh, on it frank at any point in time regained eyes on him at a later time when it was just Frank. Uh, you can plead not guilty. Another chase you broke out. And if he doesn't give me a statement, then where it led to Miriam Turner overpass, I mean, I mean, where sense. Frank got so, out of his car you want to take and hand. dove into yeah, the so water. I do, but I Suarez. Comes to testify. You want bench trial? Suarez. To be honest, I'm not very... Uh, and uh, Nakoda swam after him, and during this swim pursuit, Frank pulled out a knife and stabbed Suarez. The grill then shot uh, Frank down. All right. And he Answer was full arrested. Rock and roll. You... Frank pled guilty to all charges. Oh shit! I forgot to add resisting arrest too. My bad. Yeah, you... Oh. L. <laughs> my guy. <God>, my guy. <laughs> all right. All right. Good stuff. Another W. Yeah. Another double, yeah, yeah. Oh, did he uh did he have a headache or something or uh no, I think he's just uh he's fine. Did just you kill him? him? Yeah. Oh, okay. What the hell? I ate him. Oh Jesus. That's actually it'll come cool. out the other end. Yeah, one day. One day. Alright. That's the Brigney. Alright.
Uh, make, I gotta call Rose back. I don't even know if Rose is still on duty. Okay. That was like a half hour ago. That's how long this... That whole thing lasted like an hour. Yeah, it did. I can talk now. Sorry, that whole thing lasted like an hour. Alright. Well, so far so good. Yeah. Pissed your pants and you got back in the car. Yeah. It's usually what I do. Are you ever like want to invest in like adult diapers or something? Or no, you're wearing diapers is weird. So pissing your pants with no adult diapers is fine. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. VCB. It took just out the frequent what? on southbound. Yeah, problem? No, I mean, I just figured, you know, you'd probably want to stay dry and stuff unless you just like the feeling of your wet pants. Well, what else am I going to do? Uh, use the, a, a toilet or adult diapers. Oh, yeah, I should have probably just used the toilet, huh? Yeah. I don't, know why you just, I don't know why you just pissed your pants right there and then. Uh, it felt like the right thing to do. Toretti has a, a special brand of uh, diapers. I'm not wearing freaking diapers. Well, he's got Toretti brand diapers. I don't want to wear diapers, Neil. Okay. All right. That's fine. Jeez. Hey, Rose. How's it going? I'm okay. How are you, Neil? Good, I'm using my phone at a gas station, even though you're not supposed to. Or did they uh, debunk that superstition? I don't know. Oh, I, uh, I guess we'll find out. Well, good luck. Hope, hope you don't, you know, explode. Yeah. What did you, uh, you talk about, Rose? You just saying hi. I just want to say hi, see how you're doing. I'm doing well. I just got in like an hour long chase with Brickney over uh, some guy that ended up trying to stab a cop. Well, he did stab a cop. He stabbed Suarez. Oh. Yeah, Suarez got a haircut, I think. Yeah, okay. it's weird. Yeah, he got uh, a he got a haircut. That's I knew he looked different, but he got he's different because he got a haircut. Nothing else. Like what what kind of haircut? I don't think he got a haircut. I think he got them all cut. <laughs> <laughs> That's true, Brickney. That's true. Hey, you'll you'll, say you'll see Rose. when you when say you that to Rose. Say the joke to Rose. Brickney says, "I don't think he got a haircut. I think he got them all cut." Because <laughs> you know you wouldn't just you wouldn't just get one haircut. You'd yeah. Get them oh, all cut. You know? he didn't get like a singular yeah. hair. Yeah. Good oh one. yeah. Good one. You tell Brickney. She laughing. It's, it's a good one. She, uh, she's laughing. Yeah, she's laughing. She's, she's probably said, cracking up. Huh? She said it was a good one. Yeah, she's cracking up. She just now stopped laughing to, to gasp for <laughs> oh. I know. It's good. It's good. Would you do me yeah. a favor? Yeah, what's up, Rose? Are you, will you ask Brickney how her day's going for me? Uh, Brickney, Rose wants to know how your day's going. Uh, it's going okay. Like, Copper, who's like my best friend, isn't really interested in talking to me. She doesn't pick up my phone calls anymore. Uh, he but said... apart from that, like, it's going all right. I don't know. I just feel like... Things could be better between me and a lot of my friends these days because, I don't know, I'm trying my best and stuff like that, but I just, you know, I don't know. He said What's he's good. <laughs> just good? That's it? Well, he said a lot. It's, he said, he said you know, he's sad about Copper not answering his calls, and he's, you know, he's doing his best these days, and he tries to be there for his friends, but sometimes they're not there for him. But, you know, oh, besides no. that, he's good. Uh, he's really into uh, this one game now. What's the game? What's the game again, Brick? Which one? The one that's like 
Welcome to... Oh, like My Time at Porsche? Yeah, My Time at Porsche. Yeah. Dinkum. Dinkum. He's really into Dinkum. I don't know what that is. It's like a, it's like a world building game, kind of. Almost. Is it like Legos? No, no Lego? like... Uh, remember, remember Farmville? Stardew Valley. Like Stardew Valley. Closer. Yeah. I, like I never played them, you but I, I'm, I'm aware of them. Okay. How are you, how are you, Rose? You sound uh, a lot better than you did yesterday. Yesterday you sound super stressed for some reason. I was stressed. I've been stressed. I still well, am stressed. If but you want to talk just, about uh, it, Ricky and I are all ears. You know, I'm just repressing everything and like in a deep uh, state of denial at this point. Okay, um, that's healthy. Yeah. It's, uh, Surely that won't all explode at any moment and just come out at the your worst moment in time. Yeah, I never, I, I never do that. You know, I don't just like repress things to the point where then I uh, freak out or I anything. Think she, I think she represses all her feelings until they build up and she just explodes, Brittany. Yeah. Oh yeah, a lot of people do that. Yeah. I yeah. also like to say I don't explode on people. I just usually like well, cry yeah. a little bit and then I uh, get over it. Sometimes it's just easier. Okay. Okay. Well, like, like I said, you know, if you want to talk, you know, Brickney and I, or me, or Brickney, or we're all here, you know. Now nah, be fine. Okay. I'll Keep it to yourself. Totally Put it in a little box. Put it in the back of your yep. head and crush it. You know. Exactly. I com I compartmentalize everything. That's good. That's good. Yeah. Very healthy. Yeah, healthy, healthy person right healthy. here yeah all right well besides you know your uh, internal agony i'm glad you're doing well and uh it's always it's always good to hear from you when are you getting on duty rose mm, probably in two hours two hours huh okay yeah it's currently well, when I checked, there were 42 cops on duty, so. Now there's 39. Well, yeah. But I'm not, I, I don't want to get on duty yet. Okay. All right. Well, if you decide to a little early, let me know. I don't know if I'll be around personally in the next two hours, but I know uh, probably Brickney will. Right, Brickney? I won't, no. -uh. Never mind, not Brickney, uh-uh. You'll be by yourself. I've, I've already been around for like almost six hours. Brickney's already been around for like six hours. Whoa. I've been around for like two and a half. Six hours, huh? Yeah. Well, I'll probably just go do motor things, you know. Mm -hmm. hey, I saw a picture of you today at the meeting where you got one of the Cara Cara boys. Hell yeah, good shit. Yeah, we almost got the other truck, mm. but they got away. They always do, those goddamn Cara Cara boys. Well, the other truck was actually, I think, like a, uh, was it like a Ford something? Oh, but yeah, the F-150. We got the car, yeah, we got the Cara Cara, though. Hell yeah. Well, get shit, now Rose. I gotta go get that Ford. Yeah, you know, I hear they're built yeah. tough, but Rose is built tougher. You know what I mean? Oh, uh, mm. Rose, yeah, do you have catchphrases that are to like the flower? Like, true. like when you arrest people, you're like, every rose has its thorn, and then you send them up. No, usually when I arrest people, I say, "Do you need medical?" You should, okay, well, you should you should pump in a couple catchphrases here and there. I think "Do you need medical?" is a pretty good catchphrase. Time to trim the hedges, know. and then you send them up. Time to I'm get pruned. With, I'm, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna stick with. Do you need medical? All right. Well, yeah. After that, after do you need medical stuff like that? You know. Just a okay, thought. I'll it's think, just a thought. I'll, I'll just think a thought. about. I'll think about. I'll think about it. All right, Rose. All right. I'll tell you what. If you need anything, give me a call. Okay. We'll get back on patrol. Okay. But I appreciate you and your friendship. Yeah. Likewise. Oh, by the way, bridesmaids. I would like. I'd like bridesmaids to wear pink. Pink. Okay, when is the wedding again? April 24th. 24th. Oh, we got plenty of time to plan and stuff. I'm going to get ready to do a... I got to start planning your, your bachelorette party. Okay. You cool with strippers? No. What if they're Baker Mayfield strippers? No. You like football? 
The fall's okay. Nacho cheese? Oh. Sh sure. All right, that's all I need to hear. Oh, Love it's gonna be nacho great. Cheese. It's gonna be great. Okay. First, I gotta go. Okay. There's so, there's someone right in front of me. There's a cop right in front of me that just went down. I gotta. I'll call you back, right? Okay. Bye. Okay. Bye. Uh, uh, time got stabbed by somebody. Shelly 911 in. 906 to 23. Do we know who stabbed her? Not the clue. We're gonna go inside and find out. Hmm. We were pretty quick. Right. I didn't. 23 to Burger. I didn't yeah, see anybody. Really leave. Same cool. traffic. Alrighty, time is gonna be inside the burger shop to the right. Copy. Jet ski down there. 906 was, uh. Was pretty much on scene immediately. Didn't see any vehicles uh, heading southbound San Andreas Ave. Six two six, go check the roof. Huh? <sighs> Maybe she had a heart attack. Oh, yeah, Break. I thought he was gonna be a male wearing all black motorcycle helmet. He stopped time and then run out. All right, the roof is cold for at least. There's no one on top of the roof. It definitely yeah, narrows it down. Yeah, first thing I'll be careful for you, Mr. Roland. <laughs> All black Shit. and a motorcycle helmet. Oh, Half the city down. fucking stabbed. Oh, <laughs> uh, 66 is going to move his seat there for him, Miss. All right, where's the officer? Inside, inside burger shop. I can stop an iPod. Oh, oh, never mind. Time, be conscious. She's dead. Oh, oh, no. oh. Still open. All right, stand hey, back, stand back, stand um, back. I've, right. I've got pressure on, so you let me know when you're ready for me to release that pressure. All right, uh, hold on there for a second. All right, we got to make sure she's conscious. We got to make sure she's conscious. All right. She's out cold. Wake up. She's... Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. 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 <laughs> and I'm on the tenth oven working the case. Mandem. Oh, Jesus. She said. Okay. She said mandem. She said mandem. She said mandem. Oh. Not our problem. Someone got stabbed. You advised when she was gasping for air. She mm. said mandem. The person that stabbed her might have been a person member of the mandem. That's the name of a gang. Oh my God. Okay. I think it's the mandem gang. On her back. <laughs> Good work, guys. Good work. Oh, yeah, okay, so, uh... Yeah, the whole gang stabbed her. <laughs> and what if she's in the gang, and that was her way of repping the gang? Be like, Man, she's trying to get her head head off. <laughs> she British? It is for air sound, like I hit a British accent. Oh, negative, negative. I believe that she was calling out the individual in all black with a motorcycle helmet was a member of the mandem. Crack the case. Oh shit. Yeah. I think the mandem did this. You know what, Brickney? I think you might be onto something. Yeah. I think you might be onto something. Yeah, I'm pretty good at like detective stuff. Where milestones a thing? I don't know. I have no idea. Persecuting me. Oh no! A lot of the blood seeped through the. Uh, so, um, quick question for you guys: uh, mm -hmm. Was she just stabbed and then he ran out, or did yeah. he? Uh, did the individual get hit too, or something? Or no, no, it sounded like a stabbing. And then they, yeah. and then one she day got, he said, "This yeah, is for this," said, and then he stabbed her. That's it. No, I just heard her say, what do you want? Say, and then he pulled out a knife. I didn't say anything. And it happened right over there? Yeah, by the statue. Yeah. Hey. Okay, what? thank you. What's up? Yeah, what's up? Yeah, he's always like, real quick. Hold still. Hold still. <laughs> it's, it, he's, he thinks the roundabout oh. way, but he always gets to the end. Oh, so. there oh. we go. Oh. All right. Oh. Now we're just going to get the blood hey, into hey, her arm. Blood on the scene. It might be hers. Oh, yeah, I documented it already. Up there with All right. the, 
Just well, we have a small little here. Hey, Brett. Brittany. 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 Uh, and we just got to pop your blood. Yeah, like in the cool. parking lot. Yeah, you're doing. Yeah. yeah. Pretty good, pretty good. How are you? Oh, yeah. 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 It's she got stopped. Yeah. It's still donating. It's a shame. Yeah, by the mandem. Those classic British people with a knife. That's what they do. That's what they do. That's what they do. I should know. I'm All British people. All British people. They just stab people. Hey. Hey. Classic. No, no, no. Hey, this is first. No, here's the thing. You know what British police officers use more? Hey, how's it going? That means I'm a giver. Nice oh, stick. stick. Yeah. Uh, I didn't do it. I do that sometimes. Six, 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 everyone like, in Burger Shop. I feel like not doing just the blood shooting or anything. I'll just carry a nightstick on duty instead. We have units inside Burger Shop. Is everything still, still code four inside? Yeah. Hey, um, Len Rift Cook and Save Times Life. Copy that. I was just making sure. Let him cook. Run around the parking lot. Excuse me, I think business has been yeah, set still since no one can enter or leave. Are you in the parking lot? No, right now, but I will. Is over. Okay, I'll send it to you and, and you right. can listen to it. Ugh. You must have treated the officer who went to the hospital. I'll be that. Uh, 906 is going to start an investigation report over uh, this incident. Are you guys uh, ready to move out? Hey, yeah. 10 9? We ready to roll. Uh, if you have double up you know but I just want of you to bring times towards back to the hospital. Six one six can uh, I'll be in Brittany. Is it just me or is okay. it really unclear today? I thought they said take her or they want us to take a car. Just your car, her car. Officers getting stabbed today. A lot of, a lot of British yeah, people, yeah, yeah. I guess. Check. Take your mask off. Well, in fact, I'm initiating a uh, 38 no, Northbound no, Mirror Park drive out site no, with you, the yeah. library with the park. 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 He said no, thank you. At least he was nice, bro. Yeah, true. 339, no touching. What's up, Chris? Doing good today. Doing good today, man. It's been a solid day. What's up, Banana Pudding Pop? I bought a car today. And uh, we've had some good PD stuff going on today. So, solid day for me, man. I bought a, uh, an old Toyota Tacoma. Pretty stoked about it. I've wanted one for a while now. I financed one. That should be clear. I ain't got that kind of money. Look like any of the major arteries are nicked here. The best way to close it off <laughs> is cauterization. What? Please, 
I don't want that. No don't fire, want that. no fire. No fire. Okay. Um. Hmm. What else can we do? Uh, stem cell. Would you like some stem cells? Yeah. That's oh, there you go. That'd be nice. Be Perfect. All right. Let me get these Is stem Ruth cells prepared. We got some the... fresh ones in the barrel. Just got to. Loose, not Ruth. All right. Oh, my God. Got the what? stem cells here. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 Oh, my God. What's wrong? Oh, Holy fuck. Did you just kill a baby to save time? Holy fuck. Um, All right, just got to scoop this up like I'm scooping uh, uh, mayo out of a jar here. What is uh, happening? He's a hero is what he's doing. He's saving a life. Yeah, yeah by killing a baby. That baby wasn't going to amount to anything anyway. Probably not. Or now we'll just uh, rub this over the injury here. The stem cells will create a new layer of skin for you. Thank you. Thank you. You're a hero. Feeling it's really fast. And oh, okay. let's get this stitched up and closed up. We'll that was a, a, that was a lot. It should be good. <sighs> ah. Oh, one more thing. One more big thing. I'm alive. One more thing. You need to verify that you're human. So I have a captcha for you. Okay. All right. Can you tell me what you see here? 69. Okay, this one? <laughs> poop. <laughs> this poop. Send nudes. And this yeah. last one. Come. What? Perfect. She's good to go. Yes. Let's go. Is that what come looks like? Yeah. Oh, gross. Guys, oh my god, thank you so much for the help. I thought I was going to die. So you said it was a... Who, who do you think did this? Some guy with a motorcycle mask. It's like an all-black motorcycle mask with like a red suit with a mandem chain just came up to me. I was like, this is for Claire Seducer, and then stabbed me. Who the fuck is that? Claire they were Seducer? in like a they were in like a those airport like shuttle buses, the yellow one. So you think that Claire Seducer ordered put a, a hit, hit out on, on me. you? Yeah, hundred okay. percent. We can put out a warrant for her then. Yeah, can we? Yeah, we'll put out yeah. we'll put out a we'll, we'll, we'll include her God. in there. I'll put her in the Thank investigation God. report. Yeah, I mean, you usually put out a Yeah, hey, he just came up to me at a burger. I was about to order a burger or two, maybe three. Bulking. Huh. Well, that's a bummer. W what's a bummer? That I didn't die? No, you didn't get to order your burger. Oh, yeah. That sucks. <gasps> I'm scared. Yeah, well, Thanks, guys, you, for the assistance. Yeah. Uh, you want to caramb it so you can defend yourself? Sure. Okay. I got it from a guy earlier that stabbed the cop, so. Oh, thank you. Is it a cool color? I don't know. I didn't even look at it. it oh, it's it just used, ugly as hell. It was okay. used to stab Suarez. Oh, sick. Yeah. I'll, I'll stab the guy who stabbed me. Are you kind Hello? Yeah, that's probably for the best. I'm okay. Thank you old... so very much. Oh, you're welcome. Your car is out front. Oh, my God. You're the best. Thank you so much. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Yeah, go ahead. Who yeah. stopped you, time? Two points of blood. Pardon? Put out the, put out the war. Who stopped you? I don't know. He was wearing a mask and he had a mandem chain on. He's like, this is for Claire Seducer. And then boom. Oh, shit. I think so. I don't even know who that is. Are oh, you doing a report? Yeah, I think you can upgrade to an incident. Uh, I mean, we don't really we have know. A, we have the hit organizer. I mean, yeah, we got, we got Claire, but we don't have the person that did it. I'm just going to leave it like this for now. Okay. Uh, I want to go to MRPD and throw this in there. We'll get to the bottom of it. Maybe they'll still be in the yellow tour bus. Maybe. Wait, they're in the yellow tour bus? Yeah, that's what they said. The bus came back.
Be on the lookout for a yellow tour bus. Suspect in all black with a red suit, motorcycle helmet, and a mandem chain. We parked out here, right? Yeah, super cool. That someone stole our car. Uh. Under the oh. car. I think I found it. Yeah, super cool. Found it. Can you, uh... What? Can you check the, uh, the trunk and stuff? Just to make sure nobody's hiding there. Yeah, okay. Clear? Yeah. Alright. Alright. Can I get in? You can get in. Okay. So you're pranking me for a second there. Uh -huh. Just kidding. Ooh, ooh, you gotta be quicker. Uh oh. <laughs> that car is stolen. I gotta reset my lock fast. No. Yeah, I get what you mean. I get what you mean, man. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Alright, let me uh just run in real quick. I just need to throw something at Evans. Okay. Sick. All right. Mm -hmm. I feel like cop cars should be harder to lockpick. I know they like you already need a uh, special lockpick for it, but still. Now that those lockpicks are pretty easily uh, obtained. <laughs> why, does, why does she have so many? All right. Mm -mm 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 -mm. A little bit more of Neil. Maybe like one or two more calls. And then we're going to switch gears into uh, something else. Not sure what yet. Not sure what yet. But, uh, but yeah. All right. A second. Okay.
All right. Let's get back out there. Uh, All right. Let's go. Let's go. Continuing northbound lower La Perda. You see Dan can talk. You talking. needed more sweets. Dan can talk? talk? What do you mean? Dan couldn't talk because he got like his throat slit or something. Now he can talk. Oh, shit. Y'all need Dan additional Bailey? on this. Yeah. No, we got plenty. Damn. Poor guy. He broke up. Going up to the Banner Motel. How we fix this? Take cops, guys. VCB. Left northbound all the street. We got a car picking up with a garden gnome driving. Heading towards all the street apartments. Bet now they need additionals, huh? Picked up by the two door little coupe car. Yeah, and we're gonna go over and kick some freaking ass. Northbound all the true, parallel to the true, all the street apartments. Yeah, I become like a kick ass there. cop since you and I were last riding, by the way. Mm, we're doing great. We make a good team we're always. Bro. I'm insane. I'm like a super cracked at like everything these days. We make a good team. We gotta do yeah. more stuff too, uh, out of city as well, Brick. I'm down. You guys need backup on this? Southbound. Passing the Banner Motel. Taking a right Hop westbound. Hop in, boys. Oh, yeah. Hop in. Wait, Hop in. No, 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 no. We need to be able to call. We don't need to go. Uh, uh, uh. Where do you guys need to go? My, uh, my car is just there. My car is, he's just robbing my car! My car! You need to come here, jerk! You're a jerk! I mean, to just pursue, or you guys want to get out here? I'll get out, I'll get out, go, 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 go. Right, northbound, Kalee. Hey, McGreal. Hey, how's it going there, Lexi? I guess we're joining this. Hey, that was quiet over there, uh, McGreal. Left, I'm south, yeah, I was, I was whispering, yeah. that's why I'm yeah. uh, this thing here for Pip. Uh, hey, Firm, this is Eugene driving. Uh, we were in an 80 with him about five minutes ago where he stole this very car. And Continuing yeah, southbound, Dutch London. My goodness. Right, getting onto uh, La Puerta. He's going to take the jump down to Greenwich. Why does he, he does this every time? Seven, 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 seven. Nah, what we have plenty. Hell? No! We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yes. We're good. Oh my God, Brick, you're in the car. Hey, Brick. I didn't see you there. We're fine. Never doubted. Off road. We're gonna be jumping up to La Perta. Channel one, guys. We're here for suit channel one. Oh, I got them here in La Puerta. They're heading northbound. Up Hang on to your Baker Mayfield yeah, memorabilia. Oh, no, let's do this. Uh, oh. Chase on four. Wicked. Good love, sir. Right, keep chase, uh, huh? Four. Are you good back there? Good here, northbound yeah. La Perta. Hey, no seatbelt back here. Secondary, the doors off the car. I'm on my fall out. I'm on my fall out. The next job we do, I'm on my fall out. Fine. No. I don't know if I'm going to be fine. Andrew, Scott, 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 Music. Westbound, they are stuck. It's box Oh no! He's fine. He's fine. Oh my god! There's no door. I fell out the door. All right, the, uh, Why don't you just hold on to something, lovesick? The recycling area. Sorry, sorry. Excuse me. Excuse me. Coming out northbound, yeah. Alton. Oh. The Tonys are shooting. The Tonys are shooting. Tony, no. Tony Corleone is busted back there. Continue northbound, Alton. There's so many Tonys. Ugh. Northbound. Uh, Northbound. 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 <laughs> I got you, sir. Uh, we're good. Right on uh, the Adam's apple heading. Uh, left into the construction. Oh my God, we just, up to construction. just killed Tony Corleone. Uh, uh, there's more, there's more, finally. There's more, there's more. Oh, there's more there's Tony's. No of construction now. There's no door. Taking the jump. Oh, McQueel did a cool spin and I just flew out the car. Go ahead. I'll take care of this. They're gone. Are you sure? Are you sure? I'll take care of him. Yeah, I was with Clear before. All right. Okay. I love sick. You don't know what fraction of the speech they jump now. <laughs> it's crazy that he jumped out of there. 66 is gonna code six out, west fell out. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I mean, you literally also spun it clockwise. Yeah, because that's what you do in those scenarios. You could have been clock counterclockwise, and he would have been fine. He's fine. But you had, you spun it in a way that. Just sent him flying out. Wait, was 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 Crystal wearing a uh, uh, Rangers outfit? 
Oh, I don't know. The 16 North Las Lagunas Boulevard. I think she was. I think she might have been still in UPD. I think she was just riding with Lovesick. Little Sol. Oh, yeah. Code 16 eastbound out of Zappel. Cool. God, poor Lovesick. Yeah. Poor little guy. He's just a little guy. is code four. Huh? He's just a little guy. Repair our car while they're repairing theirs. It's funny. Okay. Oh, shoot. Oh, too slow. Too slow. Too slow. Too slow. Turkey Joe. You're a turkey. I think that that's going to be called UTL. No way, they're not going to freaking lose them. Is one, is one just completely silent right now still? Yeah, yeah. it is. Yeah, okay. that's what I'm Alright, we're calling this UTL. Back yes. to channel two. All right, Joe. Thank you for the six months. I appreciate you. Yeah, that had me really confused. I was like, wait, hold on. It was quiet. Too quiet. And then Dan yeah, finally called six, UTL seven, like a dyslexic kid collapse. trying to do his ABCs. Yeah, um, really yeah. well. With the mm. uh, Eugene's car. Ready to check. Ten two. Ten two. Ten two. Dispatch U 374, attempted to pull over Santa C, who revoked driver's license. Yeah, I think for the six months. 77, Logan. Yeah, we're on the corner of Sinner and Vespucci. Copy that. 6676. Mm hmm. I don't know what I feel like doing today. Do I feel like doing variety? Do I feel like uh, playing another character after Neil? Do I do wild RP? I don't know. There's a lot of options here. 914 uh, 10 Are you guys all good? Yeah, all good, folks, mate. We're all right, Neil. We're just taking a statement. Yeah, okay. All right. King of the castle. King of the castle could be fun. King of the castle. Oh, so the guy got his gun stolen. Uh, maybe. I don't know. I'm not really paying attention to. Uh, well, someone nine one one saying, "What do I do if my gun was stolen?" And then someone responded saying, "Report it stolen." And then he said, "It's stolen." Four six five. I'm um, seventy six. The latest uh, breaking enter at the bank. Nine oh six. Uh, Any of you guys need backup from that? Hey, firm. Yes, we do. Let's get uh, one more unit on that, and we can hop over to a radio channel. 436. All right, dispatch. Do we got a free radio channel for this 31 Alpha? Uh, we don't have a dispatch on duty today, I don't think. Copy that. I believe channel one's free. Let's go over to channel one. Copy that. All right. 906 is 23. There's going to be a black and colored G Wagon on scene in front of this Fleeka. Multiple individuals. We got a Buzz Lightyear looking motherfucker. Uh, hostage inside. I see one without a mask on. Looks like a Ralphie Ralph. Uh, multiple individuals inside. Whoop. Uh, 906 will take pictures and flag the vehicle. Reducer, you want to do uh, negotiations? Oh, really? Really? Yes. I got the flag. Can I get your name, right. please? Thank you. Hello, Anthony Ralph. What are you doing in there? Oh, really? You're not robbing this place. It's a withdrawal. Okay. 
Okay, perfect, perfect. Uh, be advised, this guy next to me has a mask on. What? Uh, okay. It's not Ralphie Ralph. It's, yeah, yeah. it's a mask. Yeah, he has a mask on. Yeah, I respect <laughs> Uh, plate Um, shit. It's petrified Stop. shit, actually. What? Shut up, idiot. What do we? What do we shut up? <laughs> what do we shut up? Hello guys, how's it going, you guys everyone? Down? You guys down? What? The time? No, what? no, no, no. Let's not run out. On the, on the count of three. No, we the shouldn't. Count. They're do saying that. on we the count of three, let's run out. You guys down? So just three. be ready for a potential foot chase. Mink. Oh, not me. Ah! They're running out. They're running out. Hey, They're guys, getting hey, into the car. Guys. Suit up, unit. Suit up. Suit up. You guys are clear to get aggressive with them. They did not make a negotiation. You guys are clear for pit box spike immediately. Copy that, Claire. You sticking back with the hostage? Yeah, Yo, but they're prior here. You want me to take comms? Let's yeah, go. Yeah, take comms. All right, 413, there you were in active. 1080 Mercedes G Wagon, black in color, occupied at least three to four times. We're eastbound Carcer Avenue or Carcer Way, passing by the courthouse. What a plan. Of Rockford Plaza. They're driving on the wrong side of the road. They're eastbound. Going oh my god, they're Rockford English. Plaza, Watch out. They might stab Avenue. somebody. Falling down, right? Oh, they're southbound. Oh, they try to fake. They're still continuing eastbound Occupation Avenue. Oh my god, they're driving on the sidewalk. They're like, but I'm going in for a pit. I'll be that. You guys are right. extremely aggressive. They did not make uh, negotiations. Alright, 465 and second day. We're southbound Elgin. And going uh, still southbound Elgin. I'm going to go for a pit here. Good pit for it. Box, I'm going to get this here. Go for a box. What's your 20? Southbound Elgin in front of Cold Box. Yeah, you, guys going box. To you guys didn't negotiate. Currently basically stopped. They're uh, trying to push Florence around. And all that is, man. Southbound Elgin. Here we go. All right. They're taking a left eastbound. San Andreas. They're going to Legion Square Park. Uh, they're going southbound through the park right now. That's pretty wicked. Take it. Southbound Elgin Avenue. Yeah, that's Frank, Cooper 60. Adams, Boulevard. Yeah, you know, something like Just getting ready for skate. Southbound when it comes out in like a year or two. Eyes out yeah, I'm kind of excited for it. It's going to be free to play, so that worries me. But... Yeah, yeah, me too. I mean, Skater XL and Session are two of the best games that have come out in like a decade. Dollar pill. Alright, Southbound. Oh my gosh. Are you alright? Are you okay, civilians? Alright. Sorry about that. We'll get them, guys. We'll get them. Left eastbound Carson, right through another alleyway behind form for southbound. Speak to the baseball diamond, looks like. Nope, they're coming on form, going out to Davis. Left eastbound Davis, right through another alleyway, southbound. Mm -mm -mm. Like Rose Street, heard you on the Covenant. I just tipped it with the local ticket. They had a big 50, they are still mobile though. They're oh, past you, past you, past you. They're going east, they're going east. Flowers Bar right now going south. To me, they went south. They go left or right? You see, oh, they're left. They're eastbound. Eastbound. Eastbound Dutch London. Uh, they took another left. They're northbound Dutch London. I think they took a right to El Rancho. El Rancho. I saw them. Hey, from. Right. That's on popular street. Oh my. I just got 50. That's found on popular. I tried to flip you. Uh, they took another right, uh, westbound hangar way, or Chum Street, Chum Street. Currently VCB, last seen westbound Chum Street. Uh, we're gonna code six, kind of more towards the, uh, docks. Radio check, check, radio check, is this channel used? Yay, hey, for yes. 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 I get the virus bar, I'm back here. Did you say they're I'm back sorry, here? Sir? North on the street. Oh, they, yeah. they came back to talk shit. What jerks? They're, yeah, they're uh they're going into the canals now, going north. Producer, you Ocean King? They're uh continuing north behind the canals, yeah, probably. And the canal continuing north. Pushing north. 
in the canals for we're parallel to Popular Street, heading towards Mare Park. So continue north bend the canals. Sending it still. They're making a U-turn to go south in the canals. They might do the jump on a Del Parafruit. We could probably use someone there. Yeah, I'm, I'm blocking. Yeah, uh, okay, just be careful, because they're going high rate of speed. Okay. They're lining up for the jump, they're taking it. They've taken the jump, they fucked it. Uh, I, I made it, but they're below. Ooh. Ooh, oh, is that him? Oh. It might be that. <laughs> Ooh, that's a... Oh my god. They're, they're, they're all out, they're all out, they're running oh, westbound. Yeah. Right underneath the freeway. All individuals are out. I got eyes on a guy with a cowboy hat or a pirate hat. We're running the driver of the ski mask. A ski mask on and a shirt. And four. Running toward the bus station. We get units there. Oh, I got one on foot westbound and going across the LS freeway. This fuck. Ah, hey, what up? No more pillbox now. Oh my god. Uh, They're all running super quick. the stairs on order me. Come here, you son of a bitch! Cowboy hat is running up the stairs ah! to upper pillbox. A gun's wow. uh, out, stand by. Going around. The uh, individual with the striped shirt going westbound, integrity, on the radio. This guy's all the way across, all the way westbound. I got the guy with yellow pants, he's smoked up again. He's, ready. he's running north in front of upper pillbox. So you're gonna need the same mobile likely. He's really fast. I'm faster. All right, he's, he's running run west. He's running west. He's running west. He's coming out now on two Elgin. The psychopath. He's on the edge. Don't do it, sir. Don't do it. Don't do it. It's on radio. He's running north. Running northbound. If you want to get in, I can get you closer. I told you I should have stayed on. North power. There's a guy preparing the car at the at the one inside seventy sevens. He's on the off ramp. He's running right towards you guys. Did so unit right near construction. <laughs> Your cocaine makes you so fast. Okay, underneath the construction building. Yeah, he's yeah, I got visual on him. He's you're going to the west side. He's going he's inside, he's smoking up again. I feel like he's running across. There should be like an overdose mechanic. Like he hasn't spammed the drugs yet, but running, I've seen uh, drugs north spammed. Currently towards the Royal Mop Cup. He's too fast. He's running uh north on Alta. There should definitely be like an overdose mechanic so people can't like spam it. at the moment? He's jumping westbound into the Royal Mafia compound. He's inside the compound. I'm going to watch here. Uh, or actually, you watch here. I'm going to go around. I'm already on the western side. Yeah, he should come out of there. He came, He went inside, so he's going to come out. I see another guy running westbound. Is that the same guy? Guy has yellow pants. He has yellow pants. Uh, this guy's got black pants and it looks like no shirt. He's on the phone, though. Not seen him inside the pool area. He could have jumped over. I haven't seen anyone come out yet. I haven't seen anything on the east. Just keep an eye out. I think there's only two entrances. He might be in there tucked and like slumped somewhere. He said by Royal Mafia. I locked my uh, individual. Yeah, R95 is in the Royal Mafia one. Hey, what's the status on that unit that was requesting 77s by the car? Hey, we, we got another view. Another 95. We got 195 down, 195 on on foot. He's with ski mask, white shirt. Four seventy six. Got a call out of a radio. Great Dodge Charger. They're getting on southbound Los Santos Freeway. Diabetic shock for for donuts. Something. The guy, sky ski mask guy with white shirt was beat, was trying to cuff me. 
apologize for what's gonna happen. We probably need seven days here. I don't feel comfortable. Oh, yeah, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. That Brittany... Hey guys, I found the guy Lester. that's not Ming, by the way. I found him again. I'm gonna redirect to the uh, guys trying to cuff you guys. Keep calling that. Where are you guys? Yeah, I got this guy over on Dorset Drive. It's the not Ming guy. And he's, uh, he's not that fast if you guys wanna come catch him. Ski Mask guy is in the bus station now. He was cuffing. He's moving he back. He's moving back. He's moving back. He's moving back. Get, he gets out of the car. Dude, he was him. probably in like a bush somewhere. Two people in the car. Right, Ming's running across the Del Perro Freeway right now. Southbound across it. I can't chase him because this car can't go over any sort of bump. Guy with the no shirts running to the car right now, guys. Uh, in the train track. That's the driver of the original G-Wagon. He's trying to distract you guys. He's trying to distract you guys. I got one going south. I need a unit mobile over here. I get the car. I don't know where he is. I think he, I think he might be running eastbound, but I can't, can't find him. Is what it is. I had they to lose need, eyes. They need help. Around. Anyways, should we go back to them? All right. Uh, yeah. Fuck, fuck, not me. All right. Hey, nine hundred six to seventy-six over you guys is twenty. Comms, what's going on? Torres is currently trying to get that great vehicle uh, out of the area, leaving now southbound. Way. That great vehicle is going to be occupied twice. Sister, on a foot pursuit with the guy with the ski mask. Actually, where the hell should I go? Uh, I What's think, uh, I think Brickney lost eyes. Last seen, uh, by Del Perro Freeway. I think they're heading. Gas pack coming back, guys. Brittany, the EMS on standby. My 95 is bleeding quite a lot. How did they get him down 95? They didn't even call it a radio or anything. Yeah, what the hell? Okay, okay, He's beating me up! 20! Uh, eastbound train track, eastbound train track. White coming. shirt, ski mask, he's doing drugs, going to the canals. All right, I'm gonna start beating him then. Copy that. He's running southbound behind this train. Please stand by. He's gone into the canals. Yeah, he's in the canals, in the canals. White shirt, right in southbound. Yo, Lethal. Carly, thank you for level. the raid. Yeah, I appreciate you, Carly. Have you know, on, yeah, perfect, perfect. Let's break raid. This guy's going to beat. Love it. Thank you so much. Finish up in this car. Hope you had a wonderful that car stream. Him up. Fuck, dude. They're all the way over there. I get in. They're gonna like run away here. southbound. He's never gonna get away from me. <clears throat> got a radio like a Ooh, psycho. We're trying. All I can do is watch LGX in the morning, then leave for my lunch break, then raid him back. Hey, I mean, I'm cool with it. I like it. I like it. Glad you're having fun with streams. He's drinking liquids. Uh, I'm still on the pickup car right now. All right. He, uh, yep, he's still running southbound. Pickup car. You guys got to try to catch up. Get in here, Mo. You guys have to get him. To beat him, he's gonna get in. Dude, fuck. I shouldn't have gone out. I thought when they said train tracks. Right. I should have stayed in the car. Come on, I'm gonna spike him. Uh, we're going towards yeah. Little Big. Westbound across Little Big one. Uh, no, no, that's fine. Thank you. Do you guys still have a 95 in the G Wagon originally? They no, should, have... yes. 195 that's uh, shirtless with pink pants. He is currently in very critical condition. We're getting EMS rolling in now. I made, what up? Guy to I our made a mistake. GTR. Yeah, you kind of just dove out, huh? Oh, well, sorry. I thought, I thought that they, they were a the lot original closer driver. than they were, but they're not. There's a unit running behind us, too, if you want to grab them. Yeah. It's a red GTR. Vehicle back on the G-Wagon scene. Get in. Thank you so very much. Yeah, yeah. units over there. Make sure they're secure. Right, what are we looking for? I like it. I like it, Chris. Yeah, show me off the scene. All right. We're Christian. Yeah, they the G-Wagon. Perfect. Thank you so very much. W. W. Oh. Oh, you check? Individuals, they're running out. They're trying to pick them up at the uh, down individual. Two individuals in white by the scene. 
There's a teeny tiny guy. Get him. Channel, channel one. Channel one. Leave. Them of the China break you out of the Sir, Ralphie, leave. Leave, we Ralphie. Me, we need me back over here. Ralphie, leave. I just need to join you guys right now. Come here. Oh shit! Oh. Oh. Meet these guys down the China break you out of Okay, individual picked up the uh, the smaller one. They're heading southbound. Do you turn in We're right near lower pillbox? Trying to spike the GTR again, guys. Oh, trying to pick up the guy. You want to stay on the for black the mopeds, Sir, oh. stop trying to pick people up. The GTR, pick up the guy. Spike, spike, spikes. Didn't take off. Uh, they're, they're heading southbound. Oh, my feet, my feet, my feet, my feet, oh, my feet. They're gonna fucking kill him, he's bleeding everywhere. Fine, let him die, I guess. Do we have five story now? Negative. Okay, well, let's uh, go after the scat pack then. <laughs> well, how did they take Wait, all 95? Wait, you want 95s? me to break off on the black sports car? Because I'm chasing it right now. Uh, we need to uh, go to right, the right, right, GTR. The guy in the GTR is the driver of the G-Wagon originally. He's the priority. Alright, where's the, the G-Wagon? Well, I need... he's in the GTR oh, the... now. Uh, I thought it was GTR. Go, go help them out. Yeah, go, go help them out. There's a lot of shit in here. There's a lot of shit. They fucked up my car. They kept kicking it, so I'm not sure. I feel like. What are we on right now? Yeah, whatever. Yeah, I definitely feel like Lethal should have been authorized, but you know, not my scene. All right, well, I'm on the uh, scat pack charges going north on the off road currently toward De La Serre. Hey, units on this. Hard uh, If we see that guy Ooh. with the ski mask, the shirt Doomed will Muffin, your username then. checks out. Copy that. They're, they're interfering on a, a, a chase with a black vehicle going northbound towards Sonora Road. There's already like three units on it going north on Sonora Road currently. Do you want to have a car with 104 on top of it? No, they didn't. They didn't negotiate. I, uh, we could have. We could have handled that a lot differently, in my opinion. Uh, we're in North Mountain Road but on the scat pack. I'm not sure if it was involved in that chase, but it's going North Mountain Road. Move along, people. Move along. Vehicle slowing down here. I need some backup. Uh, North I'm, Mountain I'm Road. Coming. Holy shit. Yeah, it's a great scat pack. Plate comes back to Larry Knox. Is it? Yeah, is it S plus that car? I'm in A plus. I'm pretty sure it's A plus. We're going north on Sonora Road. It's a very slow rate of speed right now, going 50 miles per hour. I think Suarez has your vehicle time. Ten intersection. Bateau County, Sonora Road. Continue north, Bateau County, Sonora Road. I feel like we could have handled this a little differently, but not my scene. Still continuing a northbound well, what would you have recommended? Um, considering they didn't do any negotiations. So all right, speed. Yeah. Just going and six, took six, everybody. I think we could have even authorized I'm, lethal I'm, on I'm the vehicles. Right. If they were eastbound handcuffing LPK. cops and were told to stop, and they didn't when they were beating them, then you know we could have upgraded to uh, a lethal one. Yeah. yeah. Uh, at it's least to shot tires, you know. Yeah. But, uh, such is life. Such is life. Nail gun these tires again. real quick. Just in case. No, because we probably got to drive it because I don't think we have any PD tow. Pass to the front of Harmony. Still east on 68. So as if you go for pit right behind you. Yeah, we got to find some. Uh, I'm going to wait for it to get to a closer to somewhere we can box it. Reverse it. It spun out. Driver's on the phone. Four secondary eastbound parallel to the prison. Going around the prison, continue eastbound. Off road. This is a fake plate. At Sonora Freeway, southbound. In southbound Sonora. It's a fake plate. Any units in the city that can try to spike them near Vinyl Park Drive? Any units? One mic out. Taking southbound to north uh, Los Santos Freeway. A plus, I can barely keep up. 
Uh, I believe it's A plus. Yeah, I'm I'm holding up an A plus right now. Okay. Uh, southbound passing. Uh, water chase is still going on. They they just took all the 95s. Uh, that we had. Southbound Los Santos Freeway passing under Vinewood Park. I don't know why. Like at that point, especially like if they're trying to take 95s, they should all be beaten. Crossing the Mirror Park Boulevard. Let's continue southbound, not taking the Elgin exit. We got units with the G wagon, so right, getting that impact. A for me. Copy. Someone check out the 78, please. Continue south, over the Ave, crossing San Andreas. Vehicle stopping. Is this where the 13 Alpha is? Negative. Continue spot strawberry. I say lucky plucker. Traffic heavy. Continue stop out strawberry. I'm calling PD Toe, Brickney. What? I'm calling PD Toe. Okay, I think the car that car's that car's here for us. Uh Bam we got a car coming fell. to the G Wagon right now. I just saw Ralph in the back of it. He's going. Break, break. We've got a car circling the area for the G Wagon. Could use an additional 77 where the initial scene took. rejecting. Uh, PD Toe is not answering, so I say we just take this ourselves. Copy that. The car needs to be fixed, but I want to wait to fix it because they're just circling. Copy that. You and 374 can't there's get a tow truck. Well. Guys, I can't get a tow truck. There's a, there's a blue uh, muscle car here as well. It's passed by twice now. Plus the other car, the uh, SUV, the black SUV that had Ralphie in the back of it, I saw. Got visual on the scat pack car. 10423. We're westbound up in the canals next to Dutch London. All right, all right. We just, well, I just want to get the car out of here. You know, we don't need to follow them. Are you getting a tow truck, Logan, or are we just going to drive this ourselves? I'm currently assistant Suarez now with the car. All right, we're going to get this ourselves and yeah, repair it. Let's just transfer it. I have a repair kit. We're still on the scat pack. Are we uh, good to take comms with this? Are you good? Okay. Take him, take him. Yeah, take comms. He jumped down the canals. Uh, I got by. I'm going to check up here real quick. He's heading back oh. Bound. Still kind of spinning out. <clears throat> long scenarios today, huh, chat? Very long scenarios. We're going right, west. Clear, like northbound. Onto a Topia Parkway. Circle Maze Bank Arena. Right eastbound onto Davis. Right again, southbound onto Grove Street. Left eastbound onto standby Davis, U turn. Now heading northbound Grove Street. All right, let's hit a shot box it here. Shot box it. Hey, firm. We need a unit here to help us box. Uh, 374 is coming. All right, they broke the box. Spikes, did they come westbound? Oh. I'm pretty sure I just saw Not Ming going northbound Los Angeles Freeway on a rented moped. Dude, this car is taking forever to fix. I keep calling the scat pack. U374 westbound Davis, right northbound Alta. 977. What's this for? He's going into the canals. Uh, I don't know. Reduce your car right behind you. Okay, we're fine. Hey, can we get one of the sevens that just joined the radio into the canals by the train yard by the bus stop? Okay, they're coming in now. They're coming in now. Need the area, please. Guns. Oh! Hang out, what are you gonna do? 
Punch, punch, to punch him, he's out to the chain mm. Oh my god, you guys just killed that guy! I'm still in the car. Who's <laughs> in that Q wagon? The 906s, they're ramming me inside of it. Uh, I will look have a motorcycle me. pulling up. I don't. Leave the area, sir. Moped is now going eastbound. I'll go for a pit here, guys. No. Unless we get a wall. If we get a wall, I get this bar here, but. They try to come back out, hold the street. I'm gonna have spikes here ready. He's he's got radio. Yeah, him, Ask him where he's going. I don't know what to do in this situation. Spiking, spiking, spiking. Ah, they jumped over him. Watch the spike. Oh, sir, no. I think trying to take the car. No. Car no. Bro. You guys need help with the car? <laughs> we got the person remote. Like I was already in it, trying to move it. Get the car, hop back into Elyon. I just need help with the car. Train tracks. Uh. We have Ming back here with his moped. I don't know. Do you guys, do you guys need help with the car or no? Yeah, we got like three individuals here. Right, might need one to redirect here. Stay on it. Watch for the moped. They seem to be leaving now. Like, like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't Red know. GTR uh, highway, northbound. Watch out for that one. Individual and a moped still underneath uh, with us. This is kind of an awkward time. Should I, I should should I get out of the car? I don't even know. Like, you this is just, this yeah, is. Yeah, the hell out of Suarez. Like I was in the car oh, when dude. they came, and I feel bad like running away from them in this. Hey, we're, but like uh, we're clearing out the GTR and the other vehicles. I mean, it helped. I don't know. So, Do you guys whatever. still yeah. see any interference mm, back there? Moped with there's, there's southbound. Got the there's G wagon. Ooh. Zesty. I'm coming back. I don't know. The, the orange color sports car is leaving. I feel kind of bad, like moving around inside the car, but like I don't know, like what else they really expect me to do there. All right, this car has been here for. Uh, are they are they still trying to get GTR's in? GTR is coming back. The GTR is coming yeah, back. Yeah, they're they're still getting in it, and I'm kind of awkwardly inside of it still because we were moving it when they tried to come grid it. The future head tricks, by the way. Don't feel safe next. He's, yeah, he's going on uh, the west westbound uh, Los Santos Freeway Popular Street exit. He's continuing eastbound up here Freeway. Okay. Got by the San Andreas exit. Let's let's get this thing out of here, but we need multiple units to follow us with it. Yeah, we'll follow you. Start rolling down the train tracks in the Little Bighorn South, and we'll uh, we'll we'll intercept you there. Moped's back on Ian's going southbound Strawberry. Uh, we don't need every unit on the escort. Uh, let's maybe do just four on the car. Everyone else, like, pull off for, like, until we see interference. Yeah, I got the, the moped going southbound Center Street. But up on Center Street. We're definitely going to get shot impound. <clears throat> One of you guys in the escort G wagon should go up and pound on it and make sure it's clear. 988 already on it. I will die for this for this G wagon, you guys. <laughs>
Was one of the 95s we had an Xavier Sin? Uh, I'm not sure we got any 95s uh, fully. I think we just had one down and then they took him back. Okay, well, this is definitely a personal vehicle that had fake plates on it. I'll just mark it as owner wasn't aware or something. Yeah, I mean, either way, it's uh, still full of strikes and no signs of tampering, right? So. All right, impounds being requested. What's up, Adam? Being headed towards the impound lot right now. I mean, not Ming, southbound Orchardville. Okay, it's been accepted, but I got to sign on duty real quick and do it. Go, Neil, go! He's pulling in okay, now. Okay, Ralph's on a motorcycle heading uptown South Chapel. Should I try and impound it, or do we want to wait until it's clear? He's, he's trying to pull into the impound lot. He's coming in. You guys want me to just go and impound pound it, or we give it him a chance? Yeah, impound it. Mm -hmm. He's, right, he's going it's for it. Time. He's going for it. Home for cuffs. I'm going for cuffs. Go for cuffs. Ralphie, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. The, uh, exit? Yeah, yeah, I'll spike don't the exit. I got the. Uh, oh, quick, 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 quick. Ah, fuck. I could have impounded it, yeah, but it just. It? it felt uh, weird. This, this assisting vehicle was blocked out of the way, but it was going with the bounding anger. It felt kind of powerful. These motherfuckers. Northbound Popular Street now, at least for this assistant vehicle. Opposite lanes of travel, northbound Popular. <clears throat> I don't know. Now, correct lanes of travel. You're clear to get out aggressive. They told me to suck their nuts, which was really good for them to say. Yeah, this is yeah, don't do that. With strike points? Yeah. Uh, they uh, got pitted. Southbound popular. And I don't know. That felt kind of powerful right. to me. Westbound innocence. I'll, t I'll take whatever I'll strike say, points if that's the case. Westbound innocence boulevard. No, no, no. The Prius funny thing about that bike, bike that's Eugene's bike. So Ralphie stole that just to come fucking get the G-Wagon. <laughs> For Westbound Capital. Motherfucker. Strike points, it's like when officers don't no, do what the they're Prius, told. Okay, the gas station? Yeah, no, no, great. The, the Prius is the inference we can go through like Was it? Oh, they, oh, they don't want the vehicle strikes? <laughs> yeah. Speed. I keep We're going, uh, do wagon Do wagon Does anyone have vision on the G-Wagon still? No. Not, negative, not the G-Wagon, but I have the, um, assisting vehicle. I found Power Street. Old Benny's, if I can get one more unit here, it'd be amazing. I can go for a... I'm on. Oh, I'm, I'm signed in if it's all marked yeah, up already. Yeah, uh, is there a report for this? By Old Benny yeah, now, Yeah, it is. It's called GG Fleeka. Is this, uh, fun attraction you're chasing right now? A nine? Are you Sorry, guys. It should be an incident. It should be an incident because Ralphie Ralph was on. I saw him twice. Yeah, just just gonna get a warrant if we don't catch him. Under Laporta. Should I do? Should I do? Ideally, the car shouldn't poof once impounded. Does it make sense? Yeah, I. I don't know. Alright, he's northbound Laporta. He did a jump. At the same time, vehicle is blown up and we fix it, so how does it make sense? Yeah. Travel, Laporta. It's okay. Continuing uh, northbound towards Del Perro Freeway, eastbound, opposite lanes of travel. Hey, Brick, you guys need help on this, or are you guys good? Uh, how many units we got on this? Hey, got one more on the initial chase. Um, you got units coming. I think we already got plenty of units, though. Copy that, copy that. All right, sounds good. 
still eastbound Del Perro. They're taking the exit off of uh, Del Perro, well, slowing down like up the ramp. They just took a kind of little bit of an exit up towards Elgin Avenue. Looks like they're taking a left going southbound onto Elgin. I currently am VCB, uh, southbound Elgin. Plus four, squad on Elgin, left west one Harley Cart. You're clear to get aggressive. This is Hellion Star vehicle, right? We're no farm power stream. <laughs> yeah, that bike. Spanish. End of the day, Rams are still best Left team in the world. Left yeah. place. Approaching Harwick. Holding rifle. Actually, there's Harwick. beef, bro, right between teams. Left side of the Demise, we've been chasing yeah, these guys already for a long time. Uh, is it, if this is just yeah, felony obstruction, not a priority suspect, uh -huh. do you guys want to stay on this or? Hey, we're good to impound it. Uh, well, I haven't identified okay. the driver, but he might be involved with the uh, initial Sleeka. That's why. Okay, copy. South on Alta Street, left eastbound Vespucci. I spun out. Take it. Yeah, Signature so Combi eastbound Vespucci Boulevard. This is beef between C GG and CG. They they tagged up Maldini's earlier. Right, right stop on mm. Strawberry. That would be the orange moped. So we need more oh, units right. on that moped. Uh, are you guys pursuing with this, or are you sticking behind? Another Colton. Wait, they're bringing another car. Another oh, oh, here, come on, top in. Where's your car? Uh, yeah, pursuing the uh, stolen vehicle heading. still. Sorry, I don't really want to. It's GG related. It's gonna go on for another uh, hour, but let's go. Hey, who are you riding I'm with? Sure. Ricky. GG gas going east right now, but I'm out of gas. Oh fuck! Okay. Past the Crusade Hospital. Hans? CCB. Uh, I think I have it on the train tracks right off of Olympic. Yep, train tracks off Olympic going westbound. Uh, they're currently like on Olympic right by GG Gas, Westbound, um, they got some distance. Yeah, I'm still Westbound Olympic, they're pretty far away from me right now, and they're able to kind of get over the... <laughs> I just fell into a fucking hole, god damn it. <laughs> apparently got no visual. Oh. Man, that was kind of sick when I just fucking did that, so whatever. <laughs> Code 6, westbound with the Probably sent it all the way down. I'm just gonna get off this. Yeah, he probably continued through there. Who's primary on this? I, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, that's what happens. Well, I'm gonna get gas real quick. Are we are we currently like totally VCB right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah you, you really did it, didn't you? <laughs> really did do it. I feel like I lost him like a minute ago, maybe. I give up on like, this car. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, I give up on life. Yeah, my bad guys. I uh I don't know, I didn't really feel right impounding it with them right there. It didn't feel good to me. Great call, I think that was the right call, Darren. Yeah. yeah it's all good. It just, it just happened. Uh, that was a whole shit show from the beginning ever since they crashed out on the train track. So we, I think we handled that as best we could. I mean, honestly, they, you did, guys did really good. they didn't even do negotiations with us. We could have gotten even more aggressive they're lucky that we didn't but uh but yeah for, for the situation immediately situation that it was we uh we all did well okay i get a unit to pick uh me and neil at the gas station at the clay I'll, I'll come get you guys yeah uh units their status frequency uh Ralphie ralph stole eugene zuckerberg's bike uh there might be issues with uh gg and cg this is the second time they've done something to each other today. Honestly, I hope they're... Yeah, they tagged up Maldini's earlier. 
got Eugene's bike impounded for felony obstruction, so okay, that's on them. Yeah, I'm, I'm so upset that we're impounding rival gas vehicles. Gosh darn it. Darn. Damn it, how would they survive? Yep. Yep. Okay. Right. Logan, where's your car at? At uh, my PDA. Yeah. Oh, okay. I got it stuck. Yeah, oh, yeah, we're easy. You need three seven four same traffic. Well, that didn't go too badly. No. Yeah, it's like about a, a, like I said, I don't know. I felt I didn't feel right impounding it with him. No, that right definitely there. be powerful. Nah, you, you, if you impounded it, he drove all the way in there. He, eh. I think it would have caused even more issues. Yeah. Yeah. To me, uh, that I was like if we were following a. Uh, a criminal, and then they just drove up to a parking spot and put their car away immediately. Yes. I feel like that would have been like same vibes. So. Oh, yep, hundred yeah. percent. Oh well. Yeah, I, I watched a. I've ever seen something like that where they literally just like lost their train ticket when they did that once. Yeah, I'm good. I like my life here. That's yeah, okay. Yeah. Uh, okay, let me just throw that evidence up. I suppose. All right. Repaired the shit out of your car, too, by the way. Appreciate it. did a really good you. job. I didn't even know what I was doing. I was just, like, hitting shit with a hammer, and then it turns out it worked. Gotta get you some uh, gas. And then I think I'm gonna go 42, Neil, if that's okay with I'm, you. I'm same, same, same thing, dude. Same thing. Yeah. Do something else. I'm gonna take a nap. What up, Minio? What's up, cutie? Nothing much, nothing much. Jay chillin', as they say. I feel that, I feel that, baby, baby. Yeah, uh, how's your day going? Good, I just got on duty, gonna go up north, do some ranger shit. Ah, oh, doing a kind of a late shift, huh? Yeah. Cool, cool, well, you have fun out there. I'm about to be going 42, actually. Have a good one, stay safe. Ten more PD. Perk up here, right? Uh, it, I can. All right, I'll bring you inside. Thank you. Just thank so you're you. safe while doing the report stuff. Appreciate it. Appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, of course. All right, Neil, I'm heading out. Hey, thanks for riding along with me, Brittany. Appreciate it. Yeah, of course. It was fun. I'll see you. I'll see you on Monday. Sounds good, brother. You have a good one, okay? Are you not? Yeah. Yeah, the whole situation was a little, uh, is it your old vehicle? a little out there. Hey, how's it going, Miguel? Hey, Suarez. Um, did you? Did we get positive identification on any of those uh, individuals? Did we confirm that was Ralphie Ralph or anybody? Uh, no, because they said that he had a mask on. And okay. as for, there was a guy with underwear on that didn't have a mask on, but I don't know who that was. So I was the only person that didn't have a mask on. I just don't know who it is. And all of our 95s, we don't have anybody, right? We didn't have anybody. No, no 95s, no, uh, no cars. Really? It was good. Yeah. It was good. It was good. All right, just making sure. Yeah, we did the best. Yeah, what can you do? I mean, hey, they, they, we tried beating them, uh, you know? I mean, what can you do? You did the yeah, best no. we could, so. 
Is what it is. All right, Suarez. Uh, I'm just gonna put a re incident report up so we know about it, but I'm not going to uh, fill it out really. Yeah, uh, I mean, there's no point, right? Because we got no cars and no warrants to put out, so there's there's really no point. You can honestly just put the lead on the report. Cause there's, you know, we didn't get, we don't got, we don't got anything, right? No, na no, no ID on purse people and no cars impound. So yeah, I mean the 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 bike was impounded. Oh yeah, at least we got the bike. I mean, that's true. Did it have size tampering on it? Uh, I believe so, and it was Eugene Zuckerberg's bike too. So, ooh, Eugene's bike. Yeah, I think Gigi and Chain Gang are at war right now, or something. So that's you know, that'll be. Wait, something. which one? Oh, his body. His. Uh, oh, I see. Yeah. His yeah, body. yeah. Yeah. Quite well. Hey, at least we got that right. So. Yeah. I'll we'll it take it over it. nothing. It's, it's better than nothing, you know? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll see how that goes next time. But uh, hey, we did the best we could. So. Oh, good. All right, Suarez. Appreciate it. Just wanted to confirm that. All right. You. No worries. All right. Take care. All right. Bye. All right. Um, it slashed me mask on i mean if i had a ped model and i couldn't wear masks i would do that too i don't, I don't blame him for doing that uh aflika in the rockford hills was being robbed suspects ran out before any negotiations were made after a long chase they abandoned uh no their vehicle blew up uh on the train tracks by mrpd after uh They all fled on foot. After repairing the vehicle and taking it to impound, one of the individuals from the bank showed up on Eugene Zuckerberg's bike and stole the G-Wagon from the impound lot. It's lost. Eyes. Nichols. With lost eyes. Michael was documented though. The plate has been flagged. Zesty. Drop this up to STSO and then we're gonna switch. I don't know what I feel like switching to though. Like, do we feel like. Alright, our choices are first of all, a great needle shift. Uh, a little hectic at the end there. A little bit of a, a unique situation. Is what it is though. Um, sh 
Should we do a different character? Should we do a different game? We could do King of the Castle with chat. I know you guys always enjoy that. I'm thinking either different character. Or King of the Castle. I don't know. You know what? Let's play King of the Castle. Let's play King of the Castle. Good Neil's shift, though. Good Neil's shift, honestly. My summer car. New! New. We'll do King of the Castle, and then tomorrow we'll focus on roleplay. We'll play, uh, we'll play Bryce in the morning, and then we'll switch to Neil. We have an FTO shift tomorrow with Trixie. And then I'm thinking after FTO shift, we'll play either DeJasper or Roland. So we can meme in Discord? Uh, I don't know. I'd have to look it up. Sewer Goblin tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, we're going to ride along with Trixie, uh, a.k.a. Sewer Goblin tomorrow. training officer yes yes Trixie is a cadet she is brand new to police stuff we're gonna take her out show her how to do the job uh, we'll do that tomorrow I'll, uh, I'll check Neil's text in just a minute what happened to the painting stream it's gonna happen next week uh, over the weekend I'm gonna go out and buy the uh, supplies um, we can shoot for I don't know what day we're doing it yet, but I plan to buy all the supplies for this week, for this weekend. Um, and then we will just pick a day and uh, do the Bob Ross painting stream sometime next week. Glovin texted me. All right, there we go. Nine oh six, ten forty-two. We mean the presentation for the Baker unit. Um, well, Silas originally said Monday, and then he said, uh, "I'm gonna check Bryce's text real quick." Oh, hold on, let me check this. And then uh, he said, "We gotta present it on a day where you, Sticks, and uh, Ingvar are all together." He said, uh, "This is this is what Moose Beard said." Uh, you guys had a you guys had a couple good ones too. Oh gosh. Alright. Uh Bryce's text messages real quick. We're not going to call or text or do anything on Bryce. Honestly, at this point, Bryce should just sell the boys a house. We never use it. We don't touch it. It's just there. From of Bryce. Pepe laugh. Text three hours ago. So many texts. All right, hold on. Sorry about yesterday after prison. I have a lot of thoughts about a lot of things, and I'm not trying to make things a big deal for you when I know you just want to hang in and chill and whatnot. Let's hang tonight or something, or tomorrow. I don't know. Call me. Apology would respond, but I think I'm all GTA'd out right now. <laughs> Why is this out of focus? I better. I'm really.
Uh, I think I need to set up the uh, the Twitch extension for this. Forget how to do that though. Then I go to extensions, and then I activate it. Boom! It's activated. Okay, so we're gonna play a game called King of the Castle. This is your first time playing. Uh, how this game goes is it's a game that we play with chat. You don't need anything. You don't need any games or whatever. You literally just need to be in chat. Uh, it's a game that you guys will play against me, streamer, where I am a uh, monarch, and I am trying to rule the kingdom. Holy fuck, that was loud. I'm so sorry. And then you guys are regions of your own trying to gain power and overthrow me as the monarch. Um, we're going to have things that have that you guys can vote on and based on certain things that you vote on different outcomes will happen in the game um, it's very fun it's very interactive I've always had a lot of fun playing this game with you guys and we're going to start a new dynasty uh, we look badass I want to change our hair color Dope. Are there new clothes yet? Clean looking. Clean with it. Dynasty name is Chat Smells. Uh, we are he, him. Move this down here. Um, monarch name. Lord. Lord. Doctor Lord. Sir. So, Dr. Lord. So, Dr. Lord. Mm. Royal. So, Dr. Lord. Majesty. Fuck. Ted. King Royal, Sir Dr. Lord Ted of the Chat Smells. Dynasty. Royal Sir Dr. Lord Lucas. The chat smells dynasty. Solid. Gin. Uh, we're going to play on Twitch. I'm going to continue. Um, let's have... Let's have the barons. We'll have the counts. And we'll have the coast. Yeah. Coast has been in every game so far. What if we do barons, chiefs, and counts? Or no, not even counts. Because because the chiefs and the barons focus a lot on military. And so it'd be interesting to have a game with two really high military powers. The barons are brash rule lord famous for their belligerence and fondness for hunting. The chiefs are honorable warriors. Renowned. Yeah, okay. We'll do barons of the march, chiefs of the north, and grandees of the south. Let's do that. Chat, if you would like to join, I'm going to be AFK for just a minute. If you would like to join, 
read this line right here. You do exclamation join followed by uh, your pronouns that you would like to go by. Uh, you don't do the, the slash like he, him, just do the first one. So you can do exclamation he, exclamation she, exclamation they. Those are the three pronouns that they do for this game. Um, I'm gonna be AFK real quick. Join up, see what kind of uh, what region you guys are gonna be a part of. And we're gonna get started when I get back, okay? I'm excited, I'm excited. All right, we got a lot. Ooh, we've got like a perfect amount of people. Fourteen in each uh, each place. All right, we've got the barons of the march, the chiefs of the north, and the grandees of the south. We begin. We begin. All right, so for those of you that are new to this, how we play this game is you guys are gonna have a point system over here on the left side where you guys are gonna have things that you are good at and things that you are not good at. Uh, in order to overthrow me as the, uh, the monarch, uh, you have to complete three tasks throughout the game. Uh, these tasks can include, you know, uh, get the treasury under a thousand five hundred dollars. So you would try to pick things that would hurt my treasury or uh, Get your own personal trade up to eight in three turns or something like that uh, So you're gonna have goals and you're gonna need to work together as your group to try and get those goals to overthrow me as the monarch uh, The more we play the more you'll understand it. Let's get let's get in let's get in let's get to my coronation Let's get back to me 
I'm going to try and play this as serious as I can. So good luck. Your Majesty, I've scheduled your coronation to take place in a week's time. Shouldn't I be giving the orders now? Of course, Your Majesty. But to delay any longer would make the nobles restless. And when nobles get restless, they take their daggers and look for the nearest back. Uh, very well then. What must I do? As in tradition, the council will decide what happens at your coronation. Let's get this over with then. Shall we call the nobles in? Call the nobles in. This is you guys. How you vote during these turns is you do exclamation vote followed by the letter that you're voting with. Uh, and each vote has a different outcome to the things that, you know, that happen. Uh, for example, A brings the treasury down by a thousand, but it will bring the kingdom's stability up by one point. So, 30 seconds on the clock. A host a lavish parade with jugglers and fountains of wine. B proceed with a religious ceremony that honors the ninth god. C throw the king in the river. D outdated traditions. There's no need for a coronation at all. You may vote. 30 seconds. You guys always vote for C. I've, we've played this maybe like six times, five times. You've always voted for C. Moisten the king. Moisten the king. All right. You have voted to throw the king into the river. It is decided then. The king will be thrown into the river. The kingdom's stability went up by one point. The uh, authority went down uh, by... I'm going to bring this over here. We're going to bring that. We're going to bring that up too. Uh, the authority went up down by four. It is decided the king will be thrown into the river. What kind of coronation is that? A very traditional ceremony dating back to the Queen Alma the Wise. It's meant to represent you being reborn as a true king. The nobles pick you up and carry you out to the Treadwater River, hurling you into the shallow water with a cheer. When you climb back up the bank soaking wet, the Chancellor steps forward and places the crown upon your head. Is it your imagination or some of the nobles' stifling giggles? <laughs> council introduction. Chancellor, now that you're the king, your first duty is to meet with the Council of Nobles. Uh, your nobles hail from all across the kingdom, the wintry north, the scorching south, and of course, the bleak march. We'll introduce ourselves to the chief. Hey, look, it's Chief Stai. Uh, good luck in the days ahead, your highness. You'll need it, dealing with us lot. It's Grandy Grumbling Moblin. Uh, may the ninth god bless your reign, your highness. I trust you will conduct yourself with honor and faith. It's Baron Schnookums. <laughs> Hail and well met, your highness. Under your leadership, we'll whip this kingdom into shape. And Council Hall immediately fills with raised voices as the nobles argue with each other and demand your favor. You sigh and sit back. Is this what the council is like? No wonder your father told you to avoid the throne at all costs. Should have listened to dad. Your majesty, the first few years of your reign are the most difficult. You're new and unimproved. Uh, and unproven. The nobles of the council will scheme against you, hoping to kick you off the throne and put their own puppet claimant in your place. Those fools couldn't scheme their way out of a paper bag. Better kings than you have been topped by their treacherousness. Uh, nobles, your majesty. You, to defeat their schemes, you must secure an heir and prove that you are worthy of the crown by completing an ambition. Question is, when you die, how do you hope the kingdom will remember you? Okay, so we've done stability before. And we did faith, and faith was very hard to do. Stability's pretty good already. Authority's a challenge, though. As the architect of a new golden age... A conqueror. Trade could be interesting. Trade's pretty good, too. Let's try trade. I'm going to give myself a little bit of a challenge. A lofty goal, indeed. 
I suggest over the next few years, you're focused on improving the kingdom's overall trade as much as possible. Once you have an heir, I will return to discuss how your ambition is progressing. Good luck, your majesty. All right. Let's find out what your guys' goals are. Barons. Okay, after this cutscene, only barons are voting for this one. When have the barons of the march backed down from a fight? Never. I know you'll do whatever it takes to put me, your rightful king, onto the throne. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. You are voting on what you want your first goal to be. Uh, do you want to lower defiance? Do you want to lower others' military? Do you want to lower authority? The kingdom's authority is already out of four. Everyone's military is pretty solid. Or lowest defiance. Uh, I mean, everyone's defiance is at one already, too. So, I mean... Your guys' call. Okay. You guys have ordered lower authority. The Republic of Kurth has, has this substance called gunpowder. With enough of that, the barons can take over the kingdom. Of course, the sensible king would never allow one region to hoard such a thing. To do so secretly... The barons must ensure their trading partners don't fear the king's wrath. To advance their scheme, the barons must lower authority to four or less in two seasons. Barons, authority, four or less. Two seasons. That is your goal. A second. Okay. <clears throat> uh, Chiefs, you guys are going to be voting after this. So get ready. Chiefs of the North, we all know that I should be on the throne, not this imposter King Royal Sir Dr. Lord Lucas. How do we make that happen? Uh, raise authority, which would be interesting. Raise own military, which is already at a seven. Or lower all faith, which uh, the barons and the grandees have pretty high faith already. 15 seconds. Chiefs, you're voting. Five seconds. Guys have done to raise your own military for Ragnarok. The chiefs can plan to make an alliance with the ice giants to take over the kingdom. First, they must not be weak, or the giants won't take their proposal seriously. To advance their scheme, the giants, the chiefs must raise their military to five or more in three seasons. You guys are already at a seven. Uh, five or more in three seasons. The first, the first scheme is always pretty easy. The second and third one are hard. All right. Grandies, a false pretender occupies the throne while my claim is ignored. Grandies of the South, this is a stain on our honor. We must not allow it to go unanswered. You're voting, Grandies. Raise others' defiance. Everyone's at one. Highest faith. Uh, you guys have a seven. You guys currently have the highest faith. Or excommunication, which is lower stability. Stability's at a six. You got ten seconds. Three seconds. Figured you guys would vote for B. There's all sorts of hearsay in the capital, and the grandees intend to expose it. First, they must ensure the South is beyond reproach. To advance their scheme, the grandees must be the region with the highest faith in three seasons. Praise the sun. <laughs> all right. So, once again, from the top. Barons, you guys want the authority to be lowered to four or less in two seasons. Already out of four. Uh, Chiefs of the North, you guys want to raise your own military to at least five in three seasons. Already out of seven. 
And uh, Grandies, you guys want your highest faith in three seasons. You guys are at a seven, but the Barons are right behind you with a six. Good luck. All right. Let's set up our honor guard. Now that you are king, you need a personal protection. Why, I could plunge my sword into your heart right now. Could I not? I'd like to see you try. Is your imagination or does your martial stifle a wry chuckle? In any case, she quickly hides it. You need an honor guard to keep you safe from such dangers, your majesty. Unfortunately, this is a political decision. What are my options? Each region offers a selection of elite guards. The chiefs with their most famous warrior heroes. The grandies with the fierce battle nuns from the Sisterhood of Steel. So cool. And the barons offer a squad of battle-hardened veteran soldiers. Think carefully, your majesty. These guards' loyalty will be divided between you and their region. Of course, you could just hire foreign mercenaries. They'd be loyal to coin above all. Uh, tell me about the northern people. The sisters? I feel like I choose the sisters every single time for grandies because they're so cool. We'll see. Bearded oafs with axes and no manners. They'll get drunk and cause trouble in the palace. Okay, not them. No discipline at all, and I can't guarantee they won't run off on some random quest. But they're honorable, and in a fight, unbeatable. Uh, battle nuns. Terrifying warriors, and they've sworn a vow of silence, so at least they won't spill state secrets. But their faith and loyalty to the church above all. Even your safety. I'm about the march. These soldiers have fought more battles than they've had hot dinners. They'll be uncouth, no doubt. They won't adapt well to life in the palace, but they're loyal and tough as nails. Thorn mercenaries, a band of fearsome fighters from the Tattle Lands called the Battle Bitten Brethren. <laughs> they specialize in bodyguard work, but they're costly. Hiring foreigners will be considered an insult to all regions. I gotta go with the Barons, man. The Barons just sound like a great deal. Also because I always choose the battle nuns because they're so cool. How can I not? But the barons is a good choice, I think, for this run. I will make the arrangements at once. The, bar the march is now loyal to the kingdom and the uh, defiance rate has gone up one in the north and the south. Uh, the veterans arrive a few weeks later. They march into the throne room in perfect formation before lining up behind your throne. Hands on their sword hilts. Each soldier sports a bigger scar than the last. An untimely death. What's going on in the north, guys? You guys already having trouble? We just started the game. Oh my god. Murder. My father. <laughs> we just started and Chief Sifi's died. Chief Sifi 2 has joined the council. Murder. My father. Chief Sifi has been murdered and I know who did it. It was Grandy I Hate You chat by Morgana's Cauldron. Don't let him deny it. Oh my god. I won't deny that I killed the ven the venerable uh, Chief Sifi, but it was no murder. Sifi agreed to an honorable duel, which I won. Acts of my ancestors, it was no duel. It was a cold-blooded killing. What reason would my father possibly have to duel you in the first place? The reason for any duel is between a challenger and the challengee. A private matter not fit for this council. Okay, you guys got your first voting. Uh, a, hold a trial for Grandy. I hate you, chat. Defiance goes up. B, this Grandy is a danger to all. Imprison him. Defiance goes up and down depending on which region you are. C, the spy master should investigate to find evidence of this claim. Defiance goes up. D, a duel is a duel. Let the accused go free. Defiance goes up and down. I'm going to veto C. Let you guys, so you guys are only going to be able to vote A, B, or D. And you can start voting now. 30 seconds. Your votes start counting now. So if you did vote already, start voting right there. Five seconds, guys. Neck and neck for A and D. Did you guys vote in tied? Um, hmm. 
A duel's a duel, man. A duel's a duel. Fuck. The North is pissed. You would let a murderer walk loose even after he admitted to it? Right in this council chamber? Gods be good. The Norse's defiance has gone up by three. I'm glad the council respects the duelist code. Once agreed upon, a duel cannot be... Yep. Yep. At least the South is loyal to us now. Thank you for uh, preserving our Southern traditions, Your Highness. Uh, something going on in these grandies. The printing press. Your Highness, a blacksmith in the South has come up with some sort of printing contraption. Instead of relying on the painstaking effort of scribes, it produces a hundred copies of text an hour. How remarkable. Yes, your holiness. Isn't technology wonderful? Don't you see how dangerous this is? Books should stay in churches and universities, or else commoners will start getting ideas, says Chief Vengeful. A. Allow printing presses to be used by the masses. Uh, defiance goes up and down depending on region. Trade goes up. A th stability goes down for some reason. And so does authority. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, only the churches may use printing presses. There's a 50% chance that faith goes up. Uh, C. Only the university may use printing presses. A th stability goes up. Trade goes up. Farming goes up. An authority goes down. Or D, forbid the use of printing presses altogether. There's a 25% chance that that works. You may vote. I, I, these are all kind of like rough, man. At least these all like aren't good for me, I should say. Five seconds left. What are you guys tying at, man? Why do you guys keep tying? God. Okay. Okay. Authority is going to go down, but you know what? I'm going to get it back up. I'm going to get it back up because I want that trade to go up. I'm going to allow the printing presses to be used by the masses. Everyone should use this invention. You're going to regret this one day, your majesty. Ignorance is the only thing keeping the common folk in line. North is already at defiance of six, which is kind of scary, but you know what? Nonsense. You're just jealous, says Grandy X. In the end, both are right. The North develops a thriving publishing industry, but as more and more books are printed, radical ideas start to spread. Oh, God. But trade in the North is is prosperous. It went up by three. Ideas like maybe peasants deserve rights, and should we even have a king at all? Oh, gosh. I give you guys printing presses, and this is what you guys do? Stability went down. Authority went down, but trade looks amazing. Okay, uh, this is an auction. You guys all have a thousand gold. Every now and then we have an auction that you can vote for by if you do exclamation fund, the letter that you want to vote on, and then the amount that you want to spend. The top two people, the top two things that have the most money end up getting voted for. Uh, barons, you can vote to lower military or lower authority. Uh, chiefs, you can vote to, uh, lower farming or raise military. Grandies, you can vote to raise faith or lower stability. You can start voting now. It's for a minute. Also, what's good, seagulls or birds? True. True and real. You guys can see how much they're funding to see if how much like you want to uh to raise stuff up dude authority's already gonna go down to zero like really quickly i feel like <laughs> we 
This isn't good. I forget if I lose if one of my things goes down to zero. I gotta get authority up. Time's up. <clears throat> Fuck. Uh, okay, so faith in the grandees went up by one and authority went down by one in the barons. You guys voted, like, did all of your money. Jesus. Uh, and the North is on the verge of rebellion already. Cool. Okay, finding a spouse. In these twisty passages of the castle, you can avoid your advisors, the nobles, even the spy master. But there's one person you can't avoid. My mom. Why haven't you found a spouse yet? It's been almost a year. I've been busy. You better find the time. Don't worry, I'll take the liberty of finding eligible candidates. What is your preference? Men, women, or do you not mind? Women. Excellent. I'll send out messengers to the most influential noble families in the kingdom. Let's see what they have to offer. Our chief was murdered? It was a duel. It was consensual. This morning you'll be cutting the ribbon on the new library, then giving a speech at the gardening festival. I prepared some inoffensive jokes about flowers for you. Tell me a flower joke. Someone's been secretly adding concrete to the, so to the soil in my garden. The plot thickens. Oh, relax, everyone. I'm just pulling your leg. I think these jokes are deflorable. Very good, Your Majesty. See how I laugh. Hang on, is there a council meeting today? Why, yes, Your Majesty. Uh, but the nobles told me you weren't attending council meetings anyways. They said you were happy to let them decide the matters. They're trying to cut me out of the ruling my own kingdom? Oh dear, quick. Let's out to the council hall. We might catch them before the session starts. Oh, your majesty, forgive me for not bowing. We didn't expect to see you here today. What's the meaning of this, Chief Timokid? Timotikos. Don't take offense, your highness. We thought you'd be relieved to have the reins of power taken from you. <laughs> I'm your king, damn it. By the old gods, your highness, anyone could see that you're not fit to rule. Let us take care of things from now on. Would that be so bad? You see what happens when the kingdom's already at one for authority? Order Chief Timoko's beheaded for... <laughs> Have Chief thrown in the dungeons. You know what? How dare he? How dare he? I'm getting him beheaded. As Chief Timo is drafted, dragged away, begging and pleading, you turn and see that the other nobles are bowing and scraping before you. My authority has gone up to four, but the defiance of the North has gone up to eight. Timo has died. Timo II has joined the council. I want you guys to know that, okay? This is... This is what's gonna happen if you guys try and go against me, okay? You guys can... You guys can rebel? If you want to in the north, with exclamation rebel. Costly crossbows. <laughs> As you're walking beside the palace parade grounds, a crossbow bolt whizzes past your head and shatters against the wall behind you. Who do we have to kill? Baron Carly Cartoons approaches. <laughs> Out of breath and waving frantically, they have a sleek, fancy-looking crossbow nestled in one hand. Great God, your highness. I nearly took your head off. What in the seven hells are you doing with that? Tell me in five words or less why I shouldn't have you executed. Um, I didn't mean to 
Fingers slipped. Damn, that was six, wasn't it? It was like seven. Sorry to scare you. I just wanted to show you this crossbow. You can shoot three bolts a minute. Sorry. Responding to a DM. Uh, and punch through Ashmedian armor at 500 yards. Beautiful, isn't she? Trouble is, to appreciate such accuracy and power, she needs to be crafted from Springwood. It grows only in the forests of the north, and those northern bastards charge... Ex wow. Exorbitantly for it. What does this mean have to do with me? The barons of the march are guarding your borders, your highness. And yet, we can't afford to buy the weapons we need. If you want to keep your kingdom safe, the chiefs must stop price gouging. Your Highness, this is outrageous. These barons just want to bargain. <laughs> okay, A, put a price cap on the sale of Springwood. Defiance goes down probably in the barons and up in the, within the north. Uh, trade goes down. Money goes down in the north. And uh, military goes up. B, order the chiefs to send Springwood to the barons for free. C, refuse to limit the free market. Or D, plant a Springwood tree in the march. There's a 40% chance that that works. Uh, <sighs> I'm going to veto... B. And let you guys vote on A, C, or D. Carly, you're starting a war. 30 seconds, chat. A, C, or D. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. You guys voted to put a price cap on the sale of Springwood. <laughs> At this price, you're practically telling us, give away our precious Springwood. There's no profit. What are we supposed to do? Starve, <laughs> says Chief Moobies Fun Ploy. Defiance in the North has gone up to nine. Defiance in the March is at zero. Obviously, the Chiefs don't starve, but their trade suffers. Trade went down by one. God damn it. Some Chiefs' wealth has decreased. Meanwhile, the Barons are thrilled with their shiny new crossbows, and the military has gone up by one. Wow. I see 15 of you guys have voted to rebel. <clears throat> Amidst dark and foreboding forests, a small squat castle stands watch over the marcher borders. There at the end of the kingdom, a plot is hatching. Look here, says Baron Blah, our first shipment from Kurth. Baron Alphotron says, incredible, may I see inside? Careful with that torch, you fool. You'll blow us to smithereens. So this is the fabled black powder, says Herman. Incredible powerful. We'll need much, much more to put you on the throne. For the next stage, the Barons scheme. They must raise their trade to five or more in four seasons. So the Barons have completed their first task. And now for your second task, Barons, you need to get it to five or more in four seasons. Uh, and your trade's already at five. Which is good, because I need trade too. So, we're going to work together, guys. Okay. After a skirmish with the Ice Giants, the Chiefs loot 500 wealth, and other nobles gain 200 wealth. Uh, I'm going to tax. I'm going to do common tax for the kingdom.
Taxes are due. Uh, so the North is currently rebelling. Loyalists, I want you to see who this is. The North, uh, the, the Barons of the March and the Grandies of the South are with me. I've never, we haven't had a game this soon where you guys have rebelled already. Opening strike. <laughs> Fucking hell. Too long have those bastards in the crown lands held us down. Too long have they called us heathens and mocked our way of life, says Chief Stevens Mom 12. Chief Paxman says, I. <laughs> now is the time to take up our axes and fight back. Morgana is with us. We'll burn their churches and string up their lying priests. I. Now I ask you, brave chiefs of the free north. Where will we strike first? Chiefs, you're voting on this, I assume. It's been a week, too, guys. It's been a week. Okay, relax. Uh, we can launch a preemptive strike against the barons to cripple the military cap uh, capabilities. If we suspect the barons may join our cause, we can call them to the war. They'll be more likely to join us if the king's authority is low. Or finally, we could send off an assassin to nip this in the bud. Dishonorable, of course, but convenient. Okay. A, there's a 50% chance A works. 10% chance that this causes defiance. Minus 750 wealth to send an assassin after the king. A, B, or C. What you guys doing, huh? What you guys doing? I'm very surprised that you guys didn't send an assassin out to the king. I am very surprised. The chiefs launched a surprise attack on the march, slashing and burning their way across fields and farmlands. Before they can get too far, however, the marcher army springs in ambush, catching the northern soldiers totally unaware. Loyalist points go up by one for the kingdom. The Norse military goes down by one. And the March's farming goes down by one because you guys fucked up their farms. Damn. Huzzah! No mercy for traitors. Long live the king, says Baron Michael D. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. The Northern Army are forced into a disorderly retreat back to their own land, losing demoralized troops to ambush and desertion along the way. Good fight, guys. GG's. For the king. Rebellion. At long last, the chiefs have reached their boiling point. You are confronted in your throne room by Chief Rachel, her tattoos seeming to shift in light of the braziers. The chiefs of the north will rip that false crown from your head and stomp it into the mud. We will be fighting for glory, for honor, and for Jorah, the true monarch. Authority and stability go down by one. This is a formal declaration of war. The next time we see each other, we'll be on the battlefield. Seize her? One day I will see your head on a spike. Oh, I mean... <laughs> seize her? Come along now, traitors. Traitors get the chop. What? But you can't do this. I am an envoy, see? See how the king's tyranny grows worse by the day? Stability goes down by one. Defiance goes up to ten in the north. Your watchmen waste no time. Chief Rachel is dragged out into the courtyard and her head is struck from her soldiers. So for her shoulders. I didn't expect him to move so boldly, your majesty. Dang. This is what happens when you go against the king. This is what happens. Chief Rachel has died. Rachel II has joined the council. What are our chances against the rebe rebels? <laughs> the chiefs are formidable, but they're not undefeatable. I hope they don't pers uh, persuade any other regions to join the rebellion. That would be disastrous. How did things get so bad? The leader of the rebellion is Chief Stevens Mom 12. As reason for the uprising, he's citing your history of petty transgressions against the chiefs. Is it too late to apologize? Urge to murder rising. Anybody? You know what? 
The two people that have come to attack us, we have beheaded both of them. So you know what? We're just going to keep doing it. Yes, your majesty. Hold on to that feeling. You'll need it. So this is it. Civil war. That's right, your majesty. The kingdom is divided. There will be a lot of death and suffering before all of this is over. This, this, this run has been exciting so far. I can't wait. I'll go dig out the, the tribute. Oh my gosh. Eligible options. While this is happening, we're going to find a wife. I have found two potential matches for you. Obviously, the ongoing rebellion has limited our options. In any case, I found an eligible young woman from each of the kingdom's loyal regions. You're in desperate need of securing an alliance right now. Choose wisely. Your mother leads you to the Great Hall where she arranged two portraits on easels. For now, each is covered by a cloth. She whisks away the cloth from the first portrait. On the south, Vina, the eldest daughter of the Alo Fetza, uh, Fetva lineage. She's reputed to have an ego the size of the sun, but there's nothing wrong with confidence, right? She's an obsessive gambler, a pastime frowned upon in the south, it's been the cause of some scandal. The most common criticism of her is that she sometimes skips ch church. Okay. And finally, we have the March's offering Emmy, scion of the prestigious Prestalurk bloodline. A timid woman, not the kind that does well in the March. Bless her. Perhaps the palace will suit her better. She's had a meaningful encounter with a wizard a few years ago, and now she spends most of her time brewing strange potions. <laughs> she was high up in the army training the troops, but was dishonorably discharged for some reason. I don't know who to pick, man. I don't know who to pick. I guess, I guess Grandy's. Grandy's? Since we're, we're we're kind of a crazy king right now, what do you think? Of course, by picking Canada, you'll anger the other region, but they'll gain a lifelong alliance. Okay, so Vina, Vina's just kind of really egotistical, but she has a crazy gambling problem. Emmy is timid. And a crazy strong military presence. But... Was dishonorably discharged and hung out with a wizard. And technically... You know, the march is right underneath the north, so the north is going to try and attack the march first. So we need them on our side. And there's magic. Fuck it. We're going, we're going, with, we're going with Emmy. We're going with Emmy. Excellent. I'll make the arrangements. For the kingdom. The picture is castle. Overlooking the southern city of Calaville. Two grandies lie back to enjoy the sun. Praise be, whispers of our plan have reached the peasants, and they are in an uproar. They call for the sins of the king to be laid bare. Uh, your faith went up by one, grandies. I already have leads on information from inside the palace that we can use against the king. It's only a matter of time, says grandy Johnny Michael. Grandy Ulgal. Uh, says, and during this rebellion, I expect it'll be easier than ever to root our dirty secrets. For the next stage of their scheme, the Grandies must raise others' religion. Oh, sorry, not religion. Other regions' defiance to a combined total of at least eight. Or ensure the current rebellion is still ongoing. Well, fuck. You guys are... You... <laughs> Damn. Time to make good with the North. Damn. Fuck. 
Okay, this is for me. Okay, uh, we have one victory point for the kingdom. Uh, the rebellions, the north is still re re rebelling. <sighs> An arms merchant. Your majesty. A merchant is here to sell to see you. He has come all the way from Kurth, I hear. I hope he has something useful to sell me. Yes, I believe he does. Your luminance. So wonderful to see you. I hope that you and your council are well. Yes, we're doing well. You'll be pleased to know that the Kurth Senate have deliberated for many weeks and ultimately agreed to extend you the offer of an arms contract. We are at war. Not just any contract, mind you. The Republic has offered to sell gunpowder weapons, muskets, cannons, blunderbusses, bombards, you name it. I have it. What have you got? I've got everything your heart could desire. Ooh. Blunderbusses. Cannons will be helpful, I imagine. Muskets will always be useful. Mortars. Those will do nicely. Bombards. I need bombards. No, you guys, nobody's, nobody's lost yet. Nobody's lost yet. Everybody can still win. He's attacking us. The North are attacking us. It's not like they're going to have boats or anything. So cannons wouldn't make sense because the North doesn't use boats, really. They're just going to attack the march. Muskets. Muskets. What are blunderbusses again? Those are the pistols, right? No, blunderbuss bus Blunderbusses is the uh, the short large caliber caliber. Honestly, let's get some muskets. Muskets you say? We'll have your whole army outfitted before the month's end. It's 900 for those. And cannons. Of course. Mount them on your ships, or we'll... Wheel them into battle. They're as versatile as they are deadly. I'll add that to your total. I'm finished. Simply sublime. In that case, your total is a 1,900. Perfect. Here you go. Most wonderful indeed. I thank you for your patronage. Once the merchant has left, it's up to you to distribute your newfound uh, armaments to your loyalists. We'll give the cannons to the grandees. No. Yes? I'm trying to think of this. The north is going to attack the barons first. We'll give the cannons to the barons. I don't know how to, how to play this. The grannies are by the ocean, but so is March. We'll give the cannons to the barons because they need the biggest one. And then we'll give the muskets to the grandies. You can only hope the new weapons will be enough to finally win the war. Damn. A royal wedding. The Civil War cast a shadow of your wedding. Instead of being a joyful public holiday, the day arrives without much pomp or ceremony. This is this has been a crazy run so far. Still, all your loyal nobles have arrived in the capital to keep up appearances. Soon enough, you're standing in St. Bertrand's Cathedral with Emmy at your side. Do you take this woman as your lawfully wedded wife? 
you know what? I do. Then I pronounce you king and queen. After the wedding, of course, there's a feast. And after the feast, a dance. Your new wife, Emmy, turns bright red every time a toast is called in her honor. Stability has gone up. Authority has gone up. By the time you find yourself alone with Emmy, it's past midnight, and you've never felt more tired. Um, hello. Hello. Nice... <laughs> nice weather for it. The wedding, I mean. You both lapse into strained silence. Emmy gulps back her wine. Oh, God. <laughs> so tell me about yourself. Not much to tell, really. And I'm not sure you'd understand. Um, Basically, I like to study the fundamental elements. She lapses into silence again. All attempts to get her to talk more prove fruitless, and eventually she makes her excuses and heads to the spare bedchamber. Uh, a, a, a great battle. <laughs> Vast armies darken the landscape like the shadows of clouds. Flags are flying. Drums are pounding in rhythm with the marching of boots. The kingdom is griped with civil war. Gripped. At least, that's what you imagine. Most of your time is spent in the safety of your palace, pouring over a giant map with your marshal. Your majesty, the army of the north is advancing on the capital. Led by that treacherous church chief, Stephen's mom, 12. Oh, wait. The barons do not lick boots. We will kill the king. Wow. You guys are licking boots right now, okay? You are a loyalist and you guys are going to like it. Alternatively, they could join forces with the Army of the March. It's risky, but together they'd have a higher chance of defeating the uh, accursed chiefs. What are your orders, Your Majesty? Wait, the Grandies and the Barons should join forces? Tell the Grandies to fight the Northerner Army head on. Okay, here's my thought process. Here's my thought process. If we tell them to fight together, then we leave one thing bare. We leave the grandies bare. You know what? Together. Very well, your majesty. I'll rely on your orders to grandy the nan, the commander in the field. Hopefully they do as they're told. God knows treachery can thrive on a battlefield. We have our orders, but should we follow them? Grandy the nan says. 30 seconds. A, defy orders and send the southern army to fight the rebels. B, follow orders and link up with the barons. C, hang back and let the rebels march on the capital without challenge. Whoa! Grandies are only ones voting for this. A, B, or C. Uh, 12, 12 seconds. You guys got to vote, Grandies. <laughs> wow. Wow, 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 wow. Hang back and let the rebels march on the capital without challenge. The whole city holds its breath. You stew in your palace, waiting anxiously for your marshal's return. Finally, she bursts into your throne room. Those damned cowards. Cravens. Treacherous, yellow-bellied, lily-livered chicken hearts. Bastards. You, wow. All right, all right, all right. Noted, noted. Marshall, report. You guys got three victory points for that? Oh my God. Instead of engaging the enemy or linking up with the barons, the Grandies told their armies to just hang back, do nothing. Rebels gained three victory points. The South, so de uh, Defiance went up by two and the kingdom went down by one. You guys want to let the, you guys want to let the chiefs win in rebellion? Is that what's going on? They sat pretty in their camp and scratched their arses while the entire northern army walked on by. I'll have their heads for this, if you win, which now looks less likely. You have no choice but to rely on the barons. It'll all come down to the next battle, your majesty. The fate of the kingdom hangs on the balance. 
we will prevail. That's the spirit. Now I really must be going. I have a lot to take care of. This has been the craziest run that we've had so far. There is war left and right. I gave you guys, I gave you guys weapons. Fuck, dude. Barons are going to probably win. I can't believe you guys got three victory points for that one. The final battle, dude. The marshals stride in, her face streaked with mud and sweat. Had some trouble in the last skirmish, your majesty. Oh, ninth god. What happened? When our cavalry charged, those rebel bastards lined up their pikes and just waited. It wasn't pretty. Some of our soldiers got away. Most of the horses didn't. This is a problem. I've been exchanging diplomatic messages with the Ashmedian Empire. They're willing to donate war thoroughbreds to the, ca to the cause. It's in their interest to keep the kingdom's leadership consistent, your majesty. I have a question. What have I done as king to make you guys want to rebel like this, huh? Huh? I've been a good king. I've been a fair king. I've been, I helped all of you guys out. And the yell and 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 grandies, you rebelled for what? For what, huh? For what? I don't trust them. They want us in their debt. I suggest we send scouts into northern ter territory and steal horses from their foremost equestrian, Chief Lazy Turtle 212. That would be dangerous, Marshal. Perhaps we could purchase the Grandy's horses. Grandy Adventure Girl has decent herds. No, nothing from the Grandy's. Ah, all you want is handshakes and greasy palms. This is war, not a country fair. You guys have to vote? Send a diplomatic envoy to Ashmedian, to Ashmead, asking for their help. Hey, Grandy Adventure Girl for their horses. Steal horses from Chief Lazy Turtle. There's a 25% chance that that works. All right, you can vote 30 seconds. I already know what the grandies are going to vote for. Hmm. All right, well, stability went up by one because I used the thing. I, oh my God, we're losing all of our money. This is not looking good for the kingdom. You guys are being shitheads. Grandy Adventure, Adventure Girl is all too eager to provide her horses for the war effort. The cash doesn't hurt either. Kingdom stability went up by one. We got a victory point. Uh, the treasury went down by a thousand. We're hurting for money. The South has uh, Adventure Adventure Girl gained so much money and defiant. You guys are loyal now. You guys are loyal. You're loyal. You're loyal. Soon after the horses are brought to the capital, the marshals take them out for the first skirmish. I wasn't sure if these southern horses would be right for our situation, but they're really decent. We surprise the enemy and they scatter like the cowards they are. She bangs a fist on the table for emphasis. Servants scurry to pick up the scattered papers. Oh, sickness is spreading. Sickness is spreading in the south. Oh no. Are you guys, are you guys sick in the south? Should I? Should I help you? No, I'm not going to help you guys. You guys bailed on me in war. Your majesty, a terrible sickness is spreading amongst my troops. What kind of sickness? We've done a lot of digging. And a lot of latrines. And a lot of graves. What can we do about it? Get away from me. Calm yourself, your holiness. I don't have it. If we let the disease run its course, we'll have lost a lot of soldiers. We can't afford to lose. Oh, no! But I'm not sure how much we can do. Perhaps the council can see a way forward? Oh, never mind. Oh, I can just decide which one. 
Quarantine the diseased and order the healthy to leave them behind. Do nothing to stop spreading the sickness. <laughs> wow. I'm just going to use this little veto button and I'm going to veto C. And we're just going to do nothing to stop the sickness from spreading. You guys can vote. You guys can vote. So that picture, that picture, Carly. <laughs> you guys did it to yourself. You guys did it to yourself. By all that is holy, how could the council, and you're getting blamed for it, be so blind we have to do something but nothing is done oh fuck rebels gained a point well damn I wouldn't have done it if the rebels would but nothing is done the sickness blazes through the southern troops like a forest fire by the time it's done the dead outnumber the living the military has gone down to two you know what I'm okay with that I'm okay with that I'm okay with that. After the hideous cowardice of the Grandies, our last hope is the Barons. They're all that stands between the capital and the Northern Army. Victory will be ours. I'll send word to the Barons that it's time to strike. We can only hope they listen to our orders, Your Majesty. Barons. Hey, send the Marcher Army to fight the Rebels. There's an 80% chance that you win that fight. B, hang back and let the rebels march on the capital without challenge. Do you guys want to fight? Do you guys want to fight? We got to lead ourselves to victory, guys. For the kingdom. For the kingdom. Your marshals ride out with your orders, leaving you to wait anxiously for the outcome of the battle the next few days are agony when she finally returns she strides into your throne room with a triumph of gleam in her eyes marshal report we lured the chiefs into a forest that we'd scouted ahead of time while their column was stretched out we sprung an ambush it was an utter slaughter we chased them through the forest for days Carrying them relentlessly. Eventually, they made their final stand on a hilltop, but by that point, they had lost all morale. Authority went up to four. Loyalist points went up to five. <laughs> Military is now mediocre in the north. The crows ate well these last few days. Let me tell you, I haven't seen that many corpses since I was a little girl. Not going to question that. A little weird. So we've won. It seems so, your majesty. I don't think the chiefs have much life fight left in them. All that's left is m m mopping up. Whew. This is a crazy run. Crazy, crazy run. Alright. There's an auction. Uh... Trade goes up for the the um the barons for A. Authority goes down by one with B for the barons. <clears throat> Faith goes up by one for the chiefs. Military goes down by one for the chiefs. Grandees farming goes down with E. Trade goes down with F. You can start the auction. Remind her that Adventure Girl has so much money. So much money.
Looks like A and B are gonna win right now. There's a there's a large gap. Like three thousand dollars, three thousand coins worth in this gap. All right, your trade goes up by one, and your authority goes to three. Wait, does this mean we won the rebellion? This was close. This was so close. The war's end. Rebel army has crumbled. I've ordered a massive push into their land, looting and pillaging the whole way. As we speak, your majesty, our armies are slaying siege to Chief Stephen's mom, Twelve's fortress. We'll make the chiefs pay for their betrayal. I'll leave that up to you. First off, I need to go siege a bloody castle. Victory! The marshal rides back out to oversee the siege. A few days later, you receive word that Chief Stephen's mom, 12's castle has fallen. And just like that, the rebellion is over. Soon the armies of the grandees and the barons are parading through the city, waving their banners and showing off their loot. Trade in the south has gone up by one. Trade in the march has gone up by one. The grandee's wealth has increased. The grand, the baron's m wealth has increased. Meanwhile, Chief Stephen's Mob 12, the leader of the rebellion, is brought to you in chains. Common folk crowd into the palace to watch the trial. We fought with honor. Our ancestors smile on us for resisting your tyranny. I sentence Chief Stevens' mom, 12, to death. Stiff-backed and silent, Chief Stevens' mom, 12, is dragged out to the city square. In the square, damn. And led up onto a platform before the roaring masses. The executor's axe falls. The head bounces into the crowd. And the common folk kick it around and cheer. Jesus Christ. Chief Stephen's mom, 12, has died. Chief Stephen's mom, 12, the second, has joined the council. And just like that, the North is defeated. The rebellion is over. The kingdom is mine again. The defiance goes down all the way to one. The military goes all the way to one. And everyone is loyal. As you sit... Resplendent, atop your throne, the common folk raise a mighty cheer. Long live the king, they shout. Long live the king. The kingdom's authority goes up to six. The stability goes up to seven. Oh. Somewhere in a dark cellar, a nervous baron is showing his guests a stupendous cache of explosive gunpowder. Behold, says Baron Blah. Great God, says Alphotron. By my life, black gold dust. And what are those? Cannons, my good friend. Cannons and muskets, too. Courtesy of the Republic of Kurth. Much more than the king brought from that merchant. I gave you cannons. What the fuck are you guys talking about? They were very happy with our business. I gave you cannons. I gave you cannons. Ungrateful. Military went up to 10. Now to decide what to do with all of it. Once we show our hand, there's no going back. 30 seconds. A. Sneak the gunpowder under the palace and blow them all sky high. You raise stability. Or B. Put all these cannons and muskets to good use. You raise your own military power. Barons, A or B? <clears throat> A or B? You gave us like two? Oh my god. How's it going, Roll? It was a tie and it just chose on its own. Put all these cannons and muskets to good use. 
Raise your own military. <clears throat> With these explosive weapons, we'll be unstoppable on the battlefield. But we need to make sure we have the troops to use them. Then we'll step up our recruitment so we're ready when the time comes. I'll get to it. For the final stage of the Baron scheme, the Barons must keep their military at 10 for one full season. Fuck. Damn, dude. I mean, you guys are already at 10. Far to the north where snow blankets the landscape and wolves howl in the night. The chief's plot to bring about the end of the world. Ragnarok. What happened to your clan's warriors, Sinjema? Your lot looks like they'd uh, rather be baking cakes, says Chief Izakiti. It's been a hard year for recruiting, but we're working on it. Aye, you'd better, or those ice giants will sooner laugh at us than help us. The chief's aim to raise their military to at least five. So you still you still want to raise uh, your military to five. Chiefs Chiefs have had a rough this round. See the grandies deep in the south. The grandy paces back and forth along the balcony on the hillside villa. I'm told that progress is slow. How could they be so blind, trusting in that fool of a king after everything he's done? I've been so good to you guys. I've been so good to you guys. The grandies' aim is to raise other regions' combined defiance to eight or more. Good luck with that. Uh, <laughs> or sure, another region starts a rebellion. Good luck with that too. Wow, the grannies have a lot of money. Let's tax them. End season. <clears throat> that was so rude. You know what was rude? You know what was rude? When I asked you guys to go into battle with me and you let the North come into our territory and you just stayed in the South. I remember. <laughs> Tax the sick. <laughs> and you're sick. Oh, your marriage to Emmy has grown stale. Oh, you get along well enough and you've made some good memories together, but there's, there's no spark. She cares more about her stupid alchemy, al alchemical experiments. Isn't it alchemy? I've never heard of alchemical. All right, though. Experiments, then your happiness. But spark or no spark, you still need an heir. Congratulations are in order. The royal wedding was a magnificent affair. Not really. It went well. You're still in power, aren't you? Still got the crown on your head. That's all that matters. You've done well so far, but there's something still missing. An heir. You need someone young whose loyalty is assured. A child of your own would be a, do the trick, even if they're a bastard. Or the youngest of your many cousins. We can fix our marriage. And my wife and I will have a child together. Ah, the traditional method. No one will object on that. I'll arrange for you to take a month off from ruling so you can <laughs> get down to business. Bankruptcy looms. The treasury is almost empty, your highness. What do you suggest we do? Apart from raising taxes, we have precious few options. You could get a bank loan or sell off the crown jewels, or perhaps crack open some of your uh, presidors' tombs. Most were buried with piles of gold, so I heard. Yo! Time to crack open some tombs. <laughs> I own the royal mint, don't I? Make more coins. Wait, I can just make coins? I feel like that's gonna come back to backfire. <laughs> 10,000 coins. <laughs> Think I have to loan. Sell off some royal. I'm not doing that one. I'm not taking a loan. I'm between cracking open tombs and <laughs> making. <laughs> it's called inflation. You know what? Let's see what happens. I'll, I'll fuck it. 10,000. 
The royal mint. <laughs> oh, shit. Begins churning out new coins, allowing you to pay off several old debts. That's, that's going to come back to bite us in the ass. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. Your holiness, you recall those gunpowder weapons you gifted us not long past? A number of my fellow grandees have suspicions. There were a few accidents with all the black powder, and well, they're saying the weapons are the work of the seventh god. Demonic tools that will only do harm. They're afraid of them? Uh, I was hoping you could dispel these rumors, your holiness. Perhaps the archbishop might help. A, have the archbishop arm the clergy. Faith goes up, military goes up, authority goes up. Take the southern weapons and destroy them. Defiance goes up. Military goes down. Let them sort it out on its own. Military goes down. Stability goes down. A, B, or C. <laughs> this run's been wild. <clears throat> wow. Have the Archbishop arm the clergy. An unorthodox move, but the Archbishop is more than happy to oblige. Stability went up in the kingdom by one. Before long, it is not uncommon to see bishops armed with flintlock pistols and muskets. Some priests start opening ceremonies with symbolic shots into the sky. Wow. Uh, okay, faith in the north goes up by one. Faith in the march goes up by one. Faith in the south goes up by one. Military in the south goes up by one. And authority in the kingdom goes up by one. The kingdom's looking strong and powerful, man. Strange customs involving gunpowder and pistols work their way into the church of the ninth god. Some of which may even stand... The test of time. Meanwhile, the grandees soon forget their initial suspicions and begin jealousy guarding the weapons as religious artifacts. <sighs> Ooh. If nobles vote for the monarch's choice, they gain 500 personal wealth. Nice. Please, everyone, do quiet down one at a time. It starts as, as a day like any other. The grandees are arguing with the chiefs over something important, you assume. You had trouble keeping your eyes open through the whole thing. That is, until the marshal breaks into the room, waving a sealed letter in the air. Your Majesty, esteemed nobles, I hold in my hand a proclamation from the barons of the march. You will want to hear this. Go on, man. We, the undersigned, declare the monarchy in its council unfit for perp for purpose. Pose. Uh, being unable to guide and safeguard the kingdom in these dangerous times. Look at the stability. Look at the authority. Look at the treasury. We defeated the north. What do you want from us? For me and us. Me and us. Uh, as such, we hereby proclaim the creation of a new military government which will take effect immediately. Any resistance will be met with full force of the march. Your Majesty, this letter has gone out to every town and city in the kingdom, to every noble and mayor and peasant alike. As the council chamber catapults itself into a frenzy, you notice the baron's benches. Oh my goodness. They're empty. Your Majesty, Allow us to put down these treacherous dogs. It would be my pleasure, says Grandy Bull. Nonsense. Allow us the honor. The chiefs stand ready to assist you, your highness, says Chief Lanku. Yeah, I bet you guys are ready to assist us after the ass kicking you guys had. You will have the honor of destroying my enemies, Grandy Bull. Chief Lanku is right. The chiefs will go. Ugh. <sighs> 
not taking any chances. You will fight together. You guys are going to fight together. They grumble about it, but agree. Within days, armies are raised and ready to fight. What could have possessed the barons to go this far? Surely they don't believe they can go up against the rest of the kingdom. As it turns out, that's exactly what they were thinking. When the first reports come back from the front, the southern and northern troops are fearful, even traumatized by the barons' military might. The south's military goes down to one, the north's military goes down to zero. God damn it. Cannons and muskets, they, they tore through my soldiers like they were paper. It was a bloodbath. But don't we have some of our own? Some of your majesty, but not this many. The barons have amassed a horde unmatched by any army anywhere on this continent. There's nothing we can do. The barons were hoarding gunpowder right under our noses. Just what they needed to seize the throne by force. Within a week, the loyalist forces are decimated. And your marcher enemies are closing in. I'll just, I'll just buy more weapons. This is worse than I'd imagine, your majesty. We simply cannot compete with these weapons. Authority went down by two. Stability went down by two. What are your orders? Everyone for themselves. We stand and fight for the last. I must evacuate the palace. We stand and fight to the last. 50% chance this works. They look to each other. Fuck. As if having a private conversation in complete silence. I think not, your majesty. What? Your reign is coming to an end. It would be foolish to throw away the lives of your people in vain attempt to retain control. Call for your honor guard. Our honor guards, the barons. We're, de we're done. It's over. It's over. You call out for your honor guards, but your marshal orders them to take you to the dungeons instead. You're tossed in a cell that you have never seen before. The barons flood the capital by the end of the week or so. I could have bought more guns. I, could, I had 10,000 gold. I could have bought more guns. Or so your jailers tell you. You expect them to be dragged into public for an execution, but you remain in your cell. After what feels like months, you start to think they forgot about you. Finally, however, you're brought up to the council chamber in... in <laughs> they parade you in front of the other nobles like performing animal. Baron Hairman sits on the throne. Loyal councilmen, kill these treacherous barons and free your king. Be quiet, Hairbrain. You're not the one who gives the orders anymore. So dumb. So dumb. That's when you realize they won't get rid of you. You're far more useful alive as a jolly figurehead to keep the peasants in check and ensure a sense of continuity. At least until the new King Herman has cemented his rule. It's good you already got to know a few of the rats in your cell. You'll be spending many long years in their company by the looks of things. <sighs> I was so good to you guys. I was so good to you guys. King Royal Sir Dr. Lord Lucas was kept in the dungeons as a hostage until he finally outlived his usefulness and was quietly fed some poisoned gruel. The chief's agreement with the ice giants fell apart and the giants ended up attacking the north instead. The subsequent war kept the chiefs too busy to worry about matters of the throne. The grandees continued to throw accusations of witchcraft and hearsay at their enemies. Everyone gradually learned to ignore them. With their shiny new guns, the barons secured uh, hegemony over the rest of the kingdom and installed Herman as an unquestioned king, at least until the bullets ran out a few years later. Good, I'm glad you guys only had a few years reign. King Sir, King Royal Sir Dr. Lord Lucas the Rich. I didn't even get to have a, uh, a successor, man. Wealthiest noble, adventure girl. Horace Noble, Rachel. <laughs> Dude, the kingdom... Ugh. The kingdom was strong and good. The problem is... what, uh, Dude, we... Uh, we gave the barons so much military to take over the chiefs. And then when we got rid of the chiefs, the barons just said, Fuck it, and took us over. That was a good game, though. That was a good game. There was a rebellion, and we won it. And I've never had that much... Uh, in the treasury your wife was for us was from us the barons yeah that's true 
That's true. You printed money? I'm the king. I could do whatever. Man. We, kill, we killed a lot of people as king. We did a lot of fuck shit as king, too. We infiltrated the castle hard. You guys did. <laughs> you guys did. I still never forget the grandies not sending in troops and then us just letting the sick and then calling for us for help because of the sickness. We could have been something. We could have we had something. Damn. GG's. GG's, man. I was good. That was a good game. Baron's having 10 trade already it was big. You guys were smart to vote on that one for the last one. As a Baron, I'd love to offer to buy a beer for King Lucas and Queen McLovin sometime as consolation true deal. A pity beer. Who won? Uh, the Barons of uh, the Barons did. The Barons won, but it was a very close game between all regions and the kingdom, too. I was close. Barons absolutely wrecked. You guys were a powerhouse from the very beginning. Absolutely. We brought you into the kingdom as our guards, and we married into the Baron family. We gave you guys weapons, money, everything. And you decided to overthrow the kingdom. But I'm glad that in the text, you ran, you only had a short reign. You had a very short reign. And, uh, <laughs> you had a very short reign. And it ran out when the bullets ran out. And you know what? These great gifts were made <laughs> by Lucy. Oh, no. <laughs> I gotta help you guys. Need that as an emote? Yeah, we need. <laughs> no. All right. I don't think I have another one in me. That was a long game. I don't think I have another one of these in me. <sighs> good place to end. I think so too. I think that's a good place to end for that as well. Oh man. Let me unactivate that game. But yeah, if you guys like that game. Uh, that is a game we play every now and then. I always think it's a fun game. Boom, 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 ba -dum, boom. That's such a good game too. I hope they do more with it. I like that it's like always changing too. Like some of the dialogue is similar when we start up new games and whatnot. But like every time we've played it, even when you like so so for those of you that was your first game, when you win the game, your character dies of old age and your your kid takes over for you, and then you can continue as the kid. Um and so it's really good. So like it's there's always new dialogue and new scenarios. You got a drop? Oh hell yeah. Yeah, there are drops in this game too. Fun fact. I feel like the King story is always kind of the same. It would be cool to see that change up too. It does have some similarities. It does have some similarities for sure. I was seeing what people were playing and what I wanted to play. I feel like the key, uh, 
You couldn't choose your objective before, I think. You could vote on your objective, but I think last time it was a little different because we continued the game. And when you continue games and go into like next king reigns, uh, all the stats and money stay the same. So it might have been like a similar goal or something like that. Might have been a similar goal like that. Uh, honestly, I think that might be a good place to just end for the day. About like a six hour stream, pretty solid. Not our normal long streams, but uh, I'm pretty satisfied with that. It's a, it's honestly a beautiful day outside and I kind of want to go uh, enjoy it. So I think that's what I'm going to do. So we're going to end right here. There will be a stream tomorrow and uh, we will start off with Bryce until reset. We will do Neil, and we're going to FTO, Trixie, a.k.a. Sewer Goblins Cop. And then afterwards, we're either going to play to Jasper or Roland. Probably, ro I don't know. We'll see how I'm feeling. We'll see how I'm feeling. Um, yes, it finally stopped raining. And it's so, it's so nice outside. It's so nice outside. Let me see who's streaming right now, and I want to send you guys over to somebody. I'll probably send you guys back into GTA world. Uh, let's raid flow. Occam's rainbow. I want to raid someone that I accidentally stopped the music. I want to raid someone that, uh, could benefit from the viewers. And that deserves more viewers. So we're going to raid Flo McNasty. And I'm going to get out of here. I will see you guys tomorrow. Bright and early, 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. We're actually on time tomorrow. So see you then. Goodbye. <laughs>